And hello, everybody. It's Anthony and the net. Hi. Look what she looks like. It's her. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> hello. How is Happy everybody Sunday, doing? everyone. How was everyone Hi, doing? Hi, Emily. Welcome in. Welcome in. We are doing well. I'm getting Emily, started. We have a doing? lot to get to. Hi, Hala. Hi, Emily. Alicia. Alicia, nice to see you. Alicia, it's Sheila, good to see Dwayne, you. Sheila, Dwayne, how you Dwayne. doing? Hi, RG. Sheila and Dwayne. Oh, RG, Dwayne. that cookie looks great RG, next to you. Looking good. How's everyone Sheila doing? Sheila and Dwayne. Dwayne, the latest winner Hi, of the Lisa, award. Hi, Lisa. My cousin's here. Lisa, how Apartment you doing? Apartment owner. Hi, Lisa. Hi, Dave. Hi, Irma. How are you? I good evening. Hi, Lisa. Dave. Dave, Both how Dave. are you? Dave's Dave, in Bangor, Maine. Double, Dave, we Jeffrey. got double D Dave action. We've got Dave in Bangor and Dave in Niagara Falls. That's right. And Dave in Niagara Falls, congratulations Michelle on your Westbrook. 600 subscriber. That's amazing. Dave, congratulations. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Michelle Greg Westbrook. B. Hi, Long Maureen. Time no see. Michelle, how you doing? And Hi, Marilyn. Marilyn. Hope Marilyn everyone is Perlman having a lovely warm house. evening. Too warm. I'm hot. This is one of my uh, gifts from Anthony. That's one of the gifts from Anthony. <laughs> That's my, what I just said. My new fan. I have the Sheila fan. fan. Ah. It has two speeds. <coughs> Hi, Timothy. Leela, how Hi, you Leela. Doing? Adriana. Hi, how Adriana. Are you? Do you guys do, do you this guys every, every Sunday? Sunday? No. Not every Sunday. We actually don't have any real don't have a schedule. Um, schedule except first of the month. That's it. Hi, except Ronnie. For the C. First of the month. So every first of the month, we sing happy birthday to all the birthdays of that month. And we do something nuts. Of the month. And we do something nuts. I wish that at apartment true. owner. Why? You guys I like wish. Sunday nights? You do? You wish? Hi, we'll Carol. How are do you doing? You. I was like the little, like, I what? know it's good enough because I could see it down there. But doesn't it seem like that's almost like low? Oh, my God, Anthony. Be grateful for what you've got. Look, it's going well, down. Well, refresh How it. could it possibly refresh be going down? It. Oh my god. Sorry about that. Anthony, please. It's fine. You guys can see know. us, right? Yeah, we As I'm always, sure we don't fine. be embarrassed to say we're you know buffering don't be or you can't see. To say it. We're buffering. We probably just say we can't see you or there's a problem. Please let us know. Alright, that hurt me. You don't have to repeat that. <laughs> Alright, who is not say hello to Aunt? Joan Fitz and I am waiting How you for doing? Finnish actress Alma Poitsy goes in Golden Globe. Golden Globes are tonight? Oh, I didn't realize that. How do you like your new Is laptop? It the Golden Globe Anthony night? didn't I, I'm use not, it that much, but he I likes haven't it, used right? it that much. Hi, I Joan. Do like it. How are you, Joan? It's very nice. Yes. Who is that? Uh, Irma, I believe. Irma? Was it Irma? No, I'm so no. sorry. Let me make sure. Yeah, it was Irma. It, no, it was no, Timothy. No, it was Timothy. Uh, Hi, Daryl. I like it. You guys are funny. Daryl Hi, Brian Mohammed. How are you? Hi, Sharon. Thank you, Sharon. She says, we look good and sound good. Still battling COVID. Oh, no, Karen. Oh, man. Okay, Jack, I'm so sorry to That's hear that. That's not great. How do you guys survive the big, not so big New York snowstorm? It Give was, me a break, yeah, Holla. You live it. here in New we York. We managed it. Holla. Give me a break. <laughs> we managed like to make it. these YouTubers who put the fake snow in the back and make a big thumbnail? Come on. We could have went out also. You know, we could have went out also and drove around or, I That's don't know, walked with a flake skiing. hitting me. It's just stupid. I, I can't. I can't. Dawn, that COVID feel better. Yeah, right, Adriana? <laughs> That's me cross-country You guys skiing. are so nice. How like you're all, you're all telling her to feel better. That's really yes, good. Yes, Kay Jack. Thank you, Emily. Feel better. Feel James better. and Colin Hudson, too. Have made it to four. Yep, we uh, we do follow them. So, yes, we know we that. Do, Thank you for uh, letting us know. Anyway, I just put this. Thank you. Down there. Okay, so let's get Are to it. Cool we have a lot to talk about. Did you cool off the net? Here is one of the off. things that I got, Anthony. Well, we both got for Christmas and never opened it. It's the original cake company since Fruit 1972 cake. fruit cake now this i could throw i could <laughs> use it as a snowball football. we could be playing at the Patrick, buffalo bills because it's so it's that dense so it's lisa like very, do you like um heavy. do you like fruit cakes lisa all right let me open it up <laughs> wait a minute hi patrick how are you anthony is a snow boss i don't know what I, that means I, I, and the flake flood and the <laughs> thumbnail oh look at that shirt, look at dave way. Yeah, they know. They saw. Uh, they saw it before oh, yeah, you. Yeah, wrapped it. Godzilla versus. Mm, that smells good, actually. 
Mm, smells nice and uh, anyway, Anthony, nice and fruit cakey. Anthony, um, what was I gonna say? And you look, so look, hard about Mona look Lisa. what Dave Jeffrey said. And the fake flood in the thumbnail. And the fake fl flood. The fake flood was actually. Come on. I personally think the fake flood. It makes was. us We kind of know we who laugh. we're talking about. Yeah, we know. But the fake flood in the thumbnail oh was God. the best of all, actually. All right, let's see. There what have this been is. real I floods. I like the fruit cake my mom used to make because it made it with cake mix. I didn't know your mother made it. I know your father likes um, fruitcake, but I didn't know your mother made it. Jeez, yeah, I, I don't remember that. that. And even as a kid, I don't remember that. You got to tell me more about that. Do you have a recipe? And, and, Did you uh, ever make it? I'm glad you got your package. You laughed so hard about the Mona Lisa. Oh, you mean the card? Wait a minute. Let me see. M.M. got her package in the mail. Oh, great. She likes the bag. Wonderful. That's Marade. Thank you. Uh, we're so glad you got that. Yeah, this is what she's talking about. This is from... Yeah, the card. She Look, likes the card. This is from uh, Monica from Choppy. from Choppy. Look at that. I didn't see the face so much at first. I saw the cup and I was like, wait a minute. Look at her. <laughs> Isn't that funny? Mona Lisa and her red cup. She was out partying. Hey, Jeremy. How Jeremy are you? Jeremy Lynn. How you doing? Yeah, it does. It smells uh, cake fruity. Fruitery. Fruit it's cakery, fruit cakery. Right? It's fruit cake. Oh, you don't have the recipe. Company. Oh, boy. Ali from Iraq. How you doing, Ali? All right, well, I'm going to cut it, Aunt, because you're you the one who Ali likes fruit cake. House? I don't really care for it. Holy smoke, that thing's hard to cut through. <laughs> All right. She just, she needed to get out the cleaver. I'm going to give Christian you... Christian Hansen, how you doing? Look at that, guys. Is that... Look at that. Uh, it's dark. Neck when she wakes up in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> no, I look much worse than that. She's I even more good. disheveled. All right, I'm going to try first. I'm going to try the tiniest. Look, see, I can feel the She's fruit. even more disheveled, Christian. You have no idea. <laughs> like, this is how get, much I'm going to try. You gotta get up. a little didn't bit. It? you got to get up. Chicago, Illinois is expected to get no, thank up you. to six to seven inches of snow this week. That's not wacky oh for God, Chicago. That's terrible, though. Is that... Is and the you, fruit you, cake terrible or is no, the, the, the snow that terrible? No, the snow storm. Six to seven so, inches. Anthony, go That's ahead and, you know, Chicago. if you want, you, can, you don't have to use the fork. Here, look. Look at this. The top comes right off. Fork, what stuff. the heck? This is just uh, pure see. sugar. Is it old? No, fruit cake. This fruit cake goes till 2025. It, fruit cake lasts forever. That's the whole point. Didn't they make it years ago and they put it away and they took it out like a year later? I don't know. Oh, a fruit cake emoji! Thank you, Karen, for suggesting that. Suggesting that because Anthony's kind of Anthony's kind of trying to figure out what to do. Hi, James. I Hi, gotta make a new one for all videos. Time. James, videos. how you how doing? doing? Oh, you're welcome, Irma. Oh, Blue Star got her package too. Thank you. You're welcome. We have a rough week too. It was so terribly cold. Oh my God, Irma. This thing is. Dense. Irma, what do you want to share where you are again so everybody knows? It's like chewing on steak. Do you like it or you don't like it? Maybe it'd be better cold. It's or... okay. It's just okay and not crazy one more? <laughs> no. Okay, so we're going to try some other stuff. Wait. We're going to get the trying the stuff out of the way and then we're going to get right to it. Well, Irma's in Finland. I'm assuming... I wanted her to tell everyone, but that okay. that's okay. A fruitcake emoji would be I'm nice. I'm assuming it might be a little snowy. You lost me. What do you mean? You can't see us anymore? Hi, Are we Beach on, Bum. Guys? Do you guys see us? Oh, it gets better with age. Do you think, Marilyn, that I should put it in the refrigerator? Wait, let me just refresh because it's down to 2,000. That's not bad, but let me just do this. Hello, crazy kids. <laughs> I'm, t I'm telling you something. Lisa, a can you odd see? Hi, Joseph. How are you? If anybody can't see us, you are fine, says Mary. I mean, okay, this looks fine. Oh, wait, why is it stuck now? Oh, there we go. All right, so listen. Another thing that Choppy gave us is right from, uh, it's a Dutch original, right from Amsterdam. We're going to open it up right now. A Dutch original. Oh, okay, Dutch thanks, Masters. Lisa. Oh, good, Joseph. Oh, hi, Virginia. Happy Virginia, Sunday. how you doing? Happy Sunday. How's Again. it going? Okay, here it is. Eight C teacher. Look at this. Ooh, look how fancy. Look at that. It's in like a bag. Oh, there's two of them. Oops, I'm sorry. Actually, look, do you want to open it in while I tell them what this is? Look at this. Look at that. Look at that picture. Dutch so it masters. Says, 
It's Hein and Ver. Hein and Ver means near and far. The name pays homage to the Dutch culinary tradition of combining the best ingredients worldwide with quality local produce. We use slow food technique to develop the full potential of grand cru cow, cacao and to express its natural rich, richness and flavor. How fancy that Our is. Our chocolate does not contain artificial colors, flavors, or preservatives. A variety of in-house developed techniques is used to craft the unique hide and fair chocolate. The cocoa bean beans of one single farmer are hand selected and roasted in multiple ways to bring out as many flavors as possible. Furthermore, some of our chocolate is aged for up to two years to achieve flavor perfection. We only use traceable ingredients and exclusive work with trusted single estate farms and cooperatives. LAB wow. says she's part Dutch. Ooh. This is very tasty. Do you mm, like it? I do. Oh, wow. Did you see it? Look what it looks like. I showed it. Oh, okay. Sorry. I'm a little behind. Hi, Marisol. Right. Mm, you're right behind. Thank you, Marisol. You're the best, Marisol. Yes, Joseph's birthday is on Wednesday. I'm going to taste it now. Three more days, he'll be the big mm. seven four. Wow, that's really good, Ed. Mmm. Wow, that's really, really good. That's like a cut of It bump. is very good. That is no hurry Hershey's. Is also, is, is also part Dutch. Ooh, that's nice. All right. Oh, that's really rich. Mm. Now, you guys know... Wow, that's really this is great. very good chocolate. <laughs> well, we, it's a little bitter. Hi, Maria G. It does look delicious, doesn't it? I saw on my calendar that Anthony's birthday is coming up. Yes, January 21st. Tomorrow is Pam's birthday, the 8th. Today is the 7th, right? Yeah. Anyway, so you guys know that uh, Viv sent this, right, Anthony? Yes, Viv Vivian sent, Mavros. sent us a... A package all the way from Australia. From Australia, you saw it on the on the community page a while back before Christmas, and also on a um. What well, we saved a these members because, only video, right? Because we want to try some of the things that that was sent from her. So I think we'll we try do. two things, and then the other things we'll do on another live stream. What do you think, Aunt? Sounds like a great idea. And then we'll come back to it because it's a gift that just keeps on giving. Huh? <laughs> what is that? Hi, Katie. How are you? Hi, guys. Just one went to the mailbox. I received my gift. Thank you. I truly appreciate it. You're welcome. Oh, Those are all the people all the who got their things roll that they won. I'm appreciating that. All right. Look at this. I thought there was two in here, but it's a double bar. It's a tam-tam. It's a tam-tam, guys. We wanted to try a little tam-tam action. Mmm. There. There's another one. I'll just give you the other one. It's a tam tam. Oh, that's so good. Nick man. Johnson with two N's. Hi, Nick. Did you ever have this How before? You doing? A tam tam? I've no, seen I it. have never had a tam tam. Wow, I, I this is delicious. A tam tam. A tam tam. This is almost a like a Kit Kat, but a little more milk chocolatey. Oh, that's really good. Mmm. Let's see. Definitely. Oh, this is really good, Aunt. Made with irresistible real chocolate. Liz and Adele, how you doing? And Happy New Year Hi, to Liz. you, Liz. And Pam Johnson has joined us. How's everybody doing? So, we're going to have a little show and tell. Marilyn says they are the best. Oh, oh, they're really good, Marilyn. Oh, that's so good, Aunt. This is pretty darn good. I think we can get these at Reindu. Arnold's Tim Tam. I think they come in different flavors, so. Alan, how you doing? Hi, Alan. How are you? HC is about to be right back and get some chocolate. Okay, here's another that one. That sounds like a very good and idea. And thank HC. you so much because we love it. We love this box. You have no idea. Okay, now this. Oh, look how cute, and It's a koala. Oh, I love that. And smile. Don't ask me why we do it. <laughs> Say hi to Steve. Steven, are you in here? Are you watching? Hi, Steven. Mwah. Steve. <laughs> Steve. Mmm. <laughs> taste that. Ah, they will taste it. Oh, my God. All the goodies everybody sent us. It's a chocolate koala. Mm. Viv, wherever mm. you are, if you're watching, watching it now or that later on the replay, 
Thanks for the koala. And of course, my keychain. I have not switched it over yet, but I will. I love this keychain that came in the box. Oh, that's cute. I forgot. Yeah, you. no, but, I didn't uh, forget. Really good, I love cute. this box. This Bits of Australia. That's what it's called. Bits of Australia. Okay, now I'm putting this back in. There's other things in here. Look, but I don't know if you can eat all of this. Come on, we got cookies and more chocolates. We'll save it for next time. Is that all right? Yeah. Okay. If you want more, here's uh, more Monica's right here. All right, anyway, we have a little show and tell, and Anthony's got his stories to tell. Let's see, am I missing anything? Um, I'm great. I was with my nephew. He's back in New York. I'm a very happy uncle. That's great, Alan. Good news. Hi, Nick. How are you? It's always good to uh, spend some time with family, you know? Um, all right, so what should we talk about first, Anthony? Do you want, you are done eating? Be done, be done eating toys? so I can put this away. I'm going to show way. some stuff. And Anthony, just put this over here. And Anthony is going to tell stories. But before we do that, Joseph Taylor wants to know if there's any jellyfish in there. Hell Not no. Not any jellyfish. <laughs> Look how clear it is, and yet it says that the signal is so low. But that can't be possible. Don't obsess. I think there's something wrong with Don't the Don't obsess. App. Okay, I think so the app's a little let's low. get to the let's get to this. Okay. Let's get to this first. All right. We did the we did all the uh why are you laughing? Because I know laughing? I'm laughing because I know what she's taken out. Listen, Hope they you already had a great saw Christmas it. and New Year, Liz Nadell says. That, thank you very much. We did. Hi, Patricia we did. Cruz. We, we did. did. We had a blast. Liz. Let me throw this out and I'll be right back. Patricia Cruz. You hey, how you doing, Patricia? You want some wine and cream soda? Um, you want? Do you want to? I don't. Do you want to? No, um, I feel bad to make you open it up. I'll open it. You want it? Yeah, can I have some? I feel like I'm going to do the good old wine, hearty burgundy, and... Cream soda. Yeah, show them. A and W. Show them this. We still have plenty of Gallo Hardy Burgundy, by the way. Just <laughs> Gallo family Hardy Burgundy. We still got plenty of it. And then that's going to break out the. Uh... Don't you dare. And that's going to break out the cream soda. We have over here, the net and any jellyfish. We got uh, Ellen over here. We got 60 people in the chat. Thanks for joining us tonight, folks. 61 people. I'm going to give the usual commercial. Just remember to give this video a thumbs up. Share it. Like it. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Throw it out to your family members. Enjoy and come along and have a good time. We figured we'd, uh, we'd do a little Sunday night get together. If anyone is uh, not having a hangout, let's have a hangout. Hey, Anthony, since Lisa's in there. I'm going to tell some stories. Since Lisa's in there, just tell everybody that uh, that Lisa is our cousin that went to uh, Wohop with us. Lisa, and that, yes. And tell them about that spot. Don't tell them where it is, but tell them about that spot. Oh, that's actually sidebar. Here we go. It's the first sidebar in the evening. <clears throat> All right, so you get your cream soda, a nice long you get spoon. get the cream soda, the nice long spoon. And you just put some of this gallo. It has to be gallo, already burgundy. I already showed that it. like for three or four I'm times. I'm sorry. <laughs> go ahead, tell your story while I do this. Kiana Maria, how you Hi, doing? Hi, Kiana. Finish movie, uh, Dead Leaves Doesn't, uh, Dead Leaves Doesn't Win. Mm, All right. Smells uh, good. Yeah, you didn't tell let's the story. See. So this is a sidebar, actually. Remember to first smash off, the but thank you, Virginia. First off, yes, Lisa, who is apartment Is owner, it a twist cap or corked bottle? Of that's wine? a twist cap in the case of this big yeah. bottle. And here it's it is. It's kind of weird because the gallon that's that the smaller color. bottle is the corked bottle. We, but this yes. one is the twist cap. Get, go to the bottom. Now, mind you, we never wanted to buy this size. We just can't and find it. You can never it. get this particular wine in a normal size They have a bottle. bigger one, even. Let me taste it. This is for, like, serving your whole table of Italian oh, so gavones, essentially. And so now with gavones? Cheers, guys. All right, tell your story. 
So Lisa is an uh, apartment owner, is Lisa, Danette's cousin. Now that video that we did or the, the short we did and the photos from Instagram, which is very big on Instagram, much bigger than it is on YouTube, of our dinner at Wohop, we went to Wohop with uh, Lisa, who's uh, uh, when she was in, in New York. So we had wo a dinner at Wohop and Danette and I have been back to that neighborhood a few times not since Wohop. then. Not to Wohop, really. Not to Wohop. We went to Wohop next door. We went to another Chinese restaurant across the street. We went to another Chinese uh, restaurant in the na uh, place in the neighborhood. Not places when we were like live on camera. We went off camera. We also went down to that neighborhood <clears throat> when we had to pick up the press passes. Remember? Right. Remember the good old press passes? Hi, Melanie. What is that drink? It's cream soda, cream soda and, and Gallo Burgundy Hardy Bur wine. Gallo Hardy Burgundy. We Hardy tried Burgundy. the other ha Hardy Burgundies. They're not as good. It's got to be Gallo. I don't like the Rossi. <clears throat> Southern Belle Hi, Originals. Southern Belle. Just How saw are you? you guys on. Thank you very much for seeing us on. And thank you people. very much for joining us. We got Go 72 up there. So this is what happened. So like, well, like when we got the good old press passes, that was another time we were in that neighborhood. It, like Chinatown, very close to where you go to pick up the press passes. So this is what it is. Keep this under your hats. We drove down there, and as you might imagine, Emily, how you doing? Hi, Emily. As you doing? might imagine, it ain't easy to find a parking spot around. I don't know there. why you're whispering, but okay. It's because this is a secret. This is a secret. We're, we're, we're secretizing. We're doing secretive things here. If you see us go up, look at the signal is so damn low, and yet it doesn't make any Hold difference. On, look me... at the screen. Hold on. Look at. No, I want you to look at the I screen. I did. I it, saw it your screen. It doesn't look any different. Anthony, I think this is it's this, your phone. this is off. Oh, maybe it's this. Um, yeah, maybe. Whatever. Tell I don't the know. story because this is taking really too care. long. This is taking too long. I don't think it really means anything. So then stop. I think worrying we're gonna have it. to not go by that in the uh, today. Anyway. So, like, as you could imagine, this is a sidebar. As you could imagine, it's kind of hard to find. It tastes a delicious, spot Sharon. <laughs> so parking spots down there are like tough to come by. So, like, we driving around, and this first time we went there, a long time oh, ago, hi, in Sammy. the summertime, it was the height <laughs> of summer, and it was ro it was roasting out. And so, like, we're looking around for parking space. This is not the time we were there with Lisa. It was after that, and we're looking around to find a place to put the car. Thank you, Patrick. And we found what we now have referred to as the spot. Yeah, like, they keep are Keep it tight. under You're your right. hat. Because, yeah, because they're going to change it. Because it sounds like it's a secret. I don't know what's going on. Something's not kosher about it. There's a lot of that things. That is not going to work. The one that stands up is, is Never the mind, shielders. go. No, but you have to hold not, shielders. It doesn't seem kosher. This it's, parking there's a lot spot. Of things there's in Chinatown a, there's that don't one seem street. Kosher. There's this one street in Chinatown where the signs don't seem to match up to the behavior. It says it's a loading area for trucks, but there's no nothing nearby that you could bring anything in with a truck. It's like as if they no, tore down a warehouse. Like, it's like someone's yard. It's like somebody's backyard. There's nothing you could. There's that, no that loading truck, dock. What does the truck go up? Uh, that a not, load, like in a loading no, dock. No, not a there's sidewalk. No ramp. Ramp. That's there's no, there's ramp. no ramp. There's no ramp. There's no driveway. It's a yard. There's there's a yard with a gate. But it's a, and there's no driveway. There's no way you could drive Vian, into it. How are you? It's a wall. <laughs> Vian Chung, how you doing? It's a war. Right, exactly, Emily. It's it doesn't backyard. make sense. And it says that you would load something like and you, all the cops you would, like, parked there, like deliveries. All the cops. So, all the cops. so at first we thought no loading it's just cops. But it says like you had dock. to be a cop and park there. But but then it said then you look and you see not everybody parked there is a cop. But most people drive by and, and they keep scared. driving because the sign says you loading can't park yeah. there. The sign says you can't park, but everybody's parked there up to a certain point. So Hi, like Jack, Danette and you? I, Johnny on the spot. We 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 went. That's good, Vian. Hi, Major. Try it. Or should we just park? 
And it was like, we were getting we desperate. Get it. We go in like why. this. We were desperate. We're so going to we get said, a ticket. Oh, we're going to get a ticket. The police are like walking by. They're standing on the corner. It was basically. I don't remember like the name of the street. Police Lisa. were swirling Hi, around Hernandez. like this. How are you? you know, like, you like fish in an aquarium. They were swirling and circling. And I was like, one of these cops is going to give us a ticket. All right. Uh oh, Emily they're like says standing she got right a there. ticket. They're leaning against the. They're leaning against cars. They're looking around, but they're not handing out any tickets at all. It's like it's it's a secret, guys. It's a secret. I don't know. Well, we've parked You're there. You're not supposed to park there. We've parked there now. Almost but you can park three times. Two but times. you can apparently you can park. You there. can park there. I don't know why, but there's a reason. All right, this looks like a jock strap, Anthony. Come on. Anyway, so I gave Danette a job strap. Meanwhile, when we left the uh, the when we left the listen to this, we left the um, Joe Hernandez. How you doing? Welcome to the chat. Thank Anthony, you. tell them how we got a ticket after we left the the uh, merchant house. Oh, when we left the merchant house, we got a ticket. We went the wrong way we back to the car because we were bullshit. You know what? Yeah, because and we were freaking two minutes and, late. I saw the and a half. We got a Ugh. ticket because. We got the ticket purely because we went the wrong, we went way, the wrong way to walk back. Talking we about talking. how we didn't get a we didn't get a signal. Blah, 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 blah. You know, blah, 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 blah. And you're, you're like, wait a minute. Your arms in the air, like you just don't. No, care. only we do you're that. You're walking no, around it's... and you're going like this. The net, uh, uh, <laughs> I'm walking, and it kept walking. And the net stuck. Liberty Tree, how Hi, you Liberty doing? Tree. We live I'm in waving Queens. my arms, and the net goes like this. Aren't we working really far? Yeah, it's a lot longer this is, than I remember. It seems so much longer to get back and to the And then we're in, we're in the But then park. when we first went Where's to the, the place, and I'm going like that, no, it just looks different because we're going in a different direction. Duh. Because I'm always trying to figure out a reason that I'm not wrong. <laughs> like, we're right. going, and then we're passing, so we're like, in freaking Washington we're passing Square like, park. you know, Washington Square Park, I'm like, and I'm going, the park before. Something, something seems off. I don't remember seeing a car. A park or a big archway. <laughs> I don't remember seeing watching. All right, get arch. to the point. So we get back to the car. So we we're like, oh my god, we gotta walk back. And then we saw so like it took us twice as long to get to the car. And we see a guy off in the distance, and there he is, writing the ticket. You know, he's doing. And he the, said, you know, I'm sorry, I can't do nothing about it. I'm sorry, I already started writing the yeah. ticket. And then, so he didn't actually write it anymore. It's a machine, you know, it's digital. But what gotta, happened it was... It looks better for me to go like this. You can put it on here if you're worried for the about guy it. To go, than to go like this. Anyway, no, it's no big deal. I'm just telling the story because what happened was he told us, it's okay, just buy another ticket and then you can say you were getting the ticket. I didn't see you. He was really, really nice, this guy. It was very Police nice. Police officer said, just send it in. Let them see. It's only about a minute or two later. And that's it. You can just disregard it. So we're like, oh, okay. What are you, tourists? Yeah, it was like yes! we were tourists. We're stupid. I have Geniuses no clue like ourselves how that are silly. I have never. You have I no clue, and you. I have no clue. We were I so have... stupid talking about the dumb signal. Nobody I... else has a signal problem, and I'm. You know what? I will tell you. Treadwell. Right now. Treadwell. The thing. I have never had that happen to me in my life where I overshot where I was supposed to turn at a corner. Yeah, let me And that's what that. happened. Look at you, you're disheveled today. Happen. What is going on? I'm anyway. I look great. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so I, I sent the ticket in and Major they Minnie, said. How you doing, Jack? I sent it in and I, told, I wrote this letter or whatever. And they said, no, 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 no. If you don't pay your ticket within the next three days. We're going to add $10 to your ticket. So I was like, oh, that's it. And I wrote out my ticket and mailed it in. Whatever. I'm like, kiss my behind. It was worth it. It was worth it. It doesn't matter. All right. So this is what I want to show you. This is what I have. See? Lisa this is says what... I do. I said I look fantastic. And Wait, Lisa let me, said let I me use him as this the... Is, I'm going to use Anthony this as is the, the guinea pig. This is the original headlamp. Right? This is what I use. Now, I want to show you. Without... Actually, it's on... No, it's on right. Okay, so this is what I bought. It's like an Energizer Danette Ever Ready. Yeah. Uh, and it's great. For because herself. if you want to look at, say, your nails or the cat's nails or you want to look at your jewelry, all you have to do is press this button. It's going to get blinding, so I'll go quick. Press this button. Where's the button? Well, I can't do it because you're... Okay, hold on. Let me make it go down. Put your hands down. I'll do it this way, so this way... She can't even press So look, the you see it's red. 
That's for like when you're in the dark, which I love. And then there's this one where you press it a second time. I don't know why I can't press it, but I, I, it's your head. <laughs> All right. I don't know why it won't work now. What the hell happened to this, Aunt? It worked before. Uh, I guess I have to Does, change the battery. Uh, I got to change the battery. I don't know why it's not working. It has a white light and a red light. This is light, the white light. Obviously, that's the white light. Is, is obviously. Oh, it's on. That's why they can't see it because it's not. It's not as bright as what I'm going to. It's see. not that bright. It is on, but anyway. So I thought the net. He thought I didn't have it anymore. It's going to charge in yes. his brain. Yes, it is, yes. Patrick. <laughs> Southern Bell feels bought was sad, sad for you. Wait a minute. So he buys this for me for Christmas, right? Where am I going with this? This is the battery. This is the battery pack. I showed you this the other day, right? That's the Look, battery pack. It looks headlight. like an old camera. This is a head like this is this is bigger than this whole this whole part here. This is the battery pack, right? That's just the battery. Here's the front. Okay, well, are you ready? Where am I going with this? It's a good one. Where with am this I going then... with this? It's supposed to be like like this, I think. And it's supposed exactly, to Exactly, like, Southern Belle. Where am I going? Hi, I Sally. I think you're supposed to put it over your head like this, and then you... <laughs> I don't know what it is. That is not how it works. You're a Jew. I think it's like that. That is not how it works. You look like the guy from the... You look like Jacob Marley. <laughs> oh, Jacob Marley. Welcome aboard. Where am I going with this? Where am I going with this? That's in case there's a cave. There's a there's a. Now do you think I should? That's keep in it? case the, uh, in case there's How a. How do you close it in. off? Oh then my god! Oh my god! Oh yeah! Got also, to do that. Watch out! Don't get an epileptic fit, people. <laughs> Pam, Pam Johnson, where am I going with this, guys? <laughs> That's in case there's a Look sudden the cave in. Stephen, are you still here? Do you see what I gotta live with? Look at my normal size one. Look at this one. Where am I going? Am I going into a mine? Where am I going? That's in case there's a cave in. Hi, Karina. How you doing? If like there's a building collapse and I, I mean, have to seriously. find you. Put it on the top of the car, said something. Mining. Like, you should have yes. had that when the ticket was being written. You could you know have blinded you do with the that? knee to me. You know what you do that? You put that on the top of the car when you want them to think you're a cop and you want to get through traffic. What word? You mean juice? I don't even know what it means. I don't know where it came from. I just said, because he looked like a juice. Juice. What does it mean? I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> spelunking? Hi, Keith. How are you? Yes, when I'm spelunking, right. So one Keith. more thing I want to I show I thought you. the net was going to start a new career of cave, of cave uh, <laughs> exploration. I know I had... I will be... I have to admit, it is, but it's much stronger say, than the other, but what fair, am I going to do with it? To be fair to me, I really someone. had an idea. It was much smaller than it. I mean, is. you know what this is good for? Like, if you're going... If you're doing, like... Um, Walking through a forest? No, like, if you're doing... Night? No, like if you're doing like uh, gardening and it's starting to get dark or... Why are we gardening at night? Because maybe it's summertime and it's starting to get dark. It's 8 there. You got like two more bulbs to put in the in the ground. I, I don't see know. that one last worm. Power outage. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, there's power outages. I think Southern Bell had the idea. You put it on top of the car and you masquerade as a cop to get through traffic. And okay, I like so... go out of the window and I go... Ooh, All right, I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you a few things, and then I'm going to shut up and do and it. That's gonna show and then things. Anthony's going to tell you the sidebars. Okay, so this is something that's near and dear to my heart. Uh, some dig some tunnels. <laughs> Patrick. Oh, my God. Maybe if I get it a little bit it's closer. Gonna dig Hold some on. tunnels. All right. Let's get it a little closer for a second so I could show you. So this is a bracelet that one year my mother... Uh, got made up for me when we were on vacation. We went on a two week vacation to um, the first place we went to, which was Cooperstown to the Baseball Hall of Fame. And if you could see that, it is a little man. You could see it's a little brownish. It's like a little man. Um, it's a, a charm bracelet, right? So there's a little man and the little, um, it's a little, what is that called, Anthony? That you, a baseball bat? No, this. That, well, he's holding a bat. He's like batting up. And then there's this. That's okay, like. He's got a dog. What is this? <laughs> a knife? Well, I don't know. What? I can't see it. Your hand's in the way. Why are you a jerk? He's got a machete. Yeah, look. 
Is it a charm bracelet? What is that? You know, like a banner, like baseball. What is it a called? A pennant? Yeah, no, here it is. It says baseball hall of fame. It's a tag? No, this thing, you know, like when you do rah, rah, rah. Look, you guys see it, right? It's so small. I don't know what it's called. Anyway, so there's that. <laughs> so there, there is you that. You do? Carol calls her husband a chooch. It's an chooch. Italian thing. All right, so then we had a Westie at the time. And this is a, a so that's a, um, I, I don't know why I'm showing this because you can't see it. Anyway. I can see it. But I, they I can't. I don't know what it is this anyway. This is a um, uh, West a dog? Island dog. Uh -huh. Oh, this I got is, that one right. That was just a guess. <laughs> this is the Maid of the Mist, which is a which is the boat that goes on the... A boat? Anthony, come on! <laughs> the Maid of the Mist, which goes on the Niagara Falls in Buffalo. We went to... So all the places I'm mentioning is where we went. And my mother, like this one, she got the dog because that she had to fill that in. And she wanted to get me the dog because I loved our dogs. Then this over here is... Where is it? It's hard to show. That is a bunch of, um... <laughs> is that a man riding a horse? <laughs> Come on, I don't feel good. <laughs> Look, do you need the do you is need the light? Is it a man on a bull? Do you need a light? It's a baby and a mom uh, reindeer. Reindeers. Because that it's comes deers. from deers. Because that comes from New Hampshire. None of us can see anything. This is Bear Mountain. We're still so there's blinded a bear. by the light. <laughs> there's a bear. This is the Cog Railway on uh, uh, Mount Washington because we went up on the top of the mountain. Here's the Maid of the Mist. Maid no, this is, in the house. Hey, no, this maid. is the ship from... Okay, I told you that. This is the ship from Connecticut. We came back from Connecticut and that's from uh, Mystic Seaport. So these are the some of the places we went to. That's we also, how the Nets' parents came back from Connecticut. They <laughs> sailed back. No, so we went to all the way upstate to the to the uh, falls. Then we went to New Hampshire. Then we went back down through Connecticut or something like that. Anyway, the reason I showed that is because it's jewelry. I also have this other the piece of. parents used the. I don't remember ships. what this is called, but you see how it's tarnished. Then I have this, one of my favorite rings. I love this ring, but it's tarnished. Then I have this. This is an old ring. Not old. It's fairly new because I don't really use it that much. I don't wear it. And that's gold. What? I don't know. I don't know <laughs> what anybody is saying. Hi, Manny. I was trying to get ahead of Patrick, the think about it. And you and I inspired taking notes from Anthony. What? Inspi it's inspiring. Oh, my God. We do inspire people. Oh, my God. You guys make me die. I have lived in Niagara Falls my whole life and have never been on the Maid of the Mist. What? Hi, D. Michael. But but who said that's that? all right because we've never been to the Statue of Liberty. Either one of us, right? You've never yes. been there, right? Who said that? Which, um, which Carol. Uh, uh, Carol? You've, okay. never, you've never been on it. All right, That's like this. us. We've never been to the Statue now, of Liberty. You, We've you never guys. Been on the, we, we, no. I, 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 I was just about to say I've never been up the Empire State Building. But you have. That is a complete lie. I've been up the Here's a piece Empire of sterling. Here's sterling times. silver. Yeah. I think maybe I took this out maybe twice my whole life. This is from my communion. Holy communion. As a gift from, from someone. Holy and communion. Holy it's smoke. sterling silver. But this is my question to you. There has to be other people in here. Lisa, do you have any jewelry from your communion or confirmation or anything like that that you've never, ever worn? This is from my communion, 1973. Never wore it. Who Maybe the day of the communion the I wore. Manny said he's never Look been to Sheila the Statue said, of what? Liberty either. Manny's yeah, never well been that's, to the Statue of Liberty. It's because you live in New York. Is. You always forget about it. I can go someday. Yeah. Maybe are, we should go on a live say, stream. Over yeah. and over again. Oh, why See, to us? Because we've never been there. Yeah, when you're in New York, you know you're constantly going like this. Eh, I could go oh there Oh, my anytime. God, Southern Belle. Wait a minute. No way. You never passed? Or you never went on the, like, uh, tour? I've you never been 10 miles away from Graceland and you've no never been No freaking there? way. <laughs> All right, you got an assignment. We just, we're doing something new. This is what Danette does. She comes up with things. Hi, Jackie M. I love your doggy. How cute. Anyway, that's it now, Southern Belle. I love Bell. that. How your you doing, assignment, Jackie? we're going to make an assignment for different people. Let me back it up a little now so you get a little more vision. Back it up. Okay, that's it. Back it up. All right, listen, Southern Belle. Your assignment is to go 
To Gracie Mansion. Even Gracie if it's... Mansion. Go to the mayor's house here in New York. Your assignment, Go to Elvis. Get on a plane. Get your ass up here to New York. No. And get to Gracie Mansion. <laughs> Before it's too late. You've Mom. been wanting to go there your whole life. Go to Gracie Mansion and we'll go to Graceland. <laughs> Shut up! Grace. Cut the nonsense. Look at this. Does he need a Susan, haircut? Susan, cut on? the nonsense. Susan, you have to go to Gracie. Get up to Gracie Mansion. You've waited long enough. Uh, Manny, Patrick, don't take any tips from us. All right, wait, hold on. Hi, Joe. How are you? Joe Maliga in the oh house. Oh, my God. How are you doing, Joe? <laughs> oh, D. Michael. All right, wait. Let me back up. I'm sorry. I, re I said that wrong. <laughs> oh, no. Manny wants to get Patrick a charm bracelet now. Oh, oh, my God. That was too funny. All right, go to Graceland. Take a picture. Marilyn thinks it's overrated. <laughs> Don't bother. Hi, Dwayne. How are you? Go there, take Greetings a picture, from post, Alberta. Get, send it to us, we'll post it. Let's learn from Jeanette Dwayne, and Anthony. Uh, Dwayne from Alberta, Canada. Wait, she never Dwayne? wanted to see it. Well, that's a different story. Okay, I can understand that. You're not interested. You never You're not wanted interested. to see it. If but you never wanted to see it. If you want to, I'm going to make it your decision to Graceland. But if you want to, I want to give you the first assignment. You have the DNA assignment. We just made this up on the spot. Your assignment, Southern Belle, is to take a picture of Graceland that you're not interested in seeing because it's only 10 miles away. <laughs> take a picture and send it to us so we could then share it on our community page until we tell someone else that they need an assignment. All right? How does she need a fan? Hot. It's like 25 degrees Good out. night, Adriana. Adriana, good Thank night. Thank you, Adriana, very much. We appreciate it. I'll go take a picture just for you. She can't stand Graceland. Just for going you. Going to Graceland, Graceland, Tennessee. Memphis, going to Tennessee. Tennessee. Graceland. Yes. Yeah, do you like, uh, what's his name? Paul Simon. Paul Simon. <laughs> Uh, hi, uh, Waldo TV. I will definitely make it to the, the statue this year. The album Graceland is a great album. Waldo, do you live in New York? I need an assignment, Alan says. Alan, Alan you Alan. are too funny. Alan, you're too funny. Anyway, oh, wait, what is this? Oh, homework. Okay. Alan wants homework. <laughs> Alan's going to be the next one who's going to get an assignment. Nope. She said nope. All right, no. you don't have to do it. I'm not going to You don't have to go. All right, anyway... I wouldn't go to Graceland either, said Who said Sheila that? G. Sheila! Nobody wants to go there. Does anybody want to go to Graceland? Come on. What did Elvis ever do to you? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you're 10 miles oh, away. My goodness. What is that, 10 minutes? Is that 10, 10 minutes? miles is pretty close. Oh, it's Wild Bill in the house. Uh oh. Uh oh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> What did Joe Maliga say? Love the neighborhood around Carl Schurz Park. That's, the, oh, that's in yeah. Manhattan. That's a very nice park. All right, so I promise you, Wild Bill, that we'll go to the f circus fruit soon. But right now, here's, here's a taste I have of enough some fruit, fruit. So she I got can't some go fruit. shopping yet. She got some fruit at the non-circus stop and shop. Uh, by the way... There's no circus to... involved at the stop and shop. They don't have any clowns. Anthony doesn't want to do it, but I'm going to make him. Come on. Come on. Holland's here. Here's our here. second bag of circus fruit. So since the circus is in town, since the circus uh, let's is try cold. Gracie Mansion is across the I put it in right, the refrigerator. Yeah. You, know what park, you know what park is amazing? I want to go back there, and As soon as it starts to get warmer, yeah, yeah. I want to go back to the park in Long Island. That was amazing, that park. Beautiful. So many animals. The circus. What's the name of that park? Peanut. Do you remember? Do you remember that park that we went to with all the animals, the birds? And that's when you decided, decided you needed to get a new gimbal. Do you remember? What do you mean? The one in Long Island? Yeah, in Long Island. I, I don't know what that was I called. I forgot the name of it. Lake Winnipesaukee? No. Island. Wise ass. I got to go back and see. I missed some stuff. It's from the refrigerator. Oh, How I put in the refrigerator because you suggested it on Christmas Day. Ah, it's hot. See? I'm coming to get you, see? See what I'm saying, Ed? I'm coming to get you, see? 
That's how hard it is. All right, anyway. Keith Havens lives right by oh, the man, Molly Brown hard. summer house. Really? Five minutes away from the Molly Brown. She was Where unsinkable. Was <laughs> unsinkable. Uh, she was. Yeah, we did wrong. cheat. We ate, we jate, we jate already. We jade already earlier time. You remember that, Emily? But you don't remember the name? I'll have to go back and look. Think about it, Chad. You and I buying our groceries for so. dinner and stop and <laughs> All right. Let's see. Orange slices are the bomb. I have oranges in the fridge, too, uh, Wild Bill. They taste weird cold. I don't think I like it. There are no clowns there. <laughs> Yeah, you can buy. You can. I buy know you didn't suggest it, but that's what I thought you suggested. And when I went back, I knew circus you were talking about the crustables. Fruit. But I'm still gonna say it was you because you said crustables, and I thought you meant peanuts. And you know I make mistakes. Liz likes the circus peanut. Oh, Liz actually, Nadal. there it is. It's good. Candied orange you and me slices. Both, Liz. Southern Bell's uh, thing. I would go, I could go for a circus peanut. We have some oranges Sheila. too. We have some good oranges. In them. Sheila has here. a little bit of a sweet tooth. <laughs> she does. <laughs> I also got this. At, look, look at how horrible it looks. I'm showing you the bad jewelry that needs to be cleaned for a reason. This is actually from oh Tiffany's. Oh my gosh, now I realize why you had that thing there. This is from Tiffany's. Look how bad it is. I haven't worn it because it tarnished. How says he doesn't like circus peanuts? Did what? you get pickles out of your car? No. And the pickles, pickles is okay. Is, pickles is fine. Pickles is fine. It's very warm in our garage. One actually. more show and tell. And then one more hey, thing to show you. Hey, Sleep Music Therapy. How you Hi, doing, Sleep Music? Sleep music. Got that Julia Fitzpatrick the house. Thank you very much. All right, much. so does anybody else have... Well, I made it into a necklace because nobody really wore it at the time in the 80s. This is a um, charm bracelet. No, it's an ankle bracelet. An ankle bracelet, I mean. And, of course, it says Danette on one side, and one side it says Anthony. I'm going to go for, to hell for saying this, but uh, Patrick, Manny, would you like one of these? I take it back. I'm just joking. Which one of them is wearing it on his ankle? Anyway, so, you know, back in the 80s, late 80s, you would wear this as a necklace. Now, I would love to wear this because I love this. I think it's gorgeous, okay? That but, jewelry fits Patrick well, says me. But it's not in. So if I walk around with this, like my name, my name, Danette, ever Danette. Oh, yes, Danette, I would like one. It, actually, my mother has one, too. I have it. My mother's, it doesn't look as nice as this because it's, you know, it's old. But anyway. Lisa Love Blank Ankle Bracelets had like four all gone. Wait, why are they gone? What do you mean? Why are they gone? Did you lose them? Did Anthony also have one? Yes, I did. I had a matching one. No, you didn't. <laughs> yeah, I, I had a mood ring and I was, when I was a teen. I think we all did. <gasps> do you I remember when Annette you got, I think I, I think have it in my, no, it. I still have it. Do you realize when you got a moon ring when you were younger, you thought like who you were? Look at my moon ring. Look at my, my mood. mood ring. It's I'm blue. in the mood. It's pink. When well, you anyway. go, look at my mood. All right, so this is I'm what I'm going to do. Are you guys able to get circus peanuts and see this? No, I couldn't find it anywhere. No. Holla sent it to me. Holla, Holla was generous and mailed this to us. But at one point, like a month before... I they saw were them they at, were there. I saw them in a, in, they in were in stock and shop. They were in. They took them off the shelves. I don't know why. Is it everywhere. like Christina? Is it like maybe this should be one of our emojis? This bag, circus peanut bag. It's very circus colorful. Peanuts. I know you don't really like it though. Anyway, what needs a toe? Antloaf needs a toe ring. Yeah. Oh my I could god! Have a, like a, I could have a circus peanut. Uh, they could be a circus mm -hmm. peanut emoji. I gotta make another emoji, guys. That's What's right, your Liz. Opinion? It was cool circus back then. Circus peanuts. Uh, uh, you look for it too, Alan. Oh, I wish I saved that. Then I would have just on gave Amazon. It to you. Yes, circus peanuts. Should it's we have home remedy this one? On an emoji that says Keith. That's circus nice fruit. that you should say that because. Should we have a circus fruit emoji? I have many things to clean your jewelry. Keep talking. I'm just showing. The jewelry polishing cloth. Who votes for circus fruit as an emoji? The jewelry cleaner. Jewelry cleaner. Or one of my favorites. Here it comes, guys. Here it comes. A full-on machine to clean Anthony bought this for me years ago. Look, it almost looks brand new. Look at it. 
You go like this, you put water or it's got solution. A basket. And as a basket, you put your jewelry in here and you clean it. Owen Meyer is the big O in the house. And How not you doing? only this thing is this thing is amazing. Guys, if you need a gift to bring to give you a girls or anyone who wants to clean jewelry, get this. We have to make an Amazon store so we can just tell them to click on it. And this wasn't bought in Amazon, but because it was so long ago, it is a digital electronic cleaner. You could put watches in there, your glasses. Let me show you. You could put jewelry, glasses, watches, sunglasses, sunglasses waterproof, of course. Anything. Any kind of jewelry. What the electric, hell is that? Sir electric shaver heads, razor blades, dentures, combs, toothbrushes, pen heads, printer heads, seals, watch parts, ancient coins. Like you want your coins from 1902 to be polished. You put it in there. Ancient coins, badges, valves, machine nozzles. Ancient coins. Metal dishware. Like if you have any gold doubloons. All of those things. This is what comes with it. A gigantor tweezer. Look at this. Look at it. I love this thing. You put it in there. It only takes a few minutes. Tiana and then you, Maria you take has it the out. connoisseur jewelry cleaner. Yes, that's this one. The connoisseur. It comes in... Don't get the little pen one that you just go like that. Oh, it doesn't yeah. Johnny work. Azaria? You want to immerse it. Hi, Johnny. How you doing? Johnny from Brooklyn. We miss you, Johnny. So Joe Maliga votes for circus fruit or Mr. Softy emoji. Ooh. That was that's another oh, one. Oh, but that goes with the coffee. I uh, right? would go with the coffee. A Chinese that, slipper. We were gonna do that, but Chinese we can't slipper. get one. I can't that was get my a good first one. one I wanted to do. Here's another possibility. I was thinking of perhaps uh, an emoji that sa says, Hi, Owen. Ooh, fancy. Hi, Heather W. It's okay. How about Heather. a fancy emoji for when we're showing something fancy? A gift for Patrick, and too. And wash socks, Patrick <laughs> wants to know. Why are you guys so funny? Can't Patrick, man, socks. you live in New York City. Let's get together. You know Come what on. Say, say, I think I might have to wear the pens because I'll laugh my ass off. But can it Corey Apple? But can it Corey Apple? Or kitchen sink emoji. We have to get together Joe with them because they're too funny. Perhaps a kitchen sink emoji. All I wear is silver jewelry, but it's a pain to keep clean. It is. I love, I, I have this bag, which is what normally keeps the jewelry clean, but it didn't work. See? They're all like brown. Anyway, <clears throat> let me keep up to with what it says. Hold on. Next time we come to New York, I can bring all my tarnished jewelry for you to clean. Yes, bring yes, all you your can. tarnished I jewelry. Like doing Annette it. loves doing it. Happy she New Year to you too, uh, to you, Johnny. You should see Happy New Year, Oh, let me Johnny. show you what. Let me you show you something. Else. When Hi, she's Viv. Cleaning her engagement ring. Viv, have you seen? We tried you a little delicious we tried snack. Some chocolates. They're so delicious. Larry, I love the Tam Tam. Larry, the Tam Tam Hi, was Doug. delicious. <laughs> Doug, how you doing? We yes, bring all your tarnished jewelry to New York to when you're on your way to New York and then it'll clean it. Sidebar. Like, so, look at that. It says it's 534. Oh, but look at the screen. Don't take any chances. Look at the screen. Everybody sees You guys, everything. please tell us if it's buffering. Any one of you. I think this is off. Gilda, Maybe it is. That it's Me, not Patrick, reading correctly. Me, Patrick, Danette, and Anthony, Uncle Joey. Who's Uncle Joey? Who's, who mentioned that? Um, Manny. I said we all Uncle have to get Joey? together. Oh, you mean... Um, Uncle Joey? Wait. Uncle Joey... Uh, Hashtag uh, operator. Joey Brooklyn? What does that mean? Oh, Joey Brooklyn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll all go to Brooklyn. Why don't we do that? Then they see you get confused because then that happens. There's so Joey. many Joes in you know our lives. You know how many lives. Joes? We still have a lot of Joes. The Joey Joes Brooklyn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to meet him too. Joes are off the He's hook. so cool. How was the storm? You mean the two flakes that fell? I mean, the, yeah, the two Please. flakes. Hi, Wicked Twisted. Wicked Twisted, how you doing? doing? Hit the like button, guys. Hit Thank the you, like Joey. button, yes. Definitely. Joe Maliga, see, Joe I said Maliga. Joey. I'm sorry. Joe, Joey, no, Marilyn Joey. asked if it cleans Joey. teeth. Yes, actually, not real teeth. It says it cleans dentures. All right, here, I want to share something. We're going to get a little uh, a little semi-serious for a minute. We're going to get... ...or you use or whatever, right? My mother was that little comb I carry with me everywhere. And I use it. It's old. It really needs to be thrown out. But it was my mom's, and I carry it. This Joe is... Maliga says he's the only Joe in California. 
No, I don't think so. <laughs> I'm not no. sure of that. There's that other Joe, Ed. I don't. I, I know the Joe. You know Joe. Anyway, never mind that. So yeah, there's another Joe. Anyway, so listen. There's at least one you other doing? Joe. Hi, Walt. Can, well, can you show Munchkin? She, yeah, in a minute. She's sleeping on the bed, I think. So here's the thing that's from my father. Like right Roll till TV. right till the day he died. He always used this every single day. The eyepiece. And you say, why would he have an eyepiece like a jeweler? It's the jeweler's eye. Because when you hit a certain age, and he had he had cataracts and had the operations done, but and he had better sight. But still, you guys have no idea how great this is. I use it almost every single day. Get right? to the story, Joe Maliga. All right, right, I'm going to shut up in a minute. So you go like this, and you can look. It's magnified, and you can see anything you want. All right? So this is something I use almost every single day. I remember my father bothering me. See, it has the numbers on how the magnification is. He used to bother me every day. Didn't I just look at this? Just look and be like, no, no, leave me alone. You know, like, you're kind of like a, you know, uh, you know, you think, ah, I don't want to be bothered. I got other things to do. And then after a while, I did try it once and I was like, holy crap, now I know what he means. You could see with it. The reason I'm showing you that is to get to this and then I'll shut up, okay? So this Who's is the, that with your light? This says is the Marilyn other thing Perlman. I have that yeah, you're going to think I'm crazy. Yeah, that's what I thought she was going to do. No, I have my other thing with the lights, but I want to show you something else I have. Okay, so this is so C.A.K. Carol, how you doing? Look at this, I guys. was watching Masterpiece Theater. Look what I got here, guys. Look. Do you see that? Is the light on? No. Did the light go on? Hold on. There it is. Okay, so this is another thing I have. When you get older, you can't see. Listen up, Lisa, Stephen, anybody else who's older than me or younger than me or my age. Look, you see this? Now I could see this, my nails or my jewelry. So if I want to see if my jewelry is you clean. You guys became jewelers? <laughs> Make fun of me, go ahead. Tony says, what Look, the heck? Look, it's me, it's my obsession to get my jewelry clean. So Sheila, when you come over, I'm gonna see all Bring that all dirt. Jewelry. Look, she's gonna see Look, all I the can jewelry. see all the nooks what and the do you have is right. All right, so I just wanted to show you that. Oh my God, I'm so hot. All right, so I'm what don't you have off. in that apartment, says Heather W. My God, Heather, I have other things. It's got to be for oh, another so day. Put those things on. It comes with a strap. It comes with a strap Hold so on. you don't lose it. comes it. with a strap. Not only that. <laughs> then that is Inspector Gadget, says HC. <laughs> Wait, things you don't know about Danette. Look at this. It comes with different those magnifications. Are different magnifications. It's like a so jewelry she can turn up Look, the game. I've got six of them, right? For, for both eyes. It's a full set. Anyway, I wanted to show you that. And you guys, don't scoff. This thing is amazing. The minute, I, listen to this. I went to the dentist. You know what I bought her one Christmas? What did you buy? One of those. And she had to send it back because she already had it. Uh, sound familiar? Anyway, Does so that I wanted sound like to, a familiar story? Why am I so hot? Why am I so hot, Aunt? Mm. Anyway, I just wanted to say that one time I, uh, what was I going to say? Hold on. What was I going to say about that? I don't know. What was I going to say? See, I forgot. Now I'm all disheveled myself. I forgot I'm so hot. Well, old Bill says, Johnny is area. How you doing? Wait a minute. What was I going to say about that? There was something about that. I wild Bill. Wild you. Wild oh, William. One time I went to the um, dentist and I noticed that, you know, they wear those glasses, right? So I thought they were the same glasses. Everyone's laughing. Wait. <laughs> I think I want one, Keanu Marie. Listen, get one of these. They're amazing. I'm telling you. Although I can't and figure out how to get this back in the box. I don't know how to do it. I think that's it. But anyway, oh, because I moved it. So one time I went to the dentist, right? And I said to the, to the, uh, the hygienist, I said, what is that you're wearing? Because, you know, I'm obsessed with being able to see. I used to have 15, 20 vision. I could see anything. But when you get a certain age, you can't see no more. All right, so I said to the dentist, I said, what are those glasses you're wearing? You could see like up close. She says, yeah, they're magnified. And I said, and that was before I bought this thing. And I said, where did you get that? She says, you just order it. So I said, oh, yeah. And then I ordered that. And then I saw she has didn't come in pieces, right? You know what it's And called? then she said, no, only dentists can get it. I'm like, I want one. She thinks I'm crazy. She says, thousands and thousands of dollars. I was like, all right, forget it. 
They saw the cards. Yeah, there it's it is. It's a watch repair set. This yes. is so that you could repair That's watches. That's what I said, jewelry. Yeah, watches and jewelry, guys. That's what that's for. And what is the name Keanu of it? Keanu Maria, uh, a watch repair set. <laughs> this is uh, made by... Patrick says his stomach hurts. What did they say in to make his stomach hurt? Uh, Keanu wants one. Yeah, it's a watch repair magnifier set. Two hands can be used. Get the one <laughs> where you could use two hands. We do have a lot of gadgets, Anthony. We do true. have a lot of gadgets. Anyway. <laughs> you guys are killing me. All right. We like, our goal was to kill you. It's a miracle I'm tracking the story. Sorry I leaves you now. It's five here. I have to go to sleep. Good night, Irma. That's okay. Thank Irma, you for stopping by. Thank we you appreciate for stopping it. by. Anyway. Um, I have this Vaseline lip therapy. This is what I'm putting on. Advanced healing. That's good for advanced folks healing. Make models, too. Oh, my says, lips are all burnt from uh, the wind. Carol, C A K. Yeah, it's good for yes. a lot of things. Well, anyway, now I showed you all that stuff. Now I'm going to I'm gonna do some cleaning. No cooking today. Cleaning. Here, you want this? I'm going to do some cleaning. I'm going to clean some of my jewelry so I can show you the before and after, okay? All right. Now, go ahead. You want to tell your stories? I'm going to tell a story. But I, actually, there's a couple of things... I can tell you about, let's see, I'm having flashbacks from the movie The Jerk and the octogram <laughs> that made everyone cross-eyed. <laughs> Don't stop, I love your stories. Don't stop, we love Georgie! your stories. Georgie! Is it George in the house? He won't right, leave me Anthony, alone if I'm not I don't know which the, one you should start jacket. with, Anthony, because the clothesline one, I almost peed in my pants yesterday. The, the net was like, it's very involved because there's a lot of stories. You All know, right, one story one has a lot of stories. We should probably go with many, with the with, with okay, the showers. So the the shower. Shower. Let's, the gotta, let's end the shower one because it's been long overdue. Let's do the let's showers. Let's finish the showers. Now, many of you have probably heard of the like the various <laughs> showers, but they were like four showers. Baby actually, showers right? and wedding showers. Baby so, showers and wedding showers. Can I just showers. say really quick? Let me just Danette let me just only set went it up. The three of them. Uh, no, Anthony, stop. Let me let me set it up. Anthony has two cousins, right? On his mom's side. All right? Let me say it, and then you could do the, the talking. All right. So one cousin... What? One cousin is a man, a female, and the other cousin is a male, but, but it's the wife-to-be, the and wife then to eventually be. the wife, right? So anyway, we're going to start with the girl cousin. So she had two showers. They got married before us, both of them, and they had a couple of kids. Anyway... So there's, of course, the wedding shower and then the baby shower. So there's two showers of both people, right? There's the female cousin of two showers, a baby, a wedding shower, and then the baby shower. And then the wife, to, then the male cousin, his wife, had a wedding shower and a baby shower. So starting with your female cousin, the wedding shower, she was the first of the three of us to get married. She got married... She got married twice, but her first wedding, there was a shower. Now, go ahead. Yes. This is the wedding the shower. CAK says she'll do oh, anything you want me, to, you want to see my a shower. <laughs> oh, hey, Barbara, how are you? Shower. Who said that? Uh, CAK. I love you, Carol, because you say it just she'll like anything it. Yeah, to avoid a lot of people don't like Gorge it. congratulates Daniel and Yuka. Yes, congratulations. Savoy, congratulations. What's the baby's to, uh, name? Daniel and Yuka. Oh, what's their name? name? George. Do we have a name? I realized I could avoid baby showers by being born male, so I did that. Chief! Who said my cloud? That's who said it. <laughs> That's right. There is there is the engagement ring, the wedding ring. Ring and the last, last and last, last the, the suffering. suffering. Oh my god. Dude. Followed by the suffering. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna lose it. If this story ends with a magnifying watch repair kit, I'm gonna lose it. <laughs> it should. We do have a lot of magnifying glasses, we but we won't get into that right now. Kyle, we got Kyle, Daniel and Luke, oh, baby Kyle, baby I'm Kyle, not. welcome to the universe. There's been so many babies born since we've been on. We've got um, we've got uh, uh, Stex baby Nate uh, Nathan. What's what's his name? I Nathaniel. Forgot. No, it's Nathan. Not. Nathan. And yeah, Nathaniel. Nathan. And then there's Rowan. That's uh, Virginia's grandson, uh, who's about a, a little bit over a year now. Both of them a little over a year, I believe. And now uh, Kyle is that amazing. Thank you, George. Anthony will oh, be Oh, thank you, George. That's so sweet of you. 
Yes, much love and happiness. Thank you, Virginia. That you couldn't say it better. Congratulations. Hey, Breezy. How are you and Capri? Breezy Chambers. How you doing? How's Capri? Yeah, Breezy's congratulations, child. Daniel and Yuka. That's amazing. I'm so glad that uh, they have a baby boy. If, uh, you know, I don't know what the date was. We have to go and look. We haven't seen. We haven't I don't seen, know. I know that there was lately. some bad weather in uh, where they live, mm -hmm. but thank mm -hmm. God they're okay because that, that, we would have heard that too. All right, good. I'm going to shut up. Go back to the shower. I think it was an earthquake. Earthquake, yes, that's right. Okay, I'm going to do my wedding rings now in the liquid. Okay, so this way, you know what? They're both the same. Here's my wedding band, and here's my engagement wedding engagement ring. ring. You can see it's a little dull, right? A little dull. She's going to make it shiny. It's not that shiny. So I'm going to do the, the engagement ring, and we'll see She's getting out her how the connoisseur hair. works. Now, I got this in Target. They also sell it in any of the drugstores. It comes. She's getting a shilling kit out, but, I'm not, little, but she's not Billy. Look, Bass, I'm going to show you. It comes with Tommy, a little basket. Or whatever the guy's Look, name let me was. take it out. Let me show you. It comes with. You see, it has like a little. Larry. It comes with a little basket. So and it has in the middle the little. Look, I'll show you. You put it in the basket so it doesn't really go, and you drop it down into the liquid. You take this out, and you're going to just like scrub it a little, put it in some water, and then dry it. All right, so that's in Danette's there in the solution creating, now. Creating many right, things. Yes, now, as Danette cousin. said, my female cousin. Now, the first shower was the faint, was the infamous. The first no, it wasn't. shower. It wasn't the, the box? Oh, my God. The first shower is the one you're going to tell about my fever. Oh, yes. Actually, the empty box. You've heard the empty box story. That's the third shower. That was the third shower. The empty box. Well. Yes, it is. It was the third shower? Yeah. The empty box Anthony, one? I went there, so you just tell all me. Right. Just listen so to me. All right, so you've all heard the empty box story. The That's empty the third box story. Get to I've that already later, told the empty Going box order. story. Number one. So number st number one story was, I used to have a little battery, what, what did CAK say? I used to have a little battery operated jewelry cleaner and I haven't used it in ages. Just in case then you then just came. And then has one you plug into the wall. This is the best one. I think you got this from Sharper Image. Ouch. Eh? That's, That's the Sharper Image one. And look, I love watching cool? all the Nets projects, says Breezy. <laughs> you do, She's Breezy? got many projects. Look at what it looks like inside. You can fill it up with water or solution. Do not put gold with diamonds no. in sterling silver cleaner. No, you don't. Says Keith That's Bates absolutely Havens. right. That is correct. Now, I'm going to show you this one because this is one of my favorite rings, and I don't know how it got so bad. The reason I have no nail polish is those fake nails messed up my nails so bad. I wore nail polish the other day, but like, look how bad this is. Hold on. Look how, look how bad. Look at it right there. You see how it's like brown right here on this edge right here and on the inner part? It's a green, look, it's a green stone. And it's, this is sterling silver, one of my favorite rings. And it's a but mess. But she has the silver Now, cleaner. the silver cleaner I'm going to show you that I'm going to use is this one. So you use the, look at this. So this is a nice one too for silver too, right? You can buy different products. This is a Haggerty. And you wipe it on the white side and then you shine it in, on this side. They also sell Connoisseur silver cleaners, but I didn't like the way it works, so I didn't. I don't use that. Okay, go ahead. I'm sorry. Botanic Core and Apple <laughs> from Circus Fruit. Mickey McMurphy? Wait a minute. Mickey McMurphy. Hi, is, how are you? Hey, hey, hey. The stream. Nice to see you. How are you doing, Mickey? All right. Welcome aboard. Hey, Mickey, you're so fine. Find you're so you. fine. You I'm sorry. I just can't help Yo, myself. Yo, Mickey. All right, go ahead, Anthony. Oh, Tell Mickey. your story. Hey, Mickey. All, All right. right. Welcome ahead. aboard. Anyway, so the ver one of the very first showers was what is f known. So we did tell the story of the empty box, and the empty yes. box being legendary, the story of the me of the uh, of the grand empty box. But there were other showers. Then I had other showers. His mother was a pain through. in the ass. There were three in total. There were four in total that she went to with my family that needed. For your my family, family was your mother, and so, I met your like, cousins. So, one of and them aunts. was the empty box. Okay. My family, meaning my cousins, his side who of the were family. getting married Correct. at various times. Married now, and wedding, uh, married wedding and, and baby wedding. shower. Now, the first of those showers that the net had to go to was there was a wedding shower. Am I correct? It's a rough call. That no, was it's known soft, as actually the wedding shower Keanu, was in fact this. the fever. Larry, was, the wedding shower was the fever shower, where the net had to go to a shower and keep talking. I'm just dropping my ring into water. 
Just dropping showing, it into water. Just showing it in the water. And then I'm going to dry There's it. There's a shower so, known as a fever shower. The net had to go to a shower and she had to pick, she had to dry. It was like the net's job was drive basically mostly. to transport my mother. Who lived and in the Bronx. at this time, my aunt also, my mother's aunt. My mother's right. aunt. Not Who was my a doll? Aunt. I loved her. My mother's aunt was, she was a the sweet best. woman. But she lived in Queens. She lived in Queens. We, we lived, lived in, the, in Bronx, the Bronx. And the shower was in Long Island, And the shower West Chester. was in Westchester. Right. It was in so the catering. So my girlfriend, Danette was not my wife. Right. My girlfriend's job was to go to the go to the bridal shower. Okay. Here's the, the shiny lady. one now. Look she, at the difference there. Look at the difference. Holy it's blinding mackerel. me with a shower. Look, with before it wasn't doing that. A beaver but shower. Like you see what this the heck one? is a beaver shower? Look. No. Look. A, a bridal, sh a bridal, bridal shower. shower. Look at the difference. It looks like it's shining right through the light. And this one's not. I'm gonna. I'm sorry. I'm interrupting. <laughs> I'm Let me do this one now. I'm losing my train of thought. Just go ahead. Just I'm go ahead. losing my train. I'm losing the train. I'm not going to be able to catch my Jeanette, train. I want you to meet my mother, Cobruno. Oh, my God. Oh, Cobruno. I'll meet anyone. I I'll want meet you to meet my mother. The next job, as my girlfriend, it was her job. That's right, Holly. Because when you have what's, a girlfriend, what's going on here? it is what's the girl. Okay. It could come off the rails at any moment is right, Joe. As, as a girlfriend, her job was always, first and foremost, Drive my mother to any family event. Because I had a car and they didn't. Because she had a Anthony car. Anthony had no car till he met me. No car till I met her. A driver's license, no car. As a matter of fact, I got a car when we met each other. Her job a... was to cart my mother up to Westchester and her aunt. with a stop off in Queens yes. in Astoria to pick up my mother's aunt. No, you have that wrong. To pick up my your, mother's aunt. Your cousin, her, her son, Dropped her, sons, dropped her off. He dropped her. Yes. Well, that, why didn't he pick her up? Well, we didn't get to that part we didn't of the get story, to that did yet, we? Right? She, he I was going to so. pick her up. Uh, I don't. I totally forgot about that. That's right, because you weren't even in the story. I wasn't even there. That's so right. what happens? Maud, is, make me a steak. Maud, Patrick had taken orders yet? Patrick, make me a steak. Maud, Maud, can you can you grill me up a steak? All right, good. Maud, shrimp. <sighs> See, so you're introducing. You're, you're introdu I interrupt you're intro my own, own song. story. My own story. This is enthralling. That's right, Frank. So her one job as the girlfriend was to cart Besides my mother up to Besides going half Westchester. on every part. On every Besides going half okay, on look at every that. gift. What a difference. Look every at that. Gift. Yes, it's See, very gorgeous. The point is, it's connoisseur for gold. Connoisseur. That's the thing. And besides, if you, if you can't afford the machine. That's the one somebody said they yes. had a connoisseur. If you can't afford cleaner. the machine, uh, that was a little clean. Target people, target. <clears throat> Battery yeah. powered connoisseur. All right, go ahead, Aunt. Keep going. So, beside that, that was her job. That was her one job that she had. And to go habsies with my mother on everything. Now I'm going to do this. She had silver. to go there. So, she had to cut my mother up to Westchester. I'm going to try this one. Now, leading up to that day, the net was not feeling very well. Oh, I was feeling so sick. Now, now of course, I was uninvolved in this entirely because this was early in the shower process. And early in our, in our and dating. early in our relationship. But, like, I was very all in. Early. Anthony was but all Danette in. was all in. We, we were, were all like in. Together. We, were, we, were, we were a couple. Anthony, I lost we my job. Anthony Danette was paying lost for a job. dinner. I paid for every, every meal. We were just together. We were just yeah. always together. But Did this was together. early as in my mother would have nothing to do with me being involved in a shower yeah, back exactly. then. Yeah, exactly. This was before the empty this was before box. the empty box. Before the empty box. <laughs> Where I actually had some say. No, George. Tiny though my say was. In, Heather would in like showering. a pro chop. I very rarely showered. <laughs> so, like. And so, Danette was not feeling well leading up to that day. She was like, her, her, she was getting, it was poorly. These were the days, obviously, this was many decades before COVID. But she was like slowly getting ill in the prior days leading up to the show. Hi, Christian. Christian Hansen, how you doing? Oh uh, in, in, leading up to the shower, she was slowly getting more and more Oh Ill. my God, I'm so excited. You have no idea what this cloth is doing, Aunt. I could wear my ring again. Okay. 
What the hell was all of that about? That interruption over nothing. Oh my God! This ring is clean! Sheila, sure, you gotta come visit. It's not a so I can clean your jewelry. Now you Sheila, can take your jewelry. Bring your jewelry if you're coming for Easter. That's right, George. Or maybe we have to so go up to you to clean all your jewelry. We go up. So like she's Content slowly gold, getting, Buffalo for cleaning she's jewelry. Slowly getting sicker and sicker. Sally, oh my Cipio, God. welcome to the she's house. She's been here. You're a little slow. I don't. Yeah. I did not see her. So if I didn't see her, she wasn't here. <laughs> this is the UK day. girl. How you doing? <laughs> I did not see you, so you were Lord, I'll take that. a chocolate shake. Over here. Go ahead. Over here, I'll take a chocolate shake. Patrick, Patrick. Cheeseburger deluxe. Patrick, <laughs> Patrick, can I have lettuce and tomato instead lettuce of French and tomato fries? With, and lettuce and tomato on the side for dinner. <laughs> this is what, this with is a, what a house said. vinaigrette. House vinaigrette. No onions, please, because I have GERD and it bothers me. No onions. No onions on that. I'll take the onions. Okay, anyway, yeah. so like she's 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 slowly getting more and more ill as it gets closer oh and closer God. to the shower. Yeah, but I was, and I'm going like this. I was she's, like, she's like, I said, can I say? It? Can we tell? And I was thinking I to myself, said, I can't do that to them. There's no way they're going to be able to whilst, get up there. Whilst biting my lip, I was like, I have to go in. I'm going to tell you something. I have to make a whilst first impression. I did the thing. Like, I have to do my my obligation. I have to go. This That's was it. early in our relationship. I had to go. If this was early in our relationship and very late in my relationship with my mother. I was dumb and mother, I didn't know that I could She cancel. did not know. Early in my relationship my with the net. from the dirt. Early in my relationship with the net, but very late in my relationship with my mother. <laughs> so, like, I was, like, biting my lip telling the net... Danette, perhaps you should tell my mother that you no. cannot take her. No, I did not want... I, I, I thought she was sick, but I, did, I wanted Danette to say no. I wanted Danette to say no, and what? she did. And I have to take her. No, I had to take her. Then right? I, then no. I was like, because I knew no, I was, she had to take her. I didn't know that. But, I knew she had to take but her. But I was getting sicker, but I was like, all right, I'll take Tylenol. Okay, everyone, time for an orange, says Wild Bell. Okay, not now, because I have my hands in this. No, no, Danette's hands are in chemicals. But they're all good oranges. I'll show you in a minute. And that has mutagenic properties. And then I'll also properties. show you mun Munchie as well. Renew your vows after that ring so it looks shiny again. That's hold on, right. I can't wait to show you this ring. Look at all the dirt from With the this silver. Ring, IV this wig. is a new one that I know I saved this one for like a day. With like this, this rag, IV Look, wig. And I just want to say, I guess it's American made. I don't know. Go ahead, Aunt. Keep know, going. It has a flag on it. <laughs> Come on. Anyway. So, wait, what Anthony doesn't know at the time after we leave, I say hello to him, I give him a hug, I say goodbye. She says, we all oh, go she off says to the goodbye. shower. Five hours later, because it takes like an hour to get there, so maybe it's like a four hour, maybe six hours later. Apparently, I got so sick. Then that fever started spiking. You know what it was? Spiking. It was in a. It was. It was. A, it was a rainy day. It was in a um place. I forgot the name then of it. Then it's carrying the present in the rain. No, listen, listen. It was in a. Place. My mother lifted nothing. <laughs> it was in a uh, uh uh what is it called when you get married? What is it called? A, a hall. Oh, it was in a was hall like... in Westchester. It was really fancy, and we were in the basement. And the basement had no. Oh, that was the place with the basement. Yes, it had the basement, and and it was freezing in there. It was a summer day, and they had the air conditioner on, and it was freezing because the temperature went down, and it was raining, and it was so cold. I was shivering the whole time, and apparently my fever went up. I got a fever. I had no more Tylenols. I didn't know we were going to be gone so long. It was so bad. And when I got home, I took my sh I took my uh, temperature. Like now, if I didn't feel good, I would carry the thing because I'm a hypochondriac sometimes because I have to worry about me and him. So I take the, you know, the the mom with me. But at the time, I was like dumb, you know. <laughs> so I took two Tylenols. Besides, they didn't have technology anyway, like that. Anyway, when I got days. home, I tell you, when I got home... 102.3. I was 102. shivering. 3. And I jumped into bed. I said, Mom, Dad, I lived at home. I said, I am 3. so sick. It was because the place was freezing cold. It and your aunt, not cold. your mother, your aunt was so worried about me. She saw me literally shivering. She's shivering. I, the, she gave me her place. sweater. She was cold. She was an older woman. And she was so nice. All right, let me shut up. Keep going. So now at, at a certain point, what I'm I like, believe happened, just... Danette will immediately interrupt me and correct well, me if I'm you, wrong you about this. There. Look at this. I wasn't there. Look at the dirt. So what happens is, is Wait, that... Wait, can I like, show Danette... this? 
I need Look to at go. it, guys. You saw Look before. That. Look at that mood ring. Look at it. Look at the silver. Look at the silver. Look at it. It looks like a whole nother ring. Can you be my French, my, my henchman silver? Hold on. Do you see this ring? <gasps> Look at it. Now Look she can clean. wear it. Now she get, now you'll see Do her you on see with that? that on. The before in a live and after. Stream. Yes, I will wear it because I love now it. Now you'll see her I with love that it, on. I love it, I love it, I love it. All right. That sucks. So it she's does sitting feel there. Up. So she's there in the in the hall and she's freezing to death. She's shaking and she's like Oh, lemon and baking soda. Thank you, Christian. I'll try that. that too. So she's like, Oh, Joe, we still have some of your coffee left. And I'm going to use it later. Rattling. Some of the froth. Danette is rattling. Oh, I'm so freaking. Her teeth are chattering. My sick. mother's aunt is like I'll saying, never forget I really don't was think, I, I think Danette is not feeling well to my mother. My mother's reaction was probably something along the lines of, Who gives a shit that she doesn't feel well? Do you see my foot? <laughs> What do you mean? I, I don't know. Something was probably wrong anyway, with her Anyway, <laughs> it looks brand new, right? You see, you all the girls are loving it. My mother was a caring, sharing nurturer. No, she wasn't. No. And she didn't care. She didn't care that I didn't feel good. She did and not I care stayed at the party. My, my, that my I told Anthony girlfriend after. girlfriend did not feel good. I told Anthony and my after I should have left. my mother was unconcerned to the high I should have left, but I knew that I they were my ride, and I was being... A good girl. She was there, right? And I she waited stayed. until the dumb coffee and the cake. This was the when her big fingers going into the cake, not caring, putting her fingers off. You can't. I hate that. You ever go to a party, an Italian party, and you have all the rainbow they have cookies, the cookies on the and front all of the, the Italian table. cookies? And his with mother, mother with her nails, her dirty nails. I don't know why they weren't dirty, but, but I felt Alan's like they were. Would pick up and she'd go in and go, and, and I'd be like, okay, no, I don't want any cookie. You're not supposed then put to it down do that. And it and look oh, it yeah, up and then put it back. Put it back down. Who does that? Alan, look at the cookie. Put Who's it back ever? down. My mother was taught by wolves. <laughs> oh my God! She's George. looking at the cookies and putting it down. I hate when she does that. It's embarrassing. And I borrow it to soak my Nutella stained undies. No, yeah. we stayed. I stayed to she the end. She stayed the. I had thing. to say goodbye. We were there like six hours. Now keep in mind, this was like I a, was this sick was an as era dog. way before you know cell oh. phones didn't exist. No. They were the size of washing no. machines. Back I just then. was holding but on. I got to get to the party. She would have looked like she was calling in an ass. The girls opening the gifts. I'm like mother effa. Open it faster. Open them faster. Open them faster. I was I was dying. Cell phones were the size of those walkie-talkies from World War II. There were II. no cell it phones. It would be like you were carrying no. a thing like you were calling it an 80s. airstrike. This was the 80s. We were dating, they, man. They had, not, they had beepers. Come on. We were, was People the had beepers. You couldn't send messages. I had no clue what was going on. I'm at home. Do, 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 do. I think everything's okay over she there. She was freezing. No, thought everything I was, was okay. <laughs> Everything. Keith, I can tell you story after thought story. Thought everything was okay. Older people get cold. I thought everything Their was okay. goes down. So do 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 do. And so uh, like I'm, I'm there, not right now. He's not. Now I believe at some point. Father, forgive me. It was no, they time not to know. leave. It was time they to leave. Not. So the time the net would make some way through it. By the way, was that was the wedding shower. For those of you who are members, by the way, quick sidebar. For oh, those yes. of you who are members. <laughs> For those of you who are members of the channel and have watched the members only live oh stream my God. where I told the story oh of God. the marriage itself, where I t uh, that was the lady who was married to the guy oh my where it God. lasted till the end, till they got home from the honeymoon. And then this happened. Rem ah! Remote. And then it was over. The marriage ended that morning. <laughs> that was that wedding shower. That was that wedding shower. What's the one that lasted till they got back from the honeymoon. You can, you. If you would like to see that story and you are not a member, <laughs> or if you're a member who hasn't watched that, go to that members only video <laughs> to watch this. <laughs> Where they killed each other with a sheet <laughs> to the eye, a detached retina, followed by a fling, a lucky boomerang remote control over the shoulder 
that landed <laughs> in the forehead. Out. The marriage was over. The divorce came shortly after that. You're an ass. That You're was ass. that wedding. That was what I had to say. That was through. the wedding. They were. I, that was the people who got married. That that was the shower. Yes, the baby shower. After that was a different husband. It's different that husband. Was the second husband. The baby shower was a different husband. <laughs> so that was that. Oh my god. That was that. So she my girl. Let me tell you, said, even my so sidebar, sidebar. Point, join the membership just to see that. And then you can un you can unmembership. I allow it to happen. It's all right. Just for one month, just to watch that. It's a crying shame the rest of you can't see it. It's a crying shame. I'm describing a shotgun divorce. <laughs> they came home from their honeymoon. <laughs> to the left. Back into the left. Back into the left. <laughs> oh, by the way, guys, look. Tiffany never looks so good. So they're sick look at there. that, guys. Danette is sick. Oh, my God. I could wear She's it again. She's getting better. Watch. Danette is sick. Again. She's getting worse by the second. And it's time to go home. It's time to pick yourself up and get the heck I out of there. I can wear it again. And Danette, all she, I can only assume at some point she must have been given the news that like she kind of had this one a before and after again hold on look at this one i forgot what this black stone is called marcasite marcasite thank you but look how dirty it is look at it it doesn't even look marcasite. shiny look at it okay good all i'm smelling is at a cake. certain time in the middle of this whole event she must have gotten the word that she was supposed to i can only assume that the story was, this is the kind of thing my family does. Like she said, my mother's aunt was taken there by oh, her Bill, son. What are you talking about? Was taken there by her son by, uh, to, <laughs> to the event. But then all of a sudden, he wasn't picking her up anymore. Oh, no. Danette will take her home. My hey, mother you, must have told, I agree with that. My Good. mother must have told him, mm -hmm. like... Don't worry. Oh, no, no. Don't Wild come Bill. all the way back to Westchester to pick up your mother. Danette will take her home. <laughs> Is that kind of what happened? Yeah. What happened yeah. was she said, oh, no, you don't have no. to take, call your son. Danette will take you home. And I was like, Danette will take you home. It was already going to take like an hour. And I was like, I'm sorry. I Danette's said, got flocks sweat so, at this point, so I'm so sorry. Sure. I don't feel good. I He's have like, to go home. I, I don't even want to take you home, I felt like saying. I was like, I want to leave you here. I have to I have to first drop you off and then go home. All right, it's good, right? So let me refresh. Hold on, hold on. It should it looks fine. It looks fine. Right, anyway. Um, anyway, so, so like she's got the flop sweat probably. It's like she's like going like this. The net is woozy or whatever. And she I just told said, I'm later. sorry, like I, I, up and down. Said, I said, oh, I but what she I doesn't do understand it. is that I already, I already shouldn't have gone. I stayed the whole party. She saw I didn't feel good. Her aunt, who was good, who needed to take the ride home from Queens, understood. She said, don't worry about it. And, and then I did the biggest thing of all. I said, listen, I'll give you money for the cab. I really I'll can't take you I'll give you the money for a cab. I will give you the money. I don't have it I'll on me, but I'll pay you back. I I said, I'll take, I, I'll give you the money. I can't do it. I have, so she's And driving. at that time when I was younger, I didn't know where Astoria was. I knew nothing about Astoria. There was no in Astoria. ways. There were no GPS. We had no computer to look it up. You we didn't have a to, map. You needed to get out your random we McNally. Were, we were in, in their do domain, not in my house, where we yeah. had everything. You had to get out your you random see. McNally. You had we to get have, out your photos. I didn't have her address. I didn't know anything. And I was not about to stand around, wait I another hour. I had a road hour. atlas in the and car. And it was, honest, to be honest, it wasn't safe if I kept driving, to tell you the truth. Come on, Bill. Bill. Calm it down a little bit, okay? Calm down. Stop Oranges are good. We're fine. Stop saying that. Move, change the subject, all right? Change the subject. We love you, Bill, but not here, okay? All right, so anyway, <laughs> come on. We know what you knew. We know you're so a jokester. What, 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 so so what, what, she's, 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 <clears throat> she's getting, like, nervous. So the Nets telling them. Just down a tick. Okay. So the Nets telling them. Nothing, Bill. Telling them you gotta go, you gotta, you gotta calm down. You, you know, Danette is. What were you telling them? I was I telling them, listen. Home. 
I no, I said if I take you home, if I'm on the car anymore, I may faint. I don't feel I mean, good. Faint. I'm, so the next... I'm literally shivering to death. And I honestly, it's very dangerous me taking you home. I said, I'm so sorry. His aunt was in the back. She was in the front seat next to me in the in the passenger seat. And the aunt was in the back seat. And she's like, it's okay. It's okay. Just get us home. It's fine. Right, Anthony? <clears throat> All right. So what happens is, so so she, she said, so she's taking them home. So she's, but she's so taking now them. So I'm to, driving she's got to take my mother home. Yeah. Both of them go back to your house. And then they I go to go my house. And then the net has <clears throat> to go home. So I come downstairs and I, I you know, I, they, they come upstairs and then told me that. Yeah. What's going on? Oh, my hands are getting dirty. Look, my hands from the my dirt. My hands are all dirty. So I want to clean it. My hands all have, going on have like floor. dirty. So yeah. they get, so they get back to the house. They get back to our house and I go downstairs and I, I was like, like, I don't know what's going on. Like, no, actually my people? mother. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. People, I don't know why. Maybe it's there's a bad signal. No, can everybody not a bad still signal. see us? All right, good. Aunt. Do you guys that's still not a hear bad us? Signal. Do you guys? Well, I feel like the still... I feel like the chat's not moving. Yeah, that's just uh, the chat not moving. That's just somebody say something. Somebody say something, which I think is going to be fine because I see the thing moving. <laughs> somebody say something. It's good. Thank All you, right. Katie. It's All good. Right. Thank you. Thank you, Katie. All right, go ahead. So anyway, the net gets back. The net, the, the net comes back with my mother. Now I only heard this later on. I heard the story later on from. Thanks, uh, King Jack George. Something. Thanks, George. <laughs> Say something. 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 All right, go ahead. Anyway, I only heard the story, but the net told me the story of driving home with them. So the driving home with them story runs something like this. What, what was it like? You said basically you're just I like, got the side like driving, and the net's now getting it's going to like up. the debt. They're getting death stares from behind her the entire and the uh, passenger seats the entire time because you know for some You're streaming? reason. Thank you, Alan. Go ahead, don't keep going. For That's some good. reason, uh, for some reason, the nets the, nobody sat up in front. You know how usually <laughs> someone will sit That's up funny. in the front with the driver. No, the two of them were in the back seat. If I remember no, correctly, your mother was in my the mother front, was in the front. Oh, yes. she was in the front. Yes, doing and the, the side in the back. Yes. So I believe. My aunt, my mother's aunt, is in the back seat saying, it's okay, Danette. It's, uh, I understand. You don't feel well. Right. She it's knew okay. it. I can take, you don't have to give me any money. You don't have to give me Yeah, no, I won't take your money. Trip. I'm not going to take your money. I'll go there. And my mother's reaction is like this. There was smoke coming out of her freaking face. There you go. What do you this think of that, fire guys? coming out of my head. Look at that. Ron TV Metro. Hi, How you Ron. doing, Ronnie? How Ronnie's are you, Ronnie? House. Look at that, guys. How come it doesn't? There we go. Look at that. But look at the gold. Look at the silver. Look at the wondrousness wow. of the gold. The silver. I still can't get over this one. This one's amazing. But anyway, go ahead, Aunt. Anyway, so like, then it, then it I'm came Marisol home. Again. And she, she finally makes it home. And I think my mother like threw herself out of the car or something. Like, like in a huff. She didn't. St oh, she didn't she, speak this to the neck Macy's, for like three 14 weeks. Fourteen karat gold. I'm gonna shine this up too. Go ahead. She was I said so the neck was so angry. The oh neck my god! This is a high luster. Thank you. This Alex. was one of the rare. This is the only time the neck ever did one of these. She looked at me, said goodbye, I turned around, went to her car, and yeah. drove away. I was like, I, I, I can't upstairs. stay. I can't stay. I got to go. She waited for a cab. No, I think you came down. I didn't even go upstairs. Was that what happened? I don't remember. Yeah, no, you never came upstairs. You came you downstairs, came upstairs. I think. I came downstairs. I said, I'm you sorry. Said, Your mother's leave. so mad at Your me. Your mother's driving Thank me you, up Ron. a wall. She's so mad at me. She wants to stab me. And I explained to him because I didn't know what was going to happen. I was like, oh, my God. And then, uh, and I don't know what happened after that. What happened? How did she get home? Did she take a cab? Did a she, did my son aunt come back? A, no, my aunt took a cab. She actually did get a cab. Can they you didn't just, take the I, money. Can you please just clean Hi, my... Lisa. Can you please just clean my Joan Rivers jewelry collection, says <laughs> George. Anyway. Yes, she can, Lisa. Anyway, so that was no number one experience. That was the, the number one. That, now, was this, that was shower number one. Fast forward a few years or a year later, then she gets A few remarried. months went by when I was when Danette was able to talk to my mother again. No, it wasn't. 
It was a month or two. Wow, that's pretty it was not too. Look at when that. are you going to break up with her, Anthony? <laughs> anyway, look how shiny that is. Look at that. Look at how it's shining. All right, good. So second shower is now her same baby shower. The same baby shower, mm -hmm. different husband. I know, Ron. I know. I'm so sorry. I know, no, 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 I know. Anyway, um, uh, so the second shower was the baby shower, right? That's okay, Sh that's okay, Sharon. If anybody falls asleep, I understand. If anyone falls asleep, we anyway, totally so, understand. So um, the next shower is the baby shower. I'll tell this really quick. So it was a shower where it was on in Yonkers in, in, um, off Jackson Avenue. If anybody knows Jackson Avenue, there's an Italian restaurant right off of Central Avenue yes. called Jackson Avenue next to a diner. Across the way is on the edge is an Italian restaurant with like this dome. You ever see like an outside porch? But That's it has, really inside. It's really inside and it has that glass that goes over the top and you could see in. Well, over there and part of that restaurant, they turned on Sundays, they turn, you could turn and have like a little uh, party there, like a shower. <clears throat> anyway. I think the jewelry is going to get raffled off, all it says. Anyway, so what happened was the... Um, the the shower, what led, which is so weird, it leads up to the part of the the story where the um what it leads up to the story uh -huh. of the box, right? Because this is the second shower now, this right? Is the second shower, second baby shower. I go to the shower with her, but uh, before we get there, Anthony's mother says that um <clears throat> she says that uh listen, don't worry about. I said Anthony, how am I gonna ca at this point? I had a bad back. I always had. Herniated dips, uh, di discs, I can't lift anything. And so I said to Anthony, how am I going to get the box? I can't carry it. And she it said... It was always something heavy. It was always heavy because I... Heavy, right? This might have been mm -hmm. the dishes. Maybe. I don't remember. This was the dishes. Was dishes that were box. mold. No, it wasn't dishes. Oh, no, it, it was wasn't dishes. That's right. This anyway, was a baby. So I said, listen, I can't carry this, Anthony. Do you want to come up? Maybe hang out with the guys? Well, I dropped you off at Barnes & Noble. There were so many stores up there. You could have went to the movies. The theater with Movie Land was across the way. If anybody knows Central Avenue, you know where Movie Land to, is? Yeah. It was right there, right? It was next so to Movie Land. I said, Anthony, maybe you can come with me and then you could drop it off before the party. Anyway, she refused. She was really bitchy. I'm sorry. <laughs> she was bitchy. She didn't care, right? Who cares if she doesn't have to lift it? She goes, well, lift it together. I knew that wasn't going to We'll lift it happen. together. She was a little bit of a bitch. She said, we'll lift anyway, it together, we'll lift guys. it together. We never lifted we'll lift it, together. it together. They didn't lift anyway, anything together. Anyway, so then, so what happened was, I said, There was right. no lifting together. I had no choice. I, had to, I didn't really know a much, much about her yet. Her ways, so I would say it that there way. There were ways. So I just said. There were ways, and I, I don't said, mean right, that thing whatever. It got closer to the party. And I said, all right, whatever, let's just go. We'll just, maybe somebody will be there to help us. Maybe the waiter or something, I don't know. Right, one of the guys will be there, your your cousin or whatever. Anyway, we get there and of course no one's there to help. And what does she do? She walks in and she doesn't carry anything. I'm walking back and forth. I got the, you know, what is it called? The uh, wishing well gifts. I got all the and gifts from the going back and forth. On. So now while I'm going back and forth, everyone in the, <clears throat> that's already there is watching me through the window. They're watching me, and then I have to park the car after all of this, right? Because I'm a I transport. heard this story secondhand. <clears throat> anyway, so I'm carrying this big thing. I'm like hauling this thing. I remember it was a big box. It wasn't. It wasn't. This dishes. is two stories in one. Okay, so <laughs> I, I'm I'm carrying it, and I'm and it's tinted windows, so I don't know what they're looking at. I have no way of knowing, right? So I'm walking in, and it's like, you see me this way, then I walk across the restaurant, then I walk, because there's a left, a right, and a middle. So it's all open. Like, you could see the whole, like, thing. Everything, you could see the car, you could see me getting it out of the car, you could see me grabbing it, struggling to get it out of the car, struggling while the car is still open. I have the trunk open, or the back seat, whatever it was. And I get inside, and there's, like, maybe 30 women staring at me. I'm like, Hi, Mikey. How are you? Mikey, how are you doing? Everything's good. Anyway, yeah, I should have brought some jewelry cleaner and dumped it on her head. Well, anyway, <laughs> I get inside. I'm like, can anybody help me? No one's helping me. I put it down, and they're all staring at me. And I was like, but they're looking at me like up and down, right? 
And again, I was struggling. I had a bad back. And after that, my back was messed up. It was so messed up. I don't know. It was bad for days. Anyway, so I go like this. I go, what? I literally go, what? She did what? Why are you all looking at she me? She did a what? And I looked at her, my mother-in-law to be, and I was like, what did you say? We weren't engaged. I yet. literally <laughs> said, what did you say? Oh, nothing, nothing. You know, what did you say? Like, why is everybody staring at me? Danette told me it was one of these. You know, when you're walking I was room, like, what the she hell said, did this you is say? How Danette, this is how Danette described Till it. Till this day, I don't know what she said. Swish, you know how, like, you have things that you wish you knew? Like, it doesn't even matter anymore. She's gone. She's not with us. The whole Danette, time. Don't I don't know what, know she, what said. she said. Danette told me the story like this. She said, you know, it's one of those things. Did you ever walk into a room and you hear like this? You hear like, <laughs> when you walk in and then everyone suddenly goes. <laughs> I don't know what she said. But it had to be something around the lungs of, oh, she has a bad back or... Who knows what she said? Hi, Coleslaw. And then this is what happened. As we're at the party, again, it was summertime. And I remember it was summertime. And the air condition broke. So the air condition broke. And the sun, you know, it has glass. The sun's coming. It's getting too hot in there. It's getting cold. So they tell, the, they tell the people to move to, speaking of hot, they tell the people to move the, the our party, to move to the other room. It's a Sunday. It's early, like, I don't know, 12, 1. It's not dinner time yet. So there's a whole dining room in the back of the store and, and the thing. Right, exactly. Exactly, HC. So, so she, yeah, in Charlie Brown voice. <laughs> anyway, so I, we go to the other room, right? And we're all standing because they're trying to fix something. I don't know. So we're standing there waiting and everybody's standing and we're waiting. And, you know, we're waiting to, for them to fix whatever they're going to do. Maybe they're going to put the, I don't know, maybe there's window guards or something i don't know i don't remember but i do remember this i remember that she um she was standing next to me and i you know we were talking we was just pretty much the two of us just talking and this waiter comes by and he says something and he says something like oh yeah the lights will the lights will come back on we had a problem with the electricity it'll be back on in a few minutes and the air conditioner will be back on and she, and she repeated that. So it was just me and her, right? We were on by the kitchen area. And this way, one of the girls from the party were there. And all of a sudden, his mother's name was Jean. Her name was Jeanette. So her name was Jean, Jeannie. And she started telling the story to another woman. And it was a little woman, different than that said. It was a complete lie. It was, a, the whole thing was, it I was, was like. It was a whole other story. I was like, what? It was like one of these, this is how my mother I told like, stories. What? Wait, what? Danette did not yet know. Even I did not no, yet I know. No, I had to tell you. Yeah, Danette told me. And later on, I began to like Bye, George. pay closer attention. Bye, Georgie. Good night, See George. you another time. Thank you for stopping by. We really appreciate Thank you for stopping Georgie. By. Good night, Georgie. Anyway, um, have a good night. Anyway, so she says that the man said something about her. Like a complete lie. Nothing. Not even close. Nothing. Nothing to do with it completely lied and here i am the whole rest of the party trying to figure out let's see did she think he said this did she th what did he think she no. said that you just couldn't get around she it it was like a complete it was story. like i said the sky is blue and the guy really said the ground is red it had nothing to do with what he said at all. at all and so and then I, he came to me and again, he said genie it's too hot for you and then i'm getting these lights on for you as fast as we can and then i said i said oh my god i can't wait to get home to tell anthony and ask him is your mother a liar like is she a habitual she actually liar said, is he, is she i said a liar? does your mother have a problem telling the is truth she have a truth problem like i don't know what's going I said, on here oh i don't really know i'll try to figure that out and i said I was... anthony what's wrong with you you've learned you've known her your whole life do you did you not notice this before i started telling him things about her that i noticed and he's like i, I just never noticed it before i'm like okay connect the dots do you notice certain like things? Do you notice certain and things then I like... come to find out that she can't hear in one ear. So I'm thinking maybe that's what it was. She didn't hear, so she made it up a little, you know. HC, thank you. Have yet to reply to everyone in the comments of collecting my thoughts. Oh, boy. Anyway, uh, so 
Go ahead, Aunt. What were you saying? So what was I saying? Was, was, um, Ronnie, we love you. You know that, Ronnie, right? we do love you. Anyway, so um, it turns out that we got, I got home. I told him, and I asked her, what did you say? And remember what she said was completely different than I told yeah, her. Yeah, actually, she told And then that's she when... She told the third story. That's when I found <laughs> out that she was a habitual liar. So that was the second shower. The third shower was the box shower, but now it's the... His his cousin, that's the male cousin, the, the brother of this woman, who's the sister. Cool and, guy, how you doing? Hi, Ricardo. Say hello and everyone. I've been busy with a good, have a good stream and have a good night, everyone. See you next time. Bye, Ricardo. And thank you so much for stopping by. We Thanks really so appreciate it. Thanks so much for stopping it. by. We do appreciate it. If anybody that. has to go, I understand. I know it's getting late and uh, it's different times in different places. It's different times All right. And anyway, different strokes uh, for different said, folks. went to a thrift shop and found a vintage sound effect machine from the early 90s. This specific model was designed for a certain body sound. I knew it would be great for the candy house party. Oh my God! I've never okay. lied in my life, all 684 years. Not a single lie. Never lie. That is a good find. I wish I could see it. Can you show us? Take a picture and we'll send it in the community page. Take a picture and show us. Show cool. us your sound effect machine. Unless it's just a whoopee cushion. Anyway, so Anthony, so the third shower was the box shower, and now the fourth shower is we find out that so the third shower is now his. Wife to be is getting married, and we went to the shower, and the whole thing with the empty box. At that point, I was getting to know years were going by. I was getting to know his mother more and more, and how like you have to ignore her and just do what you got to do. Well, let me hear the second part. So I got it home and tried to use it, but had to go to the store to buy special batteries. Got the batteries, couldn't find the right screw screwdriver to open it because eventually I figured it out. Okay, that sounds good. That sounds good. What's the special batteries? I'm curious. Special batteries? What do you mean? D cell? Are they special? Are they the tiny little Anthony brown is a ones? walking sound effects Are they the machine. The big ones. All right, so then the fourth the fourth shower now is the fourth shower is now the last baby shower, okay? It was a remote controlled electrono whoopee cushion. Went to the bar yesterday and put the machine under the boys' table and waited for the fun to start. Oh my god. Cole Sloth, you're nuts. You're just as nuts as he is. Anyway. I'll try my best. Fourth shower. Thank you, Patrick. The fourth shower now is the last shower. It's like, oh, whew, I don't have to do this anymore, right? So we find out that she's pregnant. The minute after she's pregnant, now it's his, sister, his mother's sister, who calls her sister, of course, naturally, and go, guess what? Guess what? Blah, blah, blah. is pregnant. And this is amazing. I'm going to throw a shower. We're going to do it a year from now. Blah, blah, blah. So now we're gonna do it like we find months out because Anthony's the seven months at this point seven or eight months. now at this point we're already married we're not dating anymore we're married he doesn't live at home anymore and right yes and now all we're hearing about is the shower okay they don't know where it is they don't know the date my mother we just would call found me out she got married to ask when she's we gonna have go. the baby in nine months okay so after my mother heard that the Wait, girl the boys was pregnant were blaming each other for the sounds. It was for the, th wait, it was like the thing. It was like the thing. They were trying to figure out who did it. We were laughing. Leslie Nielsen oh, carries that's hysterical. a whole push everywhere he goes. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, so go ahead. No, it's, it's basically, so it's now, basically the bottom line is this. Okay. Is my mother found out the girl was pregnant, and she then called me every single day to ask when they because were going to go Because you weren't home to be harassed. For the, uh, for for the baby shower right. she said so when are we gonna go out my phone rings at work so when are we gonna go out so when is the net gonna take me back so when is the net gonna take me to the store when are we gonna go and buy the thing oh so God. i told the net okay, you better Joseph. go and take her uh take us somewhere the no just tell me when you want her, i'll pick it to up go somewhere well, to I'm not go taking and buy the no thing more. she didn't want she i didn't, didn't want to take her i'm not doing it but the net didn't want to take i'm her. like i'm not doing so this the said so what do you want and so her answer was When you guys heard the story, right? Her so her answer was the diaper genie. Someone's heard the story Yeah, already? you told it on the, the drop. Diaper right. genie. The diaper genie story was was basically this. Is that, like, Danette said, I'm not going to go. I'm, I'm not, I'm, I, I had I'm enough gonna, of her shenanigans. I'm not so now go I'm married. You're not living we there. We did the shopping thing I ain't with doing her, that. And she doesn't want to do the shopping I'm thing. I'm not doing it. She so was, she said, well, I'll go and buy it. I have to buy it now. Can't we just wait when... 
Danette wanted to know, could we just wait until it's a little closer to the shower? Right. No, I can't wait till it's closer to the shower. And I have I to go have half with now. her. I have to go half. So we <laughs> went and we bought the diaper genie. And she took the diaper That's genie. Funny, we wow, had, had to get the diaper genie and bring it to my mother's house. We brought it to right. my mother's house. We had to bring it to my mother's house. That's to get it. That's the, the place where they often break up freaking... Uh, where my right. mother would oh. smash <laughs> furniture to smithereens and like throw so refrigerators fun. off of the porch. That, that was that house that where she lived. And she had the room where she kept the turtle. Yes, the turtle was still alive at the time. There was the room hashtag with the turtle. The room with the schmucko. turtle, which was the hashtag schmucko. It was the room where the turtle was kept. So we kept the diaper genie in a corner with the turtle. For like seven months. Is for like baptism seven, technically eight months. a baby shower? No, that's a baptism. Baby that showers was before baby shower. the baby is baby born. Baby showers before baptism. It's when they're pregnant and they're about oh, to give birth. Oh, no, we never went to any of them baptisms. We weren't invited. <laughs> we, were we were never invited, invited, to be honest. We I don't know never what got invited to baptisms. Well, whatever, go ahead. And it was so like we left it there, and basically the end result is we bought the thing so early that they invented another diaper. Yes, genie. they had By a the new time, one. By the time they went, my mother went there like this. There was a state of the art they've diaper got a new genie. They've got a new now, really tell good everybody. diaper genie. Too to bad, which the too late. Said, Sorry, I'm not you had to get another one. Months and months, a year ahead, like nine buy, months ahead. We had to buy it. It's not returnable. That's it. Eight months early. So Learn no your lesson. No diaper genies. No diaper genie is forthcoming. So, so what happened was they had a new state of the art diaper genie. So tell them what's a diaper genie, just in case somebody doesn't know. Eh, it's something you throw a dirty diaper in. And, and then I don't it know like what you're kind of it. converts I don't to know a, it's a garbage. About genies or diapers. Well, anyway, it turns out that I was so mad at her and so disgusted with her that I was just like, that's it. I couldn't get off from I'm work. I'm not going. Whatever it was, I wasn't going to kill was myself. When said, I'm not and I was going. like, that's it. I'm not going. So I went from killing myself with 102 fever and taking them to I'm not going. Yeah, I went I'm half going. with your gift and I didn't go. That's the conclusion of the story. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That the was story. the amazing. That was the amazingness of it all. Now we're going to go from serious to funny again, really quick. And I'm not going to bring anybody down. Thank you, everyone, for being here. You mean but we're going to go from funny to serious? No, we're going to go to serious back. right now we're for go a second. To serious right now. While um, Ron TV is here. And then we're going to go back to funny. We're and it's not to, to be insensitive. Like, it's the opposite. It's, it's to be insensitive. Uh-oh. 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 Wait, no, rub, no. Rub. Let me get over there. What the heck are you trying to do? Look at that. It's coming off. Yeah, it's right here. All right, there we go. We're going to move the table, guys. That would have been serious. Anyway. We're going to go to serious. All right, we're going to go really quick. Really, really quick. Is gonna fall we would like to say rest in peace, Mary Reed. She is one of our subscribers, <clears throat> a great friend of people here in the in the um, um, community. And mm. we, we're going to miss you, Mary. Rest in peace, Mary. In case anyone didn't know, Mary Reed passed away December 7th. We just found out a few days ago. And we're very, very, very upset by this. Uh, and so is so, so many of our subscribers, and including um, Virginia and Ron TV Metro and Audi and Lena, who um, I just heard about. And yes, praying hands. And to anyone who's out there suffering or grieving or is feeling alone or any of that, listen, Anthony and I, we're here for you anytime. You wanna send us an email, always, always. And Ron, we love you to the moon and back. And all of you, Virginia, Audi, anyone, anyone out there, thank you so much for all your love and support. Everyone who wrote whatever you wrote and your thinking and you know any of that that you put in our um, post uh, for Mary. Um, me personally, I remember seeing that beautiful pink flower she had as her emoji. And when you think of Mary, you think of that pink flower and her encouragement to Ron on his shorts was just, that's how we knew her. That's how I knew her. And I always knew that if I didn't say something or Colleen, Colleen was always in there in Ron's but Mary was always the first one, the first one to get there the and encourage one. Ron to do what he does. And that is what Mary was all about. 
Mary was all about being a human being, a wonderful human being. Yes, rest in peace. We'll never forget you, Mary, ever. And so I just wanted to just say a little something for her and for you guys. It's okay to feel sad. It's okay to go through the emotions. That's what we are, humans. And she was an amazing, wonderful human. And, um, and that's it. You have anything? Just to say, like, yeah, you know, Mary was peace. not a frequent chatter. But she was for our channel, but she was a supporter of the channel. And I know she always had wonderful things to say. She, I always look when she made comments, there were always comments that were interesting welcome, or like fun. She was like a, a she That's was. That's right, HC, lifting York. others she up. She lived in mm. New York. She lived in New Jersey. Yep. She, she, she knew the area and she would tell you things that she remembered. She responded so well to the many of the things that we did. Oh, and I didn't that know that, Ron. Did. And so it was always nice to see comments from her. And I was like, we were all surprised and shocked to hear of her passing. Yes, And it very affected shocked. many people, as it always does in yes. the community. You could say you don't know You're someone, welcome, but you really do. She did you chat on another channel. She was like, very warm and friendly. Exactly, you don't have Our, to be We saw like, her on other channels. You don't as well. have to physically meet someone to have them and touch you. And she did watch the streams. And mm -hmm. to have them touch oh, you. Oh, Patrick has known her for years life. as well. I'm so sorry, Patrick. So sorry, Patrick. I'm so sorry for anyone out there that's feeling um, yeah. overwhelmed. Somebody doesn't have to be Love literally to you guys. like to live you guys. next door to you. Someone doesn't have no. to like shake hands no. with you. For you to have a feeling of warmth absolutely. towards them. And that is absolutely always Thank the case. Thank you, Alicia and Coastal. So, like, Thank you. you know, we, as as a community, the last video we come was together. And it is, it's, I'm sure she all was you very guys kind, though, and very, very us, our, kind. our wonderful community here, yes. all sending out their thoughts and their prayers and their support to uh the people around the a internet fellow that watcher, knew someone the lady else. Mm -hmm. very well mm -hmm. so like this you know rest in peace mary we uh we're gonna miss you we, we will we'll miss you we'll miss reading your comments yes and, and i'll miss thoughts. that wonderful and pink we'll miss flower. seeing that flower <laughs> so everybody that is exactly what we wanted to say just to get a little serious for a few seconds here for a few for a few minutes for all of our friends, because we're all friends here. Then that's stepping off to the side for a minute. Uh because she has she has to. She gets emotional. We all do get emotional. And I want everybody to know we feel for you. And anyone that ever needs to talk about anything, you know, we're here to and we're here to listen to you guys. We're all part of the community. The genius community, the YouTube community. I'm gonna take a minute while the net uh, is off to the side. Okay. I feel you. bad. I only made her a mod six months ago. Says Ron. That's all right. That that's that's all right, Ron. Ron. She. she that woman you. cared about you. Loved you. She loved you. Loved your channel. She was all about you, and moderator or any of that stuff was not the most important thing to her. You were the most important thing to her. Just like you are to us. Alright, so let's change gears. And now we're gonna switch gears so wildly. Alright. Almost you impossibly. You think you can do it? I think I can switch gears. Alright, I'm gonna start dying mm -hmm. now because Didn't you are gonna tell you a story about the laundry. I thought she was gonna dye some cloth, some cloth or dye. No, no. She was feeling ill. No, I'm fine. I'm fine. I don't know what she meant. She I was had, gonna start dying. I had to go to Munchkin. Blue Star. Hey, Wait, hold on. Let me show my. Thank you, Vivian. Thank you. That then that's gonna show Munchy. She's gonna show Munchy. Cause do you know how important Munchkin is to the net? See, Munchkin is I'm not. Munchkin is thousand not, points of life. Listen, Munchkin is not officially a support animal, but she's mommy's. She's my she's support mommy's uh, emotional them, support man. animal. Move Munchkin. No, move the thing towards me a little. Wait. Yeah, that's it. The other way. No, Anthony. No, Anthony. Munchkin, look. Look over here, stupid. Come here, look. Look, Munchie. Look, see. Show the people. Munchie. 
Oh, she's so good. She's so good. She's my support animal when I'm feeling a little bit. That's down a support munchie. Or a little upset by anything. All I gotta do is go to the munch and pet her. That's a and support then guess what munchkin. Happens? All I gotta do is pet the baby. And all I gotta do is pet her and give her a little kiss. And then is examining someone's teeth in the next room with her, <laughs> a magnifier. Is that Holla? No, that's 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 Heather. Heather! Uh, Heather, you always surprise Dr. me. Dr. Carl Cabrini's in the house. There's Hi, a doctor in the house. Look, How so doing, look, doc? isn't she cute? Look at her beautiful eyes. She's like the best thing ever. If you guys don't have a pet and you're wondering about getting one, get one. Get a no idea. It doesn't have to be a cat. It could be anything. Anyway, she's so good. This she's so cat good. is out of a mind. You know, if she I get mad or if I yell, if I raise my voice for whatever reason, she yells at the net. She goes. She Ow! comes. She comes running over and she wants me to hold her. It's like she knows that I'm supposed to hold her. I think it's behavior the net modification. Can't have a fight. We can't no. have a fight. We can't have a fight. Because she'll come right over she to comes me. Comes right over and goes. Ow. Like, uh, stop fighting. Like that? No. I don't want to hear any of that. No. You guys are the best. I wanted to say thank you for being here and supporting us always. If I have never said it or I haven't said it enough, you guys mean so much to us. And I, I just want to say thank you. I, just nothing else. I, I don't have any other words. Thank you. Just thank Ron you. Ron has a sofa that's his emotional support. Okay. <laughs> I like anyway, my couch see, too. I wish that it wasn't just this. I wish that we really were like, um, what's that show? Beam me up. What is it called again? Scotty, beam me Star up. Star Trek. Star Trek. I really wish we could just be deport, like what the heck is transported. Going on here? I want to. I want to get transported to the Philippines so I can give Ron a hug, you know, and then come back. <laughs> Like, or whatever, you know what I mean? So that we could spend some time together. If you see some like times like this, lights you know? in the corner of your yes, house, Yes, a room, pup would be, oh, dog And suddenly you. we appear, don't get scared shitless. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like your possessions to be destroyed? Get a cat. <laughs> That's correct. That is one of the main things that they're good at. What did Wild Bill say? Joe's laughing. Stop trying to see your uh, birthday gifts. <laughs> All right, anyway, all right, let's go on. I want to talk about to, something. Anthony's telling me the story yesterday. I literally, I was laughing. The so I is, hope I want you to that you could tell the story the same way. I because want it was you to hysterical. understand that at a certain point, the net's going to interrupt me. Better than the stupid shower. And it's not going to sound that funny because I know. the net right, will interrupt me and and decrease my But flow. you're going to forget. You're gonna She's going to decrease Choppy! my flow. Now, this is one. You want to know what here? it is? Is Chop Skull here? The Choppy! Choppy! Wait. Your chocolate. Skull. Your chocolate was good. Your Very good. Was delicious. You opened it up. It looks like some I'll show sort of you gold again. bar. Hold on, hold on. I'll show you again. Wait, we'll show you. We read the whole story inside. These are the guys. There's two of these in there. And then there's, they come in two packs. They come in two packs. And we ate it. It was delicious. We ate one pack. So good. We ate one All right, square. Good. One square. It was now, so this good. is one. They this love is your story. card. Too. The net can't interrupt except oh, with the Come on, ridiculous what am I going to do? Just do like this in the background? She can't interrupt except with the Should I clean? Should questions. I clean my teeth? Because this is a question. This is a story of which the net knows nothing. Because she doesn't know about do you these have to things. scare people when you Because she say comes that? from a universe where these things didn't exist. Yeah, we all but do. I You're the only one that's weird. Oh, no. I come Wait, from the I universe. Wait, can I show them our tree first? Here we go again. Wait, show I want to... There Look, you go. There's we... it is. Hold she's on. Gonna, she's Sidebar. Gonna, she's going to do Sidebar. it. Sidebar. Hold on. We did not devour Someone it, Someone was using some sort of, like, electronic device to jam our phone. We still have the tree, but we moved it a little. We moved the tree. Hold on, hold on. There's Munchkin. Look, you see her over there being naughty? Look at her. Munchkin. Those are Munchkin's toys. We took down a bunch Munchkins. of Christmas. We took down Christmas decorations today. Today we took it all down. Except for this. And and the and over there is the little the little uh, what do you call it? Hanger. The thing that the hangs. hanger where the where the wreath was hanging from on the wall. Anyway. That's still there. Anyway, that's still okay. good. No, it's six thousand. Look, it's better. Yeah, that's what I mean. They had something on before in this building that was interfering with us. Some sort of gizmo. Maybe it's the wait. Can I show them before you tell your story, <gasps> guys? And she's gonna hold show on, you. Hold something. on, hold on. Get close. And you ain't gonna tell believe this. them because I don't want them to hear our neighbor. Hold on. We we 
We live across the hall. That low they can't hear you. We live across the hall from someone. Dead. And it's one of these people. Did you ever live in a building, like those of you who lived in apartments, did you ever live in that apartment where you have the person like nearby who will suddenly just like put something out in the hall? And <laughs> Wild <you> Bill. <laughs> That's a good one, Wild Bill. <laughs> where suddenly... You can see Willy Wonka from there. Do you know how to play the Willy Wonka song on the piano? No, I don't. I wish no, we I don't. Did. But we wish we did. We wish that's we not did. the music that's sheet. A, that's just she a, does have the music. No, sheet, but that's though. not that's it. Not that's not it. That's a poster. That, that's a film. Hello, poster. you're interrupting yourself. Did you ever have like a neighbor who like takes something and they'll put it out in the hallway? And you don't know why it's there, and they never take it away for but days. But it's disgusting. And days and days. The net is oh no! Open you know the why it's there. The, yeah, it's there they're too lazy. because they're too lazy they're too to get lazy. rid of it. There's oh, this is thing disgusting. In the hall. Did anybody ever see? Hold on, hold There's on. A thing in the Did wall. you ever see the that episode of Everybody Loves Raymond where uh, she they come back? Everything that everybody no, loves because this Raymond. is just like it. Did you ever see that episode where they come back from vacation and the luggage is on the stairs? It's like a two yeah. side stair, stair and they're both and they're both passing it, and they won't take the go, take the laundry out of the luggage. It's there for weeks and weeks. Nobody takes they it away because they always there, think the so other one stinks. So when I say they, I mean husband and wife. Not the kids, of course. And no so one will touch anything. Nobody will take it away because they're thinking, well, you should have did it. Well, you should have did Jeremy it. Jeremy Nguyen thinks we should end live stream. Why? I do not believe we will. <laughs> All right. I don't anyway, know go why. Ahead. The suitcase. She's in the luggage. Right. Who, who said the that? The suitcase. Who said Alan. That? Alan, Alan do you remember the, that? No, it's the episode. Right. The I don't remember how it ends, but it's ridiculous. Yeah. They put the cheese in the luggage and they let it like stick. Well, this has been here since Christmas, the day after the Christmas. Two days after 26 Christmas. 26 or 27. This thing went out I the have door. to show you. If they open the door, the jig is up and I'm in trouble. This thing went the in the The jig hallway. is up. Two or three days I gotta after show Christmas. this to you, okay? Wait a minute. I'm and gonna go bring you. There. I want all of you to be quiet. Don't say anything, or we're gonna be in trouble. All right, here we go. It's, I'm gonna show you, and I'll be right back. Been in the hall since two or three days after Christmas. After Christmas. Now, what day are we on? January 7th. Yeah, January 7th. It's like two weeks. It's two weeks. It's been in the hallway. All right, here we and go. It I'm gonna has show not you. Moved. Oh, Ray put cheese in the soup base? Yeah, I don't he remember did. that. Diana Gonzalez. Hi, Diana. Doing? Oh, I, I can't Golden believe Globes. the Golden Globes were on tonight. I would have watched it. I'm an idiot. I didn't, I didn't know it was on. I didn't know it was on. In the soup base. All right, so, let me show so you. What do you call it? Yeah, be careful is right. The net's going to take you guys. She's gonna Hold take on. You. Don't say anything because I don't want them to hear. She's checking to see if the coast is clear. <gasps> Did you just snort? <laughs> Stop snorting. I got let's the go door out. open. Patrick says, let's go out in the hall. Let's go out in the hallway. Let's go out. Okay. You ready? Here we go. Hold on. Let me turn it around. All right. Now, don't make me laugh because as soon as I show you, if they come out of their apartment, I'm going to have to run them back in. Anthony, they saw your feet and legs. It's the stand. Did you see that, guys? Did you see that? What the hell, it's Katie the says. Stand. It's the stand with it's water the, and dirt in it from the it's tree. Still got the water in it. Can you it's believe still it? Got the the water. water in it. It's the Christmas They're too tree stand. Lazy. I hear the husband the in there. <laughs> It's still got the water in it. It's still got the Is water. Is that the most disgusting thing you would have seen in your life? I don't comprehend why it's there. <laughs> it's it's cold. 
You know brackish what I want to do? Water. Do you know what I want right. to do? Brackish. That's the word. Yeah, exactly. That's I'm worried about I'm bugs. You know what I want to do? I want to put a. Uh, I want to put one of these in there and see oh what happens. God, I want to put a circus peanut in it. What happens to a circus peanut? And float it and have them look at it. I want them to see. Jeez, I wonder Wait, how that got. I'm winding it to see the stand, says Frank. It, it, I mean. <laughs> Why is it all right to leave your garbage in a communal area? It's, it's not all right. Alicia, that's what we're trying to figure why is out. It there? We're trying to we're trying to we're figure, trying that to figure one it out. out. Why wouldn't you throw it away? We're trying to figure so it out. So you don't want it in your apartment, so you're leaving it for us to look at? Perhaps we should ask the angels. Joseph! <laughs> why is it out there? Yeah, exactly, <laughs> HC. And they're the ones with the kids. They're the ones with the kids. They're the ones with all the kids. They're the ones that are always fighting. And they're always fighting. They're trying to Yes, fight. Johnny. It's they're a tree holder. It's for it's a real tree. tree. It's a Christmas tree holder. It's, the, it's a tree You can't holder. even drop the, the water out it of it. You can't even. Cole said it. It has brackish water. They won't water do in anything, it. Alicia. <laughs> I should. I should complain. Sometimes their dog pees on the Put floor. Put a piece of Snickers in there. They'll think it's poop, says Alex. I wish I had one of those fun size have, Snickers. We do have some chocolate. Wait, we have this chocolate. Hold on. What? Believe it or not, we still have some Sheila chocolate left. Look, we, we have do. some. We Sheila have some gave Sheila us these, chocolate. the Lindors, which are delicious, by the way. I don't want to waste the Lindor on don't them. Don't waste the Lindor. If I had a Snickers, I would waste that, though. <laughs> Maybe they're saving it for what? Would it Next would say. year? Maybe they're saving the water, saving the water for next year. Yeah, you have no idea, HC. You have no idea with these people. You have no idea. That is the only Twin thing. Rolls that see that is the game. only thing I don't like about living in an apartment. I lived in a house my whole <laughs> like life. Goldfish and and when we got there. married, we lived in apartments in houses in the Bronx. This this here is my first apartment I've ever lived in, and I still can't get used New to it. New Year's lunch. <laughs> <laughs> you guys won't stop. No, I'm not wasting my Lindor. No freaking way. They're anyway, criminal. I can't stand it. Yeah, they are. <laughs> and that's why I can't stand. This is what I can't stand about. Let me tell you what my pet peeve is, just in case I never, ever said one it before. One time they had, one time they left their laundry out they there for like everything. five days. Yes, there are a couple of moiks. That's there another thing. They'll put their recycle out and they're going in and out. Nobody picks it up. I'm Nobody telling you, it it's just like the suitcase. It's just like the suitcase. It's the same laundry thing. laundry out there in a wagon One of my pet like peeves. Four days. Yeah, you're better off in a house. Exactly. Laundry. Alicia, the, my, my, my pet peeve, mostly I think of everything until something else comes along, is this. This is how I feel. You want to kill yourself. You want to do something harm yourself. You want to do. I don't want bugs to come in the hallway. Then they'll come to us and we are bug free. Is that them? My pet peeve is this. Whether you go to the store, whether, you go, whether you're in an apartment, wherever you are, my pet peeve is this. You do what you want to do in your life, but don't harm someone else. Maybe it's Mr. Treadwell knocking. <laughs> Johnny, I miss you. You're funny. Anyway, what I'm saying is, is that, do I care if you're hurt? Of course. I'm a good neighbor. I'm always there for anyone who needs me. This isn't about being a neighbor. Thank God it's still there. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why are you saying that? I don't understand. But my point is, is that don't hurt someone else. That you want to have hurt. a party? Who cares? You want to have a party? No, this is Queens. We're in Fresh Meadows, this Rick Kelly. This is not Kelly. the Upper West Side. This is side. not the Upper West Side. Listen, you want to have a party? Go ahead. Have fun. After I think the law is 10 o'clock, but I mean, after 11, 12 o'clock, Put the noise down. Lower it. There's other people. Not the you're, uh, you this listen. Is Central Queens. Listen, I, people may think <clears> I'm <throat> harsh, but I'm sorry, I'm not. I think it's. I think that you should be a little more concerned about where other people are. Like the point is, I don't know if I'm saying it right, but my pet peeve is like 
Don't harm other people. Don't affect other people, especially if it's a bad thing. Don't affect other people. You should keep that in your apartment if that's what you want to do, if you don't want to throw it away. Don't put it in the hallway so the rest of us have to deal with it. It's bullshit. That's true, Frank. Except in this place, the walls are made out of solid concrete. <laughs> I mean, I'm serious. I get angry. I get angry. Yes, boundaries. Exactly, Owen. And this makes me want to go in a house. This makes me want to have my these own walls, house. These walls so I don't have to deal with these people. These walls are made out of concrete and it does, of Chuck. steel. <laughs> They're like bomb shelter apartments. Yes, they do. It has nothing to do with their background. It has nothing to do with their background. They speak English. They're, they come do. on. I just can't. I can't. I can't take it. They use all the words. Like when you when you when you drop your garbage in the hallway, it always trails back You're being to that. Very apartment. unreasonable. I know. I am. So. Listen, listen. Yes, they're garbage. Exactly. They're like so. They'll like drop stuff. Like the guy just, the, the maintenance guy is great here. He mops the floor every week on every floor. He does the stairs. Like the minute after he mops it, you'll see candy wrappers or you'll see the dog peed coming out of the, um, the, uh, the elevator. And I'm like, it trails right back to their apartment and they don't even care. You could see where it goes. Yes, laziness, you might ridiculous. Be something. No. Anyway. Jeanette, there's a cheap loft in so just six million. Very affordable. Just six million. Yeah, it's one room. Munchkin can't even uh can't They need to be evicted. Oh, that's a little harsh. <laughs> but I know what you mean. I know what you mean. I mean if we added all the things together, yeah. All right, tell your story, because it's gonna be too late then. Too okay. too too close. I mean, but that too was close. You know I'm too close. Loud. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, go your too own close. way. Whatever you want. Because you need go space. Go your own way. You need space. You need space go for your all motion. You need sp I need and space for all my emotions. Oh my God, he just slipped me by. He wants me out. I need space for all right, emotions. Go, ahead. go ahead, do it. <laughs> go your own These way. are the kind of stories. Wait, see, look, go it's back on again. It's, ba it's back going like Maybe going it's that stupid again. thing that's in the hallway. It might be uh, emitting wait, wait. A, a high frequency wait. signal. I know that things clear. No, Get Andrea thing. Doria. She'll take Andrea care of it. Andrea Doria. She'll Andrea take Doria care of it. Andrea Doria will tell a story about that. Listen. Listen. She's a bitch. Beyonce. Okay, go ahead. And this woman. You're going to tell your story? I'm out of the picture. Because this is about something. I want to yes, talk about something. Yes, we can complain something. to someone in the... In the I want to talk about something. I think we'll do that tomorrow. Thanks for reminding me. It is Owen. I love that song. Go your own way. If you gone up on another lonely day, she's gonna another keep another lonely day. <laughs> and loaf is getting unhinged. I am, Kate Jack. All right, go ahead. Because let me I'm tell you, the is the, is the, the neck could be in the story. Oh, you could be near me. Go ahead. Look. Look, no, no, stop, 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 stop. You start and then I'll come in in a few minutes. Danetta's you need to concentrate. In. I said. need to concentrate. Now we got 95 people. Thank you so much for joining us. I want to say anyone that's in here, if you're not subscribed, subscribe because you might hear some stories Oh my like God, May Ace. That's the <laughs> worst. We have a, what happened to we May? We have a guy on the first floor. We call him Billy Joel, but thank God he only plays in a day. Billy Joel. He never he plays because he true. looks like Billy Joel, he but plays he plays the, the guitar. Electric guitar. And you can he's hear him fine. He practices. On the first floor. Oh. But he doesn't do it late at night. You come in the building, you hear music. We need a munchkin cam. That's a good yes, idea. Yes, we do. We I need like a munchkin idea. cam. Maybe oh. we should just put it on her and just put it on sometimes. Just have her walk no, around she's showing sleeping. what's going oh, that's on. That's a good idea. Coleslaw. I like that idea. Maybe we'll do that on a random Tuesday. Like for one hour. We'll just put it on munchkin sleeping and everybody can talk. I love that idea. Just set up the camera in front of her. I love that idea. Munchkin cam. All right, go ahead. Tell your story. It's taking too long. Anyway, I'm going to talk wait, about wait, wait, something. Wait, wait, one more thing. Danette, when you told me about Mary, I just got home from a dinner and an old flame who reminded me why I wanted to burn myself when we dated. Oh, my God. Ron. You know what's so weird, Ron? You were telling... Uh, everybody check out Ron TV Metro, please. He's a great guy. Um, but when Ron, when you were saying that you found out at night, and for us it was daytime, it was morning, and I forgot... And I was like, what does he mean night? And then I realized you're so far away, but I feel like you're so close, Ron. So I just wanted to tell you that. 
Anyway, go ahead. I feel closer to you now, Ron. So I, you know, just wanted to share that with you. Go ahead. Tell your story. I wanted to talk about something that Danette has no experience with. Because she was one of those fancy people. That's another possibility for <laughs> an emoji. Oh, fancy. Because we like fancy. to see. Fancy. Because sometimes when we might see something fancy, we might need a fancy emoji. Oh, fancy. Because you see, Danette grew up fancy. This is something her father would have said to her mother when they were dating back in the 50s, so six, early 60s. 60, 59. 1959, when they were dating. You grew up fancy in, like, houses. See, like, she grew up in a house. I'm going to do, like, I James right now. I grew up right in now. apartment buildings. Good. I grew up in apartment buildings. Not fancy. Not fancy. I grew up in apartment buildings. Like, we, we would have, like, a... We would... <laughs> Wrong side. We would have like uh, like tree stands out in the hall and things like that. It's not in the front of the camera. She doesn't even know how to play a joke. <laughs> James does that so good. Circus peanut. Go ahead. You have to go. She grew up in fancy houses, but I grew up in apartments. So we had one yeah, thing I didn't in know apartments. About this. I want to know how many people oh, remember apartment building clotheslines when you had like a multi That's multi what I said, Coleslaw. The munchkin emoji. He doesn't listen lines. to me. Clothes I can't believe you went guy. all this time without a munchkin. I told him. And Annette did not understand clotheslines. She didn't know what they. I guess she doesn't I did, know but not about like, clothes. Not lines. like from building. She to don't building. know like from building to building clothes. Yeah, lines. all you Harlemites. Like you and have to have a clothes line. Lines. All my life we had like clothes lines. So I it's had a dryer. Like the ultimate beginning of the sidebar. They had dryers. Dryers are fancy. They have like. <laughs> we didn't have that. We had we stuck a clothespin on things. We had clothespins, clothespins, guys. You always had clothespins. And when you were a kid, your mother had tons of clothespins. Here's a quick sidebar. When you were a kid, you had tons of clothespins. And you just like have the, like, like, this was your toys. Where you take a clothespin and you put the clip on each finger and you have long fingernails. Clothespins, like this. And you just go, ah. I had clothespins on my hand. That was it. I'd take a clothespin and put it there. My mother had a sack of clothespins. She had sacks and sacks of clothespins. I'm, East, I'm in East Harlem, Johnny A. That's the no, had uh, clothespins. Not Johnny you remember? Mm -hmm. You remember the clothespins? And like, I go back far enough that I remember when clothespins didn't have clips. They weren't the, the no. alligator ones. No, they were just they the just ones where you just jammed it down. Those. You yeah. knew about yeah, those? You're too. old enough to know no, about No, because that. in our house... Pin we, hands, yes. Holla. In our house... Pin hands. In our house, we had... We occasionally in the summertime, my mother would put the sheets she outside. Hang the sheets probably because it was from... Nice but that was at ground level. We didn't have ground level when First I was a kid. First one floor up. We didn't have ground level. There was no ground level <laughs> hanging of things. Clotheslines. But the most important part of doing a clothesline was hanging the clothesline. Which hanging the clothesline became like a ritual. And my mother's clotheslines, she would go, she would get clotheslines. I don't know what they were made out of. Human hair? I don't know what. But they broke constantly. So they'd always have to hang up new clotheslines. When I was a kid, there were many clotheslines. I begin with clothesline number one. When I was a little kid, we lived in Harlem. I lived on 116th Street. In back of the the apartment, the apartment went from the front to the back. It was one of those apartments. So when you walked in the front door, you were in the front of the apartment. You're you basically in the front of the building, and then you'd walk. And the kitchen was the back of the building, and there was a fire escape at the back of the building. On the fire escape was the clothesline. My mother would go out on the fire escape. She would climb out onto the fire escape and hang clothes. Wait, why was it on the fire escape? That's Not where it was. It was in the back. And the clothes were strung across an Hi, empty Wolfie. lot Have behind you? the brownstone. Behind the brownstone, going across Ew, to the building Wolfie. on the other street. 
So you're on 116th Street and all the way back on 115th Street and someone's backyard on 115th Street is the other end of the clothesline. And it was strung across an empty lot. My mother would climb out onto a fire escape and hang the clothes out. It always made that noise. Sorry, Anthony, bring mommy the clothespins. It would be like that. It was a bag of clothespins. My mother, back in those days, my mother was wiry. She would do backflips onto a, onto the onto the fire escape. And I loved the fire escape. We always wanted, like when I was a kid, back in those days, when I was a kid, I wanted to sleep on the fire escape. I had plans. I had diagrams. I was going to make a, I was going to put cardboard and sleep on the fire escape. I think I watched too many Abbott and Costello movies as a little kid. Sleep so I, on I the fire escape. I thought I could make escape. a hammock. Like if you put enough clothespins on a, on a. If you put enough clothespins on a blanket, oh you could sleep on the blanket and you could swing out over the chasm <laughs> like this. <laughs> you like lay in the hammock and your mother could like go like this and you'd be hanging over the empty lot. Because you never thought you were going to, you know, you, you, you're a little kid. You didn't think you could fall and kill yourself. <laughs> You it was like wild. a thousand weeds down there. I would never there. do that. I'd be scared. It was like one of those things, like, and if clothes yeah, fell down glass. there, if my clothes, <laughs> I did. If clothes fell down there, you know, every once in a while you'd lose a shirt in like a windstorm and it fell down there and that was it. You never saw the shirt again. You could never see the shirt again, ever again, as long as you live. <laughs> I haven't seen a shirt again as long as you live. A pair of pants fell down there. It's gone forever. You know, because the stray cats would come, would come and get it. The stray cats would come and get your shirt and your pants and drag it away. That was the other thing my mother did. The other reason you had a fire escape was occasionally you'd climb, you know, you'd like take like, like, like meatballs of brajol that was left over and you had to chuck it over the side of the fire escape down into the empty yard wrapped in tin foil. And then it would land in there, explode, and the cats would come flying in and what? start tearing apart meatballs and brajols. Oh, my and start, God. <laughs> and start eating it. Wait, she threw <laughs> meatballs, like, with her hand? She threw, like, meatballs. No, she wrapped it in tin foil and would, like, shot put it out of the window over the fire escape down into the empty lot. She would always overshoot the way the, where the where the uh, where the clothesline was because you had to go out on the fire escape and go shh. So like to get the oh clothesline to the other side, you really needed powerful arms. So they try like you know you'd like tie something to the thing. You'd tie something it to the rope, wicked twisty. and you'd have to go like this, like like tie it to a softball. I was a little kid. I don't remember what the hell they did. But all I know is that they went like this. They would go like this and they would have like, like, oh, you, like your mother would get he's like a guy up. from the building who had a huge arm like this big. And then like he'd throw it to the other side and, and it would land on the other fire escape. We'd have to go. Oh, ah, Wait a minute. You just throw ah, it? And then some guy would stand on the fire escape and try to catch it. What? It would try. And they catch it eventually. Okay, and, I have a question. And then screw it All into right, the side of the building. Why didn't you just like? Why didn't you just tie it on the old one and then pull it over? Because it always seemed like the rope broke. By the time they knew they needed a new one, the rope had broken. Well, so you were going with a brand new one, like for the first time. And they used to rust like this. It would be like this. You spilled this much water on it, well, it turned rained. rusty. It Every rained. time it rained, it was rusted, and you had to get a new bowl. Ball ball ball. Ball. <laughs> Tying me bowl emoji. <laughs> she would be. My mother had huge forearms from chucking me bowls. Oh my out god, Ronnie. <laughs> Right next to the window, a double side bar. Right next to the window was was this <laughs> shelf. We had a we Cloudy had like a pantry, a pantry next to the next to the window with the fire escape. This was in the kitchen. Wow, a pantry was 
was this door that slid up into the ceiling. It looked like a garage. It was a little mini garage. <laughs> they had huge forearms and biceps from throwing freaking weighted so what balls happens if they miss? across to the other, they would have to to the go other like building. This and bring it then up. they'd roll it back up again and try again. And they had to usually they try like six times. Oh my God. They'd have to throw this thing about 45 feet. They were trying to break the window in the old in the old house, like on It's a Wonderful Life. <laughs> And then someone would stand on the fire escape and catch it. Oh, my God. Nobody was afraid of shit in those days. They, they, they didn't they care. Stood They'd on stand it? on the fire escape and try to catch things from each other. They'd just throw it out the window. As I was saying, next to the window in the kitchen was this thing. It was an ancient dumbwaiter that didn't work anymore. So you used it as a pantry. It couldn't go up and down anymore. You could see where the pulleys were, but it didn't move. Wait a minute. Holly so said you it couldn't as a tie pulley. it to the old one. It wouldn't fit through the wheel. It wouldn't fit through no, the wheel. That's you, right. He remembered. No, he but knows. if you put it on the bottom part, like it's closed and just It had to be way. exactly measured to get it over to the other side. <laughs> this was the same building. No. No, this was in Harlem. No, not where they hoisted the couch. I'm going to get to the hoisting couch building in a few minutes. <laughs> It was in Harlem. This was when I was a little kid. So what happened was we, we had the thing with like, sometimes I'd hide in the, in the dumbwaiter in the closet as a little kid. I'd you? pull it, th I don't know, two or three, four, five, two. maybe like five years old. And I pulled the thing down and I'd like eat like peanut butter out of a can. So, because I'm so what ancient that peanut butter was in a can. Nobody ate peanut butter out it of a can. It was a can. We Stop. had canned peanut butter. Well, you poor, was it rationed? Butter. I don't get it. We had kennel rationed peanut butter. <laughs> we had rationed mm. peanut butter. Mm. You had to eat yeah. everything out of a can in those days. Yeah, you everything did what you had to can. do. It's true, you right? did what you had to do. You had to throw did you go peanut the butter in the dumb waiter. I was in the dumb waiter. From mother, I would you? hide from my mother because I was in there. And in there, I would draw my diagrams of how I was going to live out on the fire escape. <laughs> we had no air conditioning. It was hot in the summertime. I wanted to sleep out there and roll down the staircase on the fire escape. This, this is, is good, good living. living. I love it. Oh, my God. So that's how it was. Yeah, my mother would like, yeah, with the brajol and the meatballs and the sausages, oh she takes some because she knew she had to take care of the stray cats and dogs <laughs> and in the neighborhood. Was so she would like wrap it up in aluminum foil, walk to the window, and then chuck it through the window over the fire escape <laughs> down oh, into so the empty lot where it would explode. And then dogs and cats would just like, ah, 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 they tear apart the brajol oh right man. there in the backyard. Poor animals were starving. Keep in mind, we're like on the fourth floor. <laughs> Remember, you had to walk up those stairs. It was like a fourth floor rock. Marty still walks walk up, up the stairs. It was like a fourth, four story walk up. All right, so what happened? Did you finally get it on the other side? Eventually, you get it on the other side. You have to throw it about 14 times till it gets there. Oh, my God. Now, then we moved. I told Danette about this, and she didn't believe me. She didn't understand. We moved to the Bronx. <laughs> I would love to see those diagrams. Eventually, we moved to the Bronx. And I thought, see, we moved to the Bronx, and we, we moved on a block that was almost all private homes or two-family homes. Except for two buildings. Now, wait. Karen wants to know, is that the refrigerator out of the window? No. Now, this no, is the second No, I didn't get place. to that yet. Wait, this is now the... That was the first that place That was in my home. first place as a kid. This is home. the second place as then a young Then we moved to the teenager. Bronx. Now, I wasn't even a teenager yet. I was still a little kid. So, this is your as first As a move? little kid. I was a little kid. We moved from Harlem. I was still a little kid. We moved from Harlem to the Bronx. Okay. And we moved to a neighborhood that was all houses... Except for two small apartment buildings, set dead center of the of the block that I lived on. Two small apartment buildings, one here and one there, with an alleyway between. We gotta them. get a road trip and show them one day. There's an alleyway okay, between these two places. All right, because I know. It's and there's no back, no backyard in these houses. 
Now, <laughs> this is an alleyway. I'm <laughs> being dramatic. She's being because dramatic. Because of the thing in the hallway. She's being yeah. dramatic. There's an alleyway. So there's an alleyway, and that's where you went and threw your garbage out. Remember, garbage cans were oh, made yeah. out of metal. Yeah, you could no, rattle them. A cat would knock it over, and they'd, they'd crash and make... <laughs> What's that? Cats. What's that? Cats were constantly knocking over garbage cans or raccoons or whatever hungry. animals were out there. The streets were filled with animals. You filthy animal. <laughs> they had stray dogs in those days, too. Go ahead, Luna. <laughs> they had stray dogs in those days. Good. So they had the gar they had the alleyway with the garbage cans. And when my mother moved in, I think we lived on like the third floor. Now you may know this, that alleyway, our apartment had like, like w windows. All the apartments in that building basically had windows in them on the alleyway. And that's where your clothesline okay, went wait, out. Okay, wait, let me get this straight. Hold on. So it's house, 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 two small apartments, house, 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 house. And the two small apartments were separated by an alleyway. By an they alley. They weren't connected. You could walk between them. To get to the garbage yes. in the backyard. And one place okay. was, the place across the way from our apartment building was owned by a woman that my mother was friends with. And, and Danette knew famously the lady who was the landlady there was a woman who always wore a purple coat. We talked coat. about her before. In the dead of summer, she wore a purple coat. Down to her feet. Down to her feet. It was summertime, she wore a purple coat. All I know about her is that uh, is what her name is. I'm not going to say it, but she uh, rhymes with that person who was an explorer. <laughs> yes. was down to her feet. And she was uh, from Greece, oh, and yeah. she was oh, apparently the girl. She she so apparently the Onassis on. asked her to marry him before he met Jackie, when she was like seventeen years old or something. Although I don't know what and happened because when she got older, she was not a looker. She was not a looker as a much older woman. So <laughs> she owned one building, and this other lady owned this other building that we lived in. So. Every apartment had a window that went out into the alleyway because that's where you had to hang your, hang your, really uh, carry? hang your, what do you call? That's where you had to hang your clothesline. So you would have to arrange with your clothesline. So like the people in the other building would have to share a double clothesline with you. So on the day you did your laundry, your clothesline, you would fill up both clotheslines, even though only one belonged to you. And then when they when they would did their laundry, they would use your clothesline, and they would use their own clothesline. So you you always had two clotheslines because they weren't that long. <laughs> it was only like thirty five feet long, so you needed you needed two clotheslines. So you had the two clotheslines. So you'd have to stand. So this is what they did. They'd go like this. And they'd lean out the window. Oh, directly across from us lived a woman that my mother became friends with. A, a much younger uh, younger woman, a girl named Minnie. I would, that was her actual name. I don't know what her, what her real name was, but they called her Minnie. So she lived across the way. And she had, she had a cat. That's another story. I'm going to go with a sidebar for that in a minute. But so they had to string across their lines. And I remember when we moved in, I don't know what happened. When you move into a new apartment, they had cut the clotheslines. It was like they came along with, oh, with garden shears and sliced through the clotheslines. It's like how they cut so the phone, So you had to put, too. like, they cut, cut the phone wires. Why do they call them cut the phone? There's Myrna Bergen in the house. Yeah. Myrna. They cut the clotheslines. So you have to always put a new clothesline. So she had to get Minnie to help her get the clothesline. So these women, these like small women, Minnie was like, my mother had not yet shrunk, shrunk to thigh height by that time. She was still young. So she was only as high as my shoulder blade. So like, but, uh, and Minnie was shorter than her. So these little women, I'm a kid, and these women, like, they're hanging out of a window over an alleyway on the third floor, and they're swinging. They had to swing it. They had to go like this over and over again, swing it. Catch that. They're going like this. Catch the what? Catch the line. They're swinging the pulley. 
They had to swing the pulley and then they'd lean out the window and try to catch it. And they wouldn't catch it. And then their bodies would be hanging out over space. And then they'd swing it again and they'd each try to catch it and they wouldn't get it. <laughs> and like people would go, people are downstairs watching because it's like a spectator sport. What, what, they'd what stand downstairs and they, we'd like on the third floor. They'd stand downstairs and they'd look up while people are swinging lines, trying to catch clothes lines of bullies. And they'd go like, you try to fling it across and the other woman tries to grab it. Sounds dangerous, says Wicked Twisted. It kind of probably was. Sounds crazy. She's like going like this. My mother's catching it. They catch it. Eventually they catch it and then they have to screw the bully into the into the boards and they're going like that. That's not the place where, where the pool where the refrigerator goes out out off the porch. No, because it's in an alleyway. This is the alleyway. Then now now as quick sidebar, this is also the window my mother was gonna jump out of when her father passed away. This was the one where she had the one lady out the window. She was about to jump into the alleyway to go to the hospital and her neighbor is going like this. No, Jeannie, don't go that way. Go down the stairs. Don't, go that way. <laughs> don't jump out the window, walk down the stairs. Cause that needed to be explained. <laughs> that just needed to be explained. My, mo my mother, they, they needed to explain to her, probably don't jump out the window. Just walk down the stairs and go to the hospital. <laughs> This was the same window. And you would always see, like, you had your clothes, you hang your clothes out, and, like, on the other end would be the cat playing with the clothes. Because, by the way, in those days, everybody left their windows open, and their cats would be, like, standing out on ledges. I'd be walking through the living room when I was a little kid in this apartment building, and I could look across across the alleyway, and there'd be a cat staring at me. He wasn't in the window. He was on the ledge outside the window. They'd be leaping across from one window to another. They were climbing up the side of the building. And then they'd climb up the side of the building, go onto someone else's window. Nobody ever closed their windows. These people didn't close their windows. They had no screens. They just left their screens open. The cat would just walk out. I think the cat's name was Snowball. I don't know what this cat's name was. Snowflake? Snowy, white as snow. It was a fluffy white cat, and he was always sitting on the ledge of a building. I was like scared to death. <laughs> I was a little kid scared to death. No screens, absolutely. Chop Skull says no screens. That's right. When you kid had no screen, people didn't have any screens. Nobody wanted a screen. Uh, I don't want a screen. I would keep my cat from jumping out from jumping out of a building. <laughs> Had flies, we had all flies. The flies were everywhere. I remember one day my mother asked the lady across the way to, you can't do that in Oklahoma, too many mosquitoes. Well, let me tell you about that, uh, 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 Wicked Twisted. One day the lady across the way, my mother asked the, le the woman to babysit me. I was a little kid. She asked to babysit me. So she had me come. She, My mother left me at this woman's apartment while she had to go and do something. This is the woman directly across who shared the clothes lines with us. With the cats, the Bush cream, how you doing? Sounds like Honeymooners episodes. It is. So I'm like in the other place like that. And the room is filled with flies because they had no screens. The mosquitoes were everywhere. It's like they're buzzing around. There's dragonflies. It was like a swamp in there. That's how hot it was. And the woman's walking around in like like a bare feet, a pair of shorts, a t-shirt. Just it's, it's very hot, and they can't close the window. I saw the cat for the first time up close. I had never seen the cat. The horse flies. The horse flies. That's right. <laughs> uh, choppy. The horse flies. You ever see the? You know the ones where you can hear the buzzing in your ear. It sounds like a plane going overhead. Better than roaches. Uh, slapping them away from Man, my better face. Better than roaches. It's better than the roaches. <laughs> Did I lose your that's train another, of thought? That's another sidebar. Anyway, go ahead. Better than the roaches. Is that a Danette sidebar? 
Then, no, no, the other side. Well, you have sidebars with roaches. You have your More friend. Just you have the your friend Roach Motel Kelly. No, not even that. The one who uh, borrowed our typewriter. Oh my God! Did you tell that story? Never, no. She hasn't told that story. Well, That's a good story. Yeah, tell your story. The roaches are the epitome, says Chop Skull. They are the epitome. That's exactly. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like a plane buzzing overhead. The house was filled with horse flies, mosquitoes everywhere. The cat was going in and out of the window, walking from one way. You know how the cat got from one side of the room to the other? Went out the window, walked across the ledge, and came in another window in another room. What? It didn't go into the bedroom by walking to the other room. No, it would jump onto the window, jump onto the ledge, walk across the ledge to the other room, and jump into the be into the bedroom window. That's the way they lived. That's crazy. That was normal life. Can I come into the screen now? Then that can come into the screen. All right, she good. was putting stuff away. Now eventually, I was sitting here. Good. Eventually, we moved to the porch place mm -hmm. where we had the porch, and that was that was the best of all worlds because we had a really nice. Because if a shirt fell downstairs, down the porch or oh, the last place, the porch was the last place. Okay. And again, with the clothesline. The clothesline was from the wall on the porch, from the building on the porch, across to the other building on the mm -hmm. backyard, on the other side of the backyard. And the people who lived in that house across from us had like one of those overgrown backyards. You know the people that have the backyard mm -hmm. that looks like they haven't cu cut the grass since like, say, 1945? And like the, the the grass is as tall <laughs> as your eyeballs, and like so, like if something would fall, I don't know what was going on. That my mother's clotheslines would You're constantly hinge, break. Would constantly break. Like I said, I think they were the thickness of human hair. The clotheslines constantly. Maybe broke. she was buying the cheap and ones. And they were the, the cheap ones. Everyone, Austin she and Brent, she was a connoisseur of clotheslines. She was a connoisseur of clotheslines. She'd come in, she'd come in with clotheslines and she'd say, this is a really good clothesline this time. And eventually this they would time? snap and they'd fall down. They were all constantly falling good down. Good night, Joseph. And, good night, Joe. Good night. And they'd have to go coming. outside and they'd have to like go and get the clothes, you know, reel the clothes in from outside and on the street. Or I'd have to knock on the person. You'd have to walk. I'd have to walk around the block. Go to the other person's house. Knock on the door and say, Can I go get my clothes in your backyard? And they'd say, Okay, you can go in there. You'd have to hack your way through the weeds and pick your shirts and pants off of things. And then my mother would have to put up another clothesline. Bye, Joe. They would tie a rope onto it and try to pull the pulley up. That was one of the last times my mother ever put in a put in a new clothesline. She tied a they had tied a rope, and they had to like drill a hole and into the side of the window because they put new aluminum siding on their house across the way, and so they covered up where the holes were. So they had to drill another hole into there. So we had to they had to pull it up. They didn't have to swing it anymore. Or, or use the huge arms to throw it because it was too far away to, to throw it. They would they didn't have to swing it, but they used like ropes to pull it up to the window. And then they had to screw it in, but they, it was way up high and I wasn't tall enough. So we had to ask for some help from somebody. And we asked like, who could help us out? Like who could help us wow, out? Wow, that's really so good So we idea, asked the guy, huh? What, what did Hala say? A Hala guy I know used idea. to make a lasso with fishing line, put it on the dragonfly mm -hmm. leg, and fly it like a kite. <laughs> oh my God, that's wacky. Here, <laughs> something on the so, side of your mouth. It's probably chocolate. Good, it doesn't anything. matter. Good. Anyway, so we had to get some help. So this one time we had to get some help. And my mother said to me, I was a kid, I hadn't met the net yet. My mother said to me, go ask, go up the block and ask Angelo if he can help you. Angelo? Oh, ask no! Ask Angelo if he can help, it, help us out. Now, Angelo lives on the Because Angelo's right? handy. 
I don't know why my mother thought Angelo was He was, was shorter than, than her. He was shorter than her. He was shorter than me. <laughs> but I couldn't seem to do it. And she said, Angelo's Andy with his hands. Yeah. I was it? like, why is he Andy? I, I didn't understand why he was Andy. I was a teenager. I mean, I guess it must I have been really hard really to do. I didn't really care. All right. It was very hard to do. I couldn't. I was scared no, to I death mean, to hang out of the window oh, on the on the other person's house. I didn't want to hang out the window <laughs> and try to like screw the thing you in. Didn't die, you didn't want to die. I didn't want to die because it, actually it wasn't there. It was way up there. So I had to lean all the way out of the window and try to stretch up and screw it into this hole. All right, and all drill right. a hole and screw it in. You yeah. wanted to see, you want to see point. that. So I couldn't quite do it. She, she says, ask Angelo to help out. Ask Angelo. He can help you out. Angelo is skilled in this kind of thing. So I went down the block and I asked Angela, could you, could you help oh, me do that? Cool, and Angelo's first words to me on the matter were, Dinette knows who I'm talking about, by him, the way. Yeah. She met this guy. Did he look like he was handy with anything? No. He was the guy who used to talk about how he was such a fast runner. Did you, and you know why he was a fast runner? No. I explained the backyard Can that I was reiterate? overrun with weeds. No, let me reiterate what it looked like. So here's the back. They're on the top of the house. There's two floors. They live We're on, on the, the top. top. There's a ba there's a balcony, but the balcony's open. So when you're outside, and it's you're gigantic. outside. And you can't really lean over. It's scary as anything. It's not. It's scary it's as It's scary. Hell. It has like one little it's worse wooden than, thing. Yeah. It's worse than it's a like, freaking fire well, escape. Well, let me tell you. Because it's made, it looks like it's made out of paper mache. So what it was is there is no back. There's no back, which I say. Um, What is that called? And when you go out and you step there outside. Is there a point? Yes. What is there that is. called in the back when you when you anywhere when you step outside a, a, a balcony? Porch, a balcony. It's not really. a real balcony. What happened was they opened up the back of the house and the guy downstairs, um, Bella Lugosi, he built a porch inside. And so on top of that built makeshift porch was the was there. He lived up above my them. balcony. Their balcony, which is now the ceiling, and then you could just fall right over. They knocked the hole in the wall in the kitchen and turned to it build into a doorway. A ba to build a doorway, to build a longer part of the apartment, and on top of that was a concrete seal, like um, what is it called? Like a roof almost. Like it's a roof. But it doesn't really belong there. So then they put like this wooden thing around it. It was scary as shit. I would never go very close to it. Well, anyway. Oh, I'm sorry, Alan. Good night. Go to getting getting sleepy. Okay, good night, Alan. See you good next night, time. Alan. Thanks for See being here. Time. Appreciate it. Yes, it was very dangerous, Mer Myrna. Very, very, very dangerous. dangerous. Well, and not to code. That's right. This is the Bronx now. This is the Bronx. They There's didn't a lot have of any things codes. not to code, right? So there anyway, there was no code. The back of this house, there was a lot because there was nobody using downstairs. There was a lot, alright. And now, so that's the back of the house. Now the other block. Is another block on the other side, across from that, if you look out, is another house. But that house is the back of their house. So it's like, this is one house and this is the other, a block away. And the fronts are opposite ways. The backyards, of course, are facing each other. But they didn't so have any porches or balconies. So that's how far away it was. It was very far. They didn't have a balcony They just had on windows. They just had windows. windows. They didn't have any balconies. Now go ahead. We had the balcony, but you and had you were to get higher, it up. Weren't you? So like, yes. And I had to give like the point of like Angelo was the type of guy who would tell you like this, who would Ryan. explain to you why he was an incredibly fast runner by telling you this, that he always runs with his hands like this in front of him, in front I, of his head, LAD, so he can cut the you? wind. So this is a I man. He told me that he runs like this. Because that he believed that that sped him up. <laughs> like the, what did we call him? Uh, pizza man. Pizza he man. Used, he said it was like you. All you're doing is you're turning your body into the shape of a wedge, sort of like a slice. That's of pizza. not why I called him pizza man. We're on two his different. Head, his hair. No, because when he put his head down, pointy. you know, in the in the uh, like late. He 80s, had a pointy he had a, haircut. He went like that, like a point. Like to a point. And it looked it like, like it looked like a pizza. So wedge. it was like a pizza wedge. And it was. Thick and he and said high, he always like wearing this. like this with his head I was down. Fast. And he I was, was very through. fast. And it cut the wind in this fashion because that's what and made him. And did he fast. do it? 
Did he do you it? You know, like a wedge of pizza. So he went up there. Did he do it? So I believe he, he did. He went up there, but he, at first he said, I'm not sure I could do that because I can't really reach with this arm. As he went like this. That's a great idea, H.C. I had that a bad shoulder. I'm imagining Angelo looks like Joe Pesci. He kind of did, like a skinny Joe Pesci. <laughs> He always wore a pair of tight jeans. Chariots of Fire style. Yes. He always wore tight jeans. Yeah, that was gross, though. Where you could see... The guy was old. Where, where you would, like, Didn't you know, like... that. He had to wear his short-ass jeans. You know the front... No! Don't go there! Batman. <laughs> go you know the whole back situation hey, going on? He had the tight jeans. Come on! And, like, always had a leather jacket on, even oh, in the come summertime. come on. Holland's going to say something that's really inappropriate now. It was like Batchman. It was like that Batchagaloo. Larry! Larry! This was like Batchagaloo. <laughs> like a real yeah. <laughs> He's Yes, Jordash jeans. He wore Jordash. Or maybe they were Eve Saint Laurent. <laughs> Sweet dreams, Alan. I would like to Jordache. Jordache jeans. Oh or maybe they were those Sergio Valentinos or whatever. Bash Sergio Valentino. Owen's going to put man behind everything. Batch Batch man. Batchman. <laughs> oh, Batchman. That's funny. Owen. He was like this. So like, and he always had oh, a sorry, leather jacket Emily. on. I hate when you get migraines. I had one last night into this oh, morning. He always had a but jacket on. Sounds like everyone, everyone I grew up with. with. He never Hi, didn't Jay have a jacket on, a leather jacket on. Sergio Valente. Sergio Valente. A members only jacket. A members only jacket. He had a leather members only jacket. As if I remember correctly, he did this for us while he was wearing but the jacket. But he was very small and he very, was very old. very wiry. But he had that tight jacket. He had that tight, like... You know, he was trying to he was trying to do the Fonz look, and he the had Fonz. like the muscles. He had the out. muscles sticking out, but he had like the tight he had the shirt jacket and the tight, tight shirts, shirt. And, and he'd he be like, "So like what did he do? Did he do it? Tell me." He did do it. Eventually, he got the thing up there. He was good at it. It was great. He was good at it. So and why like didn't he, I she always just loved, ask him all she time. used to ask him after that. Eventually, we would try the thing where you tied the knots because <laughs> like the lines would break. But like it was always like leaning down, and then we'd have to retie it and get it tighter. Oh, I'm so sorry, Emily. This morning I had it right here in my behind. That was my eye. favorite part of doing oh. laundry. Did anyone ever hang I laundry can't out use on hang, or anything. hang it has laundry to on clothes lines in the winter time? And Put like you take my it. shirt, we take it, it and it mommy, go to the window. Put go where, pull wherever it hurts, hand. put some pressure on it. My mother Rub would go, mommy, go out there for mommy and pull in the, she'd call me mommy yeah, and pull herself mommy. Mommy, go out on the porch and go pull in the laundry for mommy. And mommy, I'd have to go out so, there some and it would dogs. be like, the snow, a bullet in the laundry, and like the Why things would freeze solid. Out in those she would put the clothes clots? bins on, and the laundry would freeze solid. You'd have to like take in like we take in the sheets Jeez, and like lean. So My shirt would come in, and I'd lean oh, it against Calvin the wall. Klein. That's right. I'd lean the shirt against the wall oh, for, yeah, it to, to, for it to, to defrost. Good. And we'd like come in with the sheets and you put the sheets in like you'd stack your sheets until you could pull them. See, for they me it's the other defrost. way around. I get sick of have to those soften. other medicines. They'd have to Don't soften take time before you could fold them. It's the only thing I can take, so that's you're, why I take it, but it's not really the best, uh, the best for headaches. I'm you know, you'd have your towels, you'd have to wait for the towels to soften. Before dry them you on the radiator somehow. You'd dry them on the radiator. Yeah, you'd defrost them on the radiator. I would take my shirt off off the clothesline and put it in the kitchen and let it defrost, lean it against the wall. <laughs> so I'd lean my shirt against the wall until it defrosted enough to short to fold it. That's basically how you did it. It was like that. There'd be icicles hanging from everything. The towels with it. You're absolutely right. Tylenol would be the very last thing to take. It's the only thing is I Tylenol can't. Don't work. I can't take any anti-inflammatory because I get a very bad stomach ache. So I can only take Tylenol. Don't don't take Tylenol. Don't take could, Tylenol. If you could take the Mylenol or ex Excedrin, extra strength, Marga. those are all better. You know what you have to use. Oh, you head remember on. that, Barbara? Apply directly to head. <laughs> head on. Apply directly to head.
head on. Head on. Applied directly to head. Myrna's father was like going or crossing the border, illegally buying head on for his headaches. Emily, did your it's headaches like, start with head on? Applied directly Anthony's, to head. When Anthony's story started. By his head. That's what you need for your head. Head on, applied directly to head. People are sticking bottles Anthony, to their head stop like this. Yelling. <laughs> He was. He was traveling across the border. She just said it. I He's didn't believe across him the border. until we looked bullshit. it up. And then there was a... Wait, let me look it up now. Remember I didn't believe you? She thought it was complete BS I until like, she found on, the commercial. Make sense. Then Head I was thinking maybe I should get it because I get headaches a lot too. I don't think they make it anymore. Maybe they do. <laughs> Don't use Tylenol. Head on. Hold on. Frank, baby. do you remember head on? Hold on, I have to look. Buffalo Bills won. That makes Sheila happy, I'm sure. Is Sheila there? Sheila. That was LAB who said that. Oh, she watches the Buffalo too? What is it called? Head on headache? Head on headache. <laughs> applied directly to head. Why do you remember that? It's because you apply directly to head. Oh and I said God. it and nobody believed me. Except Myrna. Myrna believed me. Myrna knows. Her, her father was heading down to the United States to buy illegal Apparently black they, market head they on. They sell it in Walmart. They, come on. They still sell that stuff. Yeah, maybe I should get it. They sell it at Amazon. So many drugs you could only get in the USA. There's got to be something on Myrna it. Said. Hold on. Come on, this. There it is! That's the... That's it! That is wacky. Applied directly to head. That's so wacky. Hold on. Head on. Applied directly to head. Head on. What? Look, it says head on. Annoying headache commercial. Annoying headache commercial. Annoying headache... Usually associated with the weather. Annoying headache commercial. That's what it's it called. Together? Hold on. Naproxen for years was illegal in Canada, Marta really? says. Really? Oh, wow. Can you watch the commercial? I don't see why Hold not. Hold on, it's I'm going to get it right headache now. Commercial. You guys want to see it? Oh, this looks like something that would be good when you have a headache. <laughs> she just showed me something that looks ridiculous. <laughs> 17 years ago. Hold on. Is this going to give us a, a, like a... 17 years ago, people. Hold on. Head on, apply directly to the forehead. Head on, apply directly to the forehead. Head on, available at Walgreens. Head on, apply directly to the forehead. Head on, apply directly to the forehead. Head on, available at Walgreens. Oh my Jesus Christ. Get rid of head on. Get rid of that. Arthritis pain, active on. Active on. Available at Walgreens. What do you think? Come of that? on. This is a classic that? throwback. Wait, here's a woman that's making fun of it. But I do have this terrible headache. Head on, apply directly to the forehead. Head on, apply directly to the forehead. Head on, apply directly to the forehead. Head on, apply directly Stop. to the forehead. I, I just I just did. I said head on, bitch. Apply directly. <laughs> Don't use thing anymore. <laughs> Apply it directly to your goddamn forehead. Look, you little white trash. You don't want me to play that? I'm not going to get in no, trouble. No, you might get a copy. Oh my face. God, HC said, oh no, a new emoji. A new emoji, maybe the head on emoji. Wait, wait a minute. Let me find out what's in it. I don't want to get just stricken from YouTube for that. For that gag. It was only I don't know a few seconds. Things. It was a few seconds, but it was getting long. What's in that? I don't even know, Carrie. All I know is you apply it directly to your forehead. So it's like Ben Gay for your head, Allah says. Exactly. That's what it is. It's Ben Gay for your head. <laughs> I, it's like I want to. I want to. I want to say directly to. That you. should be the new emoji. Head I on. I'm gonna hear that all day tomorrow. That's right. She's gonna hear that in her all head. All right. It has. Oh it my has god! What Cali is it? Cali bicarbonate, which is potassium bicarbonate. 
White, okay, let me just show you. What this the hell is she trying to This is say. what it is. <laughs> Active ingredient, white bryony. White bryony? Wait a minute, what did what she it say? say? Probably Potassium tiger's bichromate. Katarina, how are you? Cali bichromium. I can't say that. Chromicum. This. Brantley is Brionia dying alba. Laughing. White bryony. So apparently we don't know what's in it. What the hell is in this stuff? It's crazy, isn't it? Extra strength. Apply to your Instacart. Wait, Myrna's going to screenshot that. Myrna, take a look at the joke. If you go to um, if you go to uh, YouTube and look up uh, snake oil in a tube, look up head on and then put headache and you'll see that girl in like the princess outfit. They're making fun of it. Listen, literally the commercial on the thing, it's usually, it's called called Annoying Headache Commercial. Head on, apply directly to forehead. Wait, listen to what this says. While iris versicolor, white bryony, and potassium dichromate have been listed as its active ingredients, the ingredients are in such small dilutions that the product consists almost entirely of wax. That's according to a head on Wikipedia. So it's wax for your forehead. <laughs> what about that other thing? Active wax on, your on elbow. Wax, wax off. <laughs> what, how did you remember this thing? Wax. <laughs> Myrna says wax. And what's in Excedrin is adesinophenamine, uh, aspirin, and caffeine. It will wake a numb brain. That's right. Oh, my God. So it's a placebo, basically. Head on, apply directly to head. Wait a minute. It says here. The daily, she, Danette is reading something called the daily headache. <laughs> oh, it's having a daily headache. It's potentially dangerous from 2006. Guys, the daily headache. The, is the active the ingredient, listen to this. The active ingredient in head on, a roll on headache treatment, is potassium dichromate, which is used in developing photos and should not come into contact with skin. According to Larry My Newman, director of the Roosevelt Headache Institute in Manhattan, head on is an OTC product and subject to so much less regulation than prescription drugs. In fact, if I'm not sure if it's, if it's regulated at all. All right, don't get that, guys. Don't get don't that. Get some head on. Oh my god! First of all, what a there's, joke. A, there's a there's a Roosevelt Headache Institute in New York. <laughs> oh my god! Katarina Falcone, how you doing? How come I never saw the commercial? You tried BC oh my powder god. for headaches. That's old school. What's Have BC you tried powder? BC powder? No, I don't think so. I don't know what that is. Oh my God, the stuff that you develop photos with. I've had a daily headache for the past 42 years of marriage. Oh my God, Barbara. One at all. Oh, that's a headache. I'm afraid head, head on right, might not Bram. be powerful enough for that one. Oh my God, <laughs> you guys are killing me. Head on might not be able to help you with that, Barb. <laughs> Larry. Larry. Cancel your Amazon orders, says Cancel Carol. your Amazon order. <laughs> Oh my God. Everybody's ordering head on everywhere. Remember, use Did it I only, remember? apply directly to forehead and onto your photo negatives. <sighs> you were too young, Danette. She was too young to see that commercial. She never heard of it. I was like, wait a minute, you never heard of head on? <sighs> no. Um, Hala says that, but I've heard people put a compress to their head. To, uh, a compress to their head to relieve the headache. Maybe there's something to it. So I guess the point is to put some pressure. A TV remote, remote might help you with that, Barbara. Back into the left. Wait, potassium dichromate is also used to tan leather? Ants, you crazy person. Oh my God, to tan leather. You well, forgot your headache because your skin leather. is being eating off. 
Oh my god. My head get no the longer pains. hurts. Yeah. My god. The pressure is gone. <laughs> it is nasty, Myrna. Jeez. <laughs> what was that? I don't know. <laughs> Do you ever hear like random noises? You can't figure out. Oh where no, you're she from. feels like yeah. You got to go to sleep. Go to sleep. No noise. No no uh, lights. We have those things that you put in the freezer, the compressor. The Sometimes the yeah. Sometimes the best thing for me when I get a terrible terrible headache, besides laying down, is Anthony. Actually, he applies pressure wherever the pain is. I tell him to squeeze my she head. She tells me to crack her head like and a wall. Literally, it feels better. <laughs> Like sometimes you just got to get the right spot and apply pressure. It's like anything. She wants apply me pressure. to Uncle Festa her. Oh my like god! Like that we. <laughs> but whatever you do, when you see, well, even the doctor told me this. Whenever you get a headache or you begin to get one, I don't, know, don't try don't to ride it out. It either. Don't try to ride it out. Take something, but when it starts, so it doesn't turn into a migraine. Stop it right when it begins. If you if you have any migraine problems. If you're a person who gets migraines, as soon as you feel the headache, definitely. definitely. <laughs> hey, listen. So look, today's January seventh, right? Sunday. The tree stand is we're beginning gonna, to move. We're going to. It's um, day of the triffids. Vix two works. No, don't squeeze your head. Why? Is that bad? Ah, oh, Wolfie, thank you. So, um. We're gonna tell you what happened with what's in the in the hallway. We'll let you know when. I it's wish I had on. someone to squeeze my head. Says Frank, <laughs> my cloud. It's weird because it's been a few days and she gets so bad migraines. You know, you may want to go to a doctor for that and find out what it yes. is. Yes. Because once you find out what it is, you can stop. It could be salt. It could be anything. I don't even. Some people it. It could be salt. On it. it could be a medication. It could be anything. Takes the pressure of your bowling ball weight of your head off your shoulders. That's, right. That's why it's good to lay down too and to go to sleep. This thing weighs Sometimes like it could be you are just tired. Ball. Yeah, it is heavy. You can easily get a headache or a migraine from being over tired and not getting enough rest. That your could be a reason. loaded with stuff, loaded with information. Yeah, temples. For me, it's always behind the eyes most of the time. It's like pressure right here. Right behind the eyes. And if you apply pressure to it, you almost feel like you're stopping the pain. Apply directly to head. Yeah, get a blood test. See, if she's having it more than two to three days, you should re really get it checked. Yes. And it's not like to scare you or anything. There is medications over the counter. Yeah, it could just be like something they can fix easily. They'll do a test to see. They'll ask you questions. And, you, you know, I know some people get migraines from like having... Um, What's like cold cuts called, Aunt? Like too much salt? What is that oh, called? Oh, you mean um, like nitrates? Nitrates, yeah. Any high salt content nitrates MSG can, can give you a headache. Yeah. There's that neurologist exactly. That have, That's uh, exactly right, and they'll help. That you. have uh, sensitivities just to MSG. Go from one. Just go for one <clears throat> appointment and see if you have to do follow ups or stress. Yes, but stress also gets relieved by going to sleep and relaxing. You know, like your future mother-in-law, right, in it? That's right. Yeah, relief from stress Sometimes from high blood pressure, absolutely. It could be food. It could be your environment. COVID could, could cause a migraine COVID, too, okay, It could Jack. be a, a medicine. could be thyroid. You get You're soon. absolutely right, Levels Marna. of thyroid. Blood test Marna, first. Yes. Talk to a, a neurologist, and you'll get down to something. Larry. Head on could be an emoji. It's in there for me. You know, nitrates what makes bacon taste. Yeah, I don't like to eat a lot of bacon at all. Head on. I don't eat bacon. Oh, it's fancy. So for you. Oh, wait. Like when the bacon oil gets solid, when it gets <laughs> cold, it turns into solid. That's what sticks to your freaking arteries. Folks, bad wait, for you. I just you realized something. Folks, they may be make, there may be people in here. Or, Does anybody have their like gift getting... Like membership emojis turned Ooh, on. Oh, are you gonna give I them now? Yeah, but you also wait. All right, let's do that. Then we'll end. New month. Oh. We're gonna. I think I might. I'm gonna go inside for a minute and try to give you out some memberships. Oh, Would someone yeah. like to become like a oh, get like a do? quick membership? Can you do? Does anybody need a membership? I'm going to do five and then see, I'll if, do five see if you get five. Uh, you guys turn. Tell them how to in. turn it on so this way they are ready. When you see the thing that it come up, there will be three dots. You can't do it on your phone, I don't think. 
you have to do it on like a tablet or on like a like a desktop. But when you see it pop up that someone has given memberships, is it flashing? Not yet. No. So you gotta unplug it, plug it back in. Okay. And it's still not working. The best cure to a headache is by having someone stump on your foot. Your foot will hurt, but you will get... Oh, well, that's funny. No, then you'll have two pains. Is this the one that was low? No, Wait. right? Should I get the side one instead? Uh, give me a second, Why guys. Why is this not working? I don't know. Do it again. Maybe I didn't do it right. Me? Sodium nitrates, too. Yeah. Any, any kind of high sodium is good. It's not doing crap. See, this is what we were talking about the other day. The pore is not blinking. Yeah. Go All with the right, other wait, wire. Where's the other one? Oh, the other wire? Could be oh, in maybe there the too. wire. Oops, sorry guys. Holy smokes. Uh oh, what is... Who's yeah. who's dead? No, I don't know. Don't talk about sex. Where's the other one, Aunt? Oh, it's in here. Okay, I got it. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe it's that wire that's always bad. Hold on. Let me do it this one. Hold on, put that in there. See, that's much better already. I like the way, it, see it's on, red. it's not flashing without it. Do you see that? Mm, that's funny. Where's the other one? That's very odd. I'd love a membership, says Rick. Okay, so Anthony's gonna give out some membership. So, um, it's gotta be this. It's Where's the other one? Where's know. the other one plugged in? I don't know. The other one's in there. There's a third, there's a second one. Well, that's what I said. Let me get. It. Go ahead. Go do your five minutes. I don't know why this one ain't working. Anthony, do your five minutes. Yeah. Wait for the net to come back. Wait a minute. It's in where? You mean in the bag? In the bag. Well, it's not in the spot where the other one is. Is it? No. I'm putting in the power. Oh, okay. Let me try it. I don't know why it's going to work. try this one. Some plug that one and try No, we, we can never select. What you have to do you is, can't. is you have to um, just have it. There yeah, it goes. There it goes. Why is the saw with nothing in it? That's odd. I don't know. There's something. All funny. right. Anyway, no, we do not choose. We cannot choose who, who will get the free membership. It no. really is up to, I guess, YouTube. My lips are so bad. So all you have to do... Click on it to opt in. Yes, I think you have to press those three dots if it's on your phone. And just put, hmm. what is it called, Aunt? It's called and just like activate, opt, into, opt uh, into the uh, it's gift. like accepting gift memberships. If you haven't done it already. So just yes. do five and first. And you toggle it to accept membership. Toggle it to accept membership. But Aunt, only do five first. Yeah, that's what so I could see if people are getting it. Swimming with sharks will, will cure your uh, headache. That's right. <laughs> Hi, Armist. How are you? Salutations to you. How are you doing? You look at the membership gift, and I believe you click it on it. Click on it to opt in. No matter how many times we talk about it, Virginia, I always forget. She's saying where. Okay, so wait a minute. Where does she go? On the dots on where, Aunt? Like, be specific. There's dots on the side of the thing when I give the membership. Oh, when he gives the membership now, go to the, you're going to see, see five membership, a banner. Click on the dot and opt into it. Celebrating the best shenanigans on YouTube. Thank you, Myrna. Myrna, member for five months. Thank you so much, Myrna. Is that how long we've been doing this, I guess? Five months? Oops. All right, so he's going to now gift soon, okay? And then as soon as you see, it says like a green banner, just like Myrna's. It's going to say five gifts. There'll be three dots in the There'll upper right-hand right -hand corner. You're going to click on there, and you're going to say opt-in. The only contests I enter are for cash lotteries and free pizza. There it is. There it is. Gifted five to Net and Anthony memberships. How you doing watching trains go by? And there they are. Yay. Wicked Twisted, Emily and Brantley, Rick Kelly, Jackie M, and J Vibe 78. Okay, Anthony, don't do it yet. Because I want to give Southern Belle a chance. You guys, let me repeat it. You sure? I mean, wait a minute. 
HC, aren't you supposed to do it before? He's saying do it when he puts the get membership. Isn't there a way of doing it before that, though? I don't think so. Click on the sign. Yeah, that's what I said, Hala. He... Hala's right. I think you have to do it before you give it out. Thank you, watching trains go by. I love your name. Okay, wait. Spot the gift icon in the live chat. Click on the icon and select allow gifts. When a nifty announcement pops up after the streamer you're watching activates membership gifting. That sounds like what you just said, Anthony. Okay, let's read it again. Spot the gift icon in the live chat chat. Click on the icon and, a and then select allow gifts. When a nifty announcement pops up after the stream you are watching activates membership gifting. Okay, so you're right. After the box comes up, go to the right, click on the three dots and do what um, HC says, allow gifting, allow gifts. That's what it's called. Yes, like do it right now. Like right now before you put the thing out? Yeah. That's not what you said before, Anthony. You said after. Yeah, yeah, but it's too late now. They've already been given out. So click the thing to hit allow. Click the icon in the live chat. Okay, where in the live chat do you click it? That's, it's on that thing that says, the thing that says I gifted memberships. Yeah. Click the three dots and see what comes There up. are no three dots. There are when you hover the mouse over it. Oh, but not on the phone. If you're on the phone, it doesn't work? Oh, you can't have a phone. It has to be... It has to be on the Oh, that's the answer. So you have to be on the computer. Because, see, I see it, too. I see where he gifted. There's no dots because I'm on the phone. So you have to be on a computer. I'm sorry, guys. I didn't know that. All right, so you have to be on a computer. In the upper right-hand corner, when I hover the mouse over it... Oh, Frank, you're welcome. There's three little dots. Okay, so if you hover over the, say that again, Ant. Hover over that upper right hover the corner. over the right hand corner. There's three dots. Click on there and opt in to allow gift membership. And she thinks she did it. Okay, Southern Bell says she thinks she did it. All right, Katie says no. After he gifts it, will pop up. There, it, there is, but I don't know whether you're allowed the gift is like your your YouTube channel. Oh, okay. All right, so Anthony. Oh, wait, Emily and all the new members, click on the happy face to open the custom emojis. Oh, I love that, Myrna. Okay, so Anthony, go ahead and send the next five. Let's see who the next five contestants will be on the DNA show. And by the way, we, Danette and Anthony, started doing the moving emojis where we, there it is, five. Come on, who's the five? Who's the, there she is, Southern Belle, Katarina, KF, Carrie. Oh, me, oh, my. Oh, that's so wonderful. Wow. Look at all the new members. Oh, I love it. You guys, all 10 of you, congratulations. Hey, Dad. Oh, my God. Southern Belle Susan. Hey, He's Jerry. out of his mind. He's out of his mind. Woohoo! She got it. There you go. Look that's at all you wonderful new members. Me. Now we have to go live soon. I mean, members only. We're going to do a members only live again soon, okay? Maybe this week or next week. So watch out for the notification. We definitely Now you can put all your shortly. Larrys in there and all of that. Larry. Anyway, so once we were live and we were like, you know what, it? It was me. I was driving and I said, you know what? We're going to have rolling emojis. We're just going to keep on changing the emojis. We're going to do something somebody else, the other channels don't do. And that's what we do. This stinks. I hate this. Why do you hate it, Wild Bill? Did you, did you do what we said? Wild Bill, Larry, did you do what we said? You We're have to do it. Constantly. You should have turned it on. That's another thing. Just for anybody watching, if you want to know for other channels, it would have to be, you would be, a, a, what is it called? You would be um, like a contestant, not a contestant. What is it called? You would be, uh, what is it called? The word, I'm losing it. Like in order to be part of it, beside activating it, you also have to be someone who watches frequently. Yeah, so if you, you go frequent into, viewer. yeah, if you go into someone's live and you've only went there once or twice, 
Yeah, you, you can't. It be, won't you, work. You won't get the gift. But why, like Bill? Joe you're Schmo always you in here. Time. You're always in here. Watch so, him one time. You're very won't do welcome, it. Southern Belle. You're very welcome, guys. This was fun. I love. I wish we could give more out. Whoever's watching that watch it, the people that Jeanette, watch you can the receive most membership often. on the phone when you get a pop message. Several choose allow gifts. Says Ron. Okay. I'm just not sure. I'm not sure it works on an oh, iPhone. Oh, watching trains go by says, sorry, if you click on the green icon, not hover. You know, we need to find out. This is not I fair I just don't to know. our viewers to not know everything. Alter wait, wait. Spot the gift icon on the live chat. Click on the icon and select allow gifts. But where's the gift icon? I'm looking at the thing and I, I don't see it. I tried it myself when Alter I... Alternately, you can choose to allow gifts directly from the I chat when the notification appears. On a phone. Okay. It didn't work for me, so I just don't know. Back when, back in the day. Ooh, did you guys opt in? Who get the gift thing. membership? Oh, HC, you want to know who got them? Hold on, I'll tell you again. Hold on. So the first one was Wicked Twisted, Emily and Brantley, Rick Kelly, Jackie M, and J Vimes seventy eight. Who I I don't remember. I saw J earlier today. I oh, think, you did. Earlier okay. Tonight. All right, but apparently he watches us frequently. Yes, yes. Okay, it's and the then, person in there that watches often. Okay, and then the second one was uh, Southern Bell, the original, was the first one. Then Katerina Falcone, then KDF, then Carrie, then Carrie. and then Oh Me Oh My. I love it. 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 And and those are all the people it. that what? Yeah, it's only gonna go. It's gonna yes, go to the people Yes, if you're a member already, you you won't get it. Obviously, if you're a member already, you won't get it. You might get an extension or something like yeah, that. Yeah, if you were to cancel and you weren't a member, then you can get it again. Um, and these are freebies. I get ten a month, and there are used. How up does my it ten. work? It's only good for thirty days, right? If you want to stay a member, then you would have to pay. The minimum is a dollar ninety nine, and we do have a, a blast on the members we do only. Have a blast. But of course, you don't have to. We have continue like a good old time. time. We've got some things, and we may do another. We may do a members only coming up soon. Yes, we have to because I don't. I don't agree with not doing it. These people are watching us, and they're paying us, and they deserve a members only. What again with that? Screwing up that signal. No, it's okay. It and hasn't it's going affected up. the signal, so I think that that's false. Oh, for Android, it works for us non-fancy folks. Oh, okay. Non, uh, Androids are different from iPhones. Androids, I have see, an that's iPhone. the point I was making is that it depends on the I'm iPhones. sorry, Damon. Maybe iPhone, next time. You're always systems here. systems are different from Android systems. The one with the number five, click on it. Oh, she sees it now. If you're a member, you won't see it. Oh, that's why. I'm so stupid. I am a member, I, aren't yeah, I? We're not going to see it. I don't the have... The reason I I don't became, have a channel that's You're not, right, I could have signed that's in as Anthony. why. I could have signed in as Anthony. No, no, Anthony. no. I forgot because you should have put your you should have put your new laptop up. You would have saw it. The reason I forgot is because I am a member. I had to join in order to do the... Because um, when you do members only, you do YouTube. You don't do Prism. And you can't see... What is it? You can't see the chat. You can't what see was the it? members. You can't see the members. You can't see the chat. So I had to literally join so we could look down at the chat. You can't see it if you're not a member. Obviously, Danette I had to become actually, a member. The net is actually so a member of our channel. Just so I could see so this. So we could watch on that channel. Because this goes too fast on here. We only see two things at a time. Now, I know so she I have to could look down sign at the phone. in as me, but <clears> the, as, as us. Yes, double but phone. Exactly. The, she could sign in as us, but she didn't always want to do that. She, like she couldn't watch from a dis uh, something. There was some. No, reason. it doesn't come up as Danette and Anthony because Danette and Anthony aren't aren't members. That's right. Danette so and Anthony are not members. So I had to members. go in as Danette so and Danette be a member. Became a member. So you'll see as my Danette. stupid face with the other members. Yeah, Danette and Anthony I had to do members. it because so I want to see. Use the other phone to watch it. Yeah, like if you see other people. Members do, only doesn't include the creator. If you see uh, right, if you see other people doing members only. They're struggling with one phone, or if it's usually just one person, they don't have. Or they may have to open up another account and join themselves in order to see another phone. It's not easy. So, Wild Bill, slow down there. Come on, come on. This isn't. It's all right. Take it easy. Take it Bill. easy. We're, you know. Take it easy. <laughs> take Bill. it easy. 
What we is the next? Uh, we just, what is that we next to our name? Here. Oh my God, Southern Belle, that is a black and white cookie. That's because the black our, and white cookie. And, and when you see the cookie next to your name, that means you are a member, a member. of our members only. And the first, emo the first one is a the black and white cookie. Is the black and, and white then after that, is, after that, a different colored rainbow. Right, rainbow cookies, and eventually getting to a regular chocolate rainbow and a vanilla rainbow. Yes. And but that's after a while. So you'll see, like, like, like Myrna and HC Teacher, they've been there from from the beginning, for example. And so theirs is a blue. This it's is hard the blue to see, but cookie. it's a blue. It's it's the cake, like a rainbow cookie cake. They really sell it, and that's what it looks like. It's a blueberry flavor. I think the next one is the, the next pink. One is I the believe. Pink, or it might even. <clears throat> and or the then lemon. After that is the is the rainbow. All right, there's a lemon. Heather W has the lemon. You see the lemon. Heather's the lemon. Right, and so it's all rainbow cookies, really. And um, so what you can do is you can go into see Breezy's showing right there. She's showing that there's also an icon, an emoji of a black and white cookie and the rainbow cookie. But you're also going to see other things that represent our channel. Watching trains go by, I haven't had a black and white cookie in 20 what? years. And now I got a craving uh, and no way to get one. Where are you from? What state or where, what country? Where are you, where are you Tell me where you're right from. Now. Right. So anyway, so when you go in there, you'll see a Manhattan special. You'll see a blue car because usually Anthony tells stories when we go on road trips. There they are. There's a, a, a matzo ball soup, a momo bowl. With two happy momos. You'll see a pastina. Southern Bell You'll see a hot the dog rainbow cookies. Summer. What else is there? Let me see what else. Yeah, there's the cookie. Ron, there's the cookie. There's all the sayings like the genius squad. We're all geniuses. Ant loaf, because he sings like an ant loaf. And like meat loaf. <laughs> <laughs> what else? Oh, All right, then smokes, we have um, a moik. A the sidebar, because Anthony tells a lot of sidebars. There's a lot of sidebars. We were surprised that so many people like the 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 car. I'm the car. really a lot surprised of by like the, the car. car. But I think there it is, Ron. Thank you so much. There they all are. We have the Sanka Instant Coffee. There, that's what they're. And, these, the and these all go back to our to our channel. It's a personal thing that's happened or a conversation we've had on our channel or that we made a big joke about. The new recent one one is Larry because. We often make fun and joke about Heather oh, W. Oh, watching trains talked. is in Canada. Oh, Canada, wonderful. Myrna's asking where in Canada because she's in Montreal. She's also in Canada. Ontario. Yes, Canada, we just never end. We never end. We but anyway, um, what was I saying? We're still alive, Oh, Kiana. so Larry, Larry is, Larry from, is from a scene in, in Raging, Raging Bull, Bull where, um, where he tells... The, his wife, his then wife, she's cooking him a steak, and he tells her to, to stop cooking it because stop it's going to. Oh, gonna it's going to burn. It. It's going to overcook. It's a piece of charcoal. He Bring keeps complaining from the dining room, and she's cooking the steak, and she's getting mad because he's yelling Honey, at don't her. Don't burn the steak. Don't it burn. It. And he's its like, "You purpose. want the steak? You want the steak?" She keeps putting a fork into the steak. You want that? Here, here's your steak, and she throws it at him. Here's your, here's he your, here's the, your mashed potatoes. He takes the, the table, throws it up in the air. Yeah. Later and on, he says, story on, short, honey, let's be friends. No, you're too fast. I'm talking. Oh, no, I'm telling okay. the story. After he does that, the, the neighbor Larry starts yelling. All right, you tell the story. Good. Good. Should I? Yeah, because no. you keep interrupting me. See, I'm not the only one that interrupts. Go ahead. Come tell on, the rest honey, of the let's story. Let's be friends. <laughs> tell, the rest, tell the story about Larry. And I'm trying to get to Larry. Like, Shut up, you animals. Bring it over Larry. here. If you've Larry. ever seen the movie, this is a very famous it's a scene. And then the neighbors yelling at him, at, and the I know what I'm saying. Him is Robert De Niro, and he's hanging out the window, and he and then he does this whole scene about Larry. Jake, Larry, Larry get over here! Your mother's an animal. So we just, you know, so we just we always say because Heather started, it's hysterical. And then Anthony just made a Larry, Larry one. And I made a Larry. And then we have to do well, another one. Do another I believe one. we should do Munchkin. Because people have been asking since the beginning. I, d I know. The Canadian, Canadian Genius, Genius Squad affiliates. I love it. So we ever finish Anthony's story. Was it that the tight jean brother wearing kid put up the clothesline? He wasn't a kid. He was in his 60s. He was way older than me. <sighs> And we were in our twenty, our thirties, whatever. He late was 20s. just he did, late twenties, but he was no, 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 no. Wait. That that got that was 
You met him when you were older, when you met me. I was 20. But this was before I ever met you. I was a oh. teenager. Angel was still wearing tight jeans even when we got no older. No wonder I didn't get the Larry reference. I've never seen Raging Bull. Wow. Wow, you've never seen Raging That's right, Bull. Wild Bill. I will eat your dog for lunch. All right, we'll allow it. Let me show. Because that's from the movie. <laughs> I'll eat your dog for lunch, Yes, I Larry. want a munchkin I'm one. I'm going to kill so that dog. I'm going to eat him for lunch. <laughs> and where is Angelo now? Lunch. Yeah, where is Angelo? I think Angelo. I'm passed not away, sure. I think he passed away. Wait. I think he did. Is he the one that was it his wife or him? <clears throat> was Actually, was he the one that walked your mother down the aisle? No. Who was that? No. Walked my mother down the I'm aisle. I'm in our you know, aisle. When we got married. aisle when we got married. No, I'm Who was that? No, no. The guy that walked her in to the Woody Yeah, call. who was that? Wait a minute. No, no. That was... My mother had a friend. Oh, God. Here Wait we a go. Minute. Wait We're never a going to bed. I got to go to work minute. tomorrow. She's got to go to work. Let, let me tell you. Let me tell What was the end of the story? Yeah, exactly, Howard. The end exactly. of the story was Angel He did it. That's out. it. Next. He did it. As over here. You and want a noodle man? Noodle oh, man. Shit, I forgot funny. about that. Noodle man. Oh, my man. God. But this too, you know what it is? It's too detailed. He had like six noodles. How do you do that? How do I do it? I could just use the it. phrase noodle man. Eh, it's not Noodle insane. man. I could use. You could I do could it for the summer. in noodles. Oh, that's a good idea. I can spell it Man, work on doing more and we'll keep... See, in order okay, to get minute, more, you have to make minute. more of them and then turn them around. Neon noodles? Like we have a hot dog one. He died of strangulation on a cross line. <laughs> End of story. Yeah, people used to throw them some stuff. <laughs> yeah, you know what? We'll do more, Anthony. Work on more. And as the as the months go by, we'll have a, uh, you know, we'll have a heart for um, Valentine's. We'll have a, Listen. you know, we'll have a... Uh, St. Patrick's Day, all yes, that stuff. But all I the holidays. One right now. I okay. might the finalists are oof oof fancy. Um what was Oh the I other love ones? sense and sensibility. I love What was that. the other ones? I love uh, little right, women. like like uh Noodle Man. <laughs> oh, thank you, Ron. What's another we know. one? What's another one? We know, Ron. Ron. Always. Go ahead. Thank you, thank you. What would some of the other are too compelling. Your what stories get so finalists? long, they don't even know the end. What are some of the other finalists? No, what were you going to say? You were what telling something. Pickles. And a noodle. Uh, munchkin. Ooh, pickles. A noodle man. Fancy. That's one that could be in the future. Um, what was another one? What was another one? Someone mentioned something else. Mm. Now I can't remember it. Pickles anymore. emoji. No, mm. a clothesline. No, that's <laughs> silly. Oh, no, no, no. We were still trying to do the Chinese slipper, but it's Chinese so Chinese slipper hard. just doesn't show up. That was the first that's one I said. That's the problem with it. You know the what Chinese we have, slipper, Ronnie? I tried. We actually have a pair of glasses, but nobody knows about that anymore. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't really lose my glasses mm -hmm. anymore, probably. Yeah, because she has too many pairs. I have one in every freaking room. I have one on every table. Anyway, so buffering. High? Buffering, that that's right. Days. I forgot about that. <laughs> buffering. Is it buffering the now? Head no. on. Head on. That was the other one that someone suggested. Oh, that's right. You could get like head a on tube. applied directly to head. Nobody will understand what it no, means. No, one know what it means. That's for when we feel like we have a headache. I told Anthony. Oh, this was like, the thing. Danette went like that. What would you tell me? Never mind. Go ahead. Just everyone loves Danette Joey. Danette told me. Everybody, everyone loves Joey. The tree stand, Rick. Oh, Kelly we said. also have the one that's not on there now that we have is the almond horn. I mean, it's all about cookies, really. Yeah, I'm adorned. Let me tell you. Let me let me tell you over here. What did he say? A maple so, cookie for you yes. Canadian friends. Ooh, that's a good a idea. maple cookie for your Canadian friends. The maple cookie. Or maybe like maple syrup. Maple syrup. <laughs> oh, this was the thing. The net is... Who walked my mother down the aisle? Oh, Not I the forgot. aisle when yeah. she got married. No, the aisle our when aisle. we got married. Yeah, who was and that? And that was like, like, who is that? No, my mother had Why a friend. Why didn't she pick your, your, your cousin? My mother had a friend. Why didn't she pick your cousin? I don't know. Oh, he was in the wedding party. He was in the, wedding, was in the party. wedding party. All right. He was yeah. in the wedding party. Like, All right, who was that? Because I don't cares. remember. It's been so long and I don't it was even so remember. so long ago. My, mother, my, my wife forgot. Mrs. Butterworth. Mrs. Butterworth. Let's have Mrs. Butterworth. The remote. <laughs> the remote. Oh, my God. I told Anthony, if your cousin that ever watches this, we're in trouble. I told that him. That would be 
very, very. If your cousin ever watches this, we're in trouble. She wants to get together. Very a Dorian gag. emoji because Danette loves Dorian. That would be very. Let me tell you something. Joke. Don't yeah. tell Joseph this, guys. But I have to tell you, sidebar, that thing that I tasted the other day that he told us to get was so bad. I whispered in Anthony's ear. I don't know if you guys heard me. That I Do would you mean prefer the oyster? that the oyster. Burster? I would have preferred the Dorian over that oyster. There was something He's wrong with it. Oh, it was disgusting. <laughs> it was bad. It tasted oh, it like awful. an oyster that was taken out of the trash. Oh, you thought we were buffering. Oh, we're not buffering though, right? No, we're not. Oh, okay. I don't see any buffering. My diet has left the building. I love your name watching trains mm -hmm. go by. Go ahead, Anthony. Mm -hmm. What were you saying? What was his name? Remind me. My mother had a friend. And she had a friend with the classic name. Her uh, friend was named Cookie. Oh, yeah. She Who had was a friend the named Cookie. And her oh. husband, Charlie. That's right. It was Charlie. Charlie walked my mother in. Her husband was Charlie. Coincidentally, her, her, their daughter's boyfriend's name was Charlie from Charlie Brown. I mean, not Charlie Brown. It's the Beefsteak Charlie. He looked like a Beefsteak Charlie. Beefsteak Charlie, Charlie was her boyfriend. No, he was, his name wasn't Charlie. Think is mine. But Mernie, you know why the name was Cookie? Because in Harlem, when they you were Italian, names cookie, they were named chicky, Cookie, Chicky, Gigi, Cookie. I wonder Gigi, if they're still cookie, like that. Cookie, cookie, Bobo. What were the guys' names? <laughs> Goofy Gog. What was the guy's name? Gabagool. <laughs> Gabagool. What was the guy's names? Aunt. Gabagool. Oh, oh. Every every oh, guy strange. was named everybody everybody was named there was guys names a Everyone little fan emoji I'm always hot Junior Junior was a classic one I'm calling Junior on the phone which Junior Junior Joe or Junior B exactly Junior huh? Sam <laughs> and I'm gonna go get the paper get Bobo. the paper <laughs> Do you have anything that one. else? One time he was sick, right? Was it Charlie? Who was sick? Charlie. Charlie. He was, was sick and oh, what did she say? Charlie was terminally ill. He was Charlie terminally was, ill. And, and what did your mother was, say? My, my it was so dumb. It was it was dumb. She was surprised when he passed away because he, he what, what did he do normally? Well, he ate something and then he belched normally. <laughs> I was like, one time I drove Anthony I like, home. What does that mean? Hold on, hold and she on. She was shocked that he passed. His away mother was day. nuts. Let because me tell it how it is. Normally. You guys already know this, but I want to tell you. Normally. She was a nutcase. How case. could he have died? I don't know how you ever lived with her, but anyway. How could he have one died? One time he had a normal belt. Cookie after. and Chicky, see? H C said chicky. it. Cookies and chickies. Did you notice you guys everywhere. were the only ones at the restaurant? Wait, yes, I did. I told Anthony something he wrong was with this place. Nobody else there. Oh my God! There was nobody else there. Anyway, Jadrul, ja <laughs> Larry, Mo, and Jack. Wait, wait. Let me tell you something. Larry, one time Mo and Jack. when we were Mo. one time when we were dating, I drove Anthony home, right? And it was daytime. I think I had to go to work or whatever. It was morning or daytime, and and you know it was sunny out. And there was Anthony's mother next to the neighbor, who was a little boy. He was like ten or whatever, and she was holding the dog, and they were just sitting sitting on. <laughs> I know where this is going. They're uh, sitting on. Let me turn this off. I gotta. I really need to tell you this. <gasps> what the hell was that? My ring. Anyway, so they're sitting on a, on a bench next to the porch, right outside. We pull up in the car, double parked, right? And Anthony, we so listen, yeah. so listen. Wow, so I can hear you. you. You're not paying attention because you may I'm have to help. I'm me. paying attention. He's a momo. So listen. So he was. They're sitting on the porch, right? I mean, on the um, what is it called? What did I just say? What's that the called? Stoop? A, no, there's no stoop. They sat on and You live there. A bench. The bench. And they're sitting there, and she's holding the dog. They had a park bench in a front park of our bench house. next to the stoop, which was a small stoop. It wasn't like a, a big stoop. It was like an four, actual park like bench. Four. There were like four steps. Well, next to that was a little like yard with no grass. Tiny yard, a yard and there with was, no grass. yeah, and was underneath concrete. the window on the first floor was Painted a bench. Gray. So she was sitting there on the bench next to the 10 year old with the dog upside down. And I go, Anthony, do you see what's going on over here? Look at what's going on. Just look out your window and look at what's going on. Look at what your mother's doing. 
So this is what I'm watching. You ready, Logan? That's why I need the head you. The dog I need you down. to be the little boy, and I'll be I'm your the mother. little boy, guys. All right. I'm holding. I'm holding the dog. Here's the dog. Here's the dog. Here's the dog's tail. All right. Here's the tail. This is a terrible. Wait a minute. Do I have a stuffed animal? I do. Hold on. Hold on a minute. She's going to I'm illustrate what on. we saw when we pulled up in the car. So we pull up in a car. I feel like I'm watching, uh, watching the part of the movie where Harry met Sally and the couples all tell the story on camera, right? Wait, we're yeah, gonna use Bobo as his tail. Use, he doesn't have a tail. I know, but we're gonna do that. Like we we all know where the butt is, right? Okay, so we're gonna do it. That do we? Way. Do we? Really? Okay, so wait. So here's so here's the dog, right? Let's say this is the dog. Wait, it has to be this way. All right, you ready? So, here, let me be the kid. So here's like make believe there's a tail here, okay? So she goes like this. She's like sitting. They're just sitting. They don't even see us, right? They're sitting. This is what I say. I don't know where my butt is. <laughs> I don't know where mine is. <laughs> it's hard to see on the red. Okay, here's the head, right? Here's where the butt is, right? So here they are. They're just like you're, you're, you're Anthony, and I'm Jean. Because the kid's name was Anthony. Look straight kid's ahead. name was Anthony. Just look too. straight ahead. We're going to be an actor, all right? There's no laughing. You're laughing. You're holding it in. All right, you ready? This is what you see. She pulls the tail down from the dog like this. I mean, she pulls the tail down and sniffs its butt and then brings it to the kid to sniff the butt. <laughs> this is what we're watching. I go, Anthony, what is wrong with her? What is wrong with this woman? This is the same woman who tried to get a cat to answer to its name. Like, answer her. Like, she did this to Snowball. the cat. Snowball. 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 I was like, Jean, it's not going to answer you. It's said, a cat. It's not having any reaction. It's because it's a cat. And, and there they you don't are. Give a shit. And yeah, exactly, Carrie. Exactly. That's exactly right. Wow. <laughs> this was his mother. That was my mom. Wait, what? My saint. You mom. heard me? They're okay. sitting there, uh, yeah. like, just looking at nothing. They smell something. They're smelling each other. And then they go, the dog is up. Why is the dog upside down, first of all? Here, and then she, the she moves the tail and she's sticking the ass in her nose. And then she sticks it in they're his like nose. Like this. And then they're like, oh, well, don't know where it's coming don't from. Don't know where the smell is from. And there you go. I haven't figured out the origin of the smell. And then she says, so that's what happened to the pumpkin pie. I want a clown to eat my fruit with. Oh, my God. Who knows, Myrna? I don't know. <coughs> In beautiful Mount Airy Lodge. This is what they brought her back from no, Mount Airy Lodge. No, I told Lodge. you a hundred times it was not from Mount Airy Lodge. They got Jesus this in Manhattan. Christ, that's scaring the shit out of this me. This is today. a great doll. Look how long it's lasted. You're scaring away all the this, new look, channel members. I got members. this at like seven years old. Look at it. Oh Look at man, it. that must have been All a big day years. in her life back then. All <laughs> these years. Officially, this is like 50 years old, Aunt. This is 50 years old. Look at it. It's adorable. And it can stretch and kick and stretch. And kick and stretch. It's so soft, too. Come on. You want me to take out my oh Madame God. Alexander? No, don't take out Madame no Alexander. No fear, again. no fear. I wonder Look if she Madame did the Alexander's same thing with face. Anthony when she changed his diaper. Probably. Probably. There she was, was a lot in of that ass case. In the house. That is a scary clown. Why are people afraid of clowns? This is scary as That clown has a knife. The clown does have a knife. So, yes, my mother had a friend named Cookie. She had more than one friend named Cookie. I could use a cookie right now. She had more than one friend named Cookie. And she had a daughter named can Roseanne. We try, wait, can we try Vivian? Who looked exactly like Let's her. Let's try Vivian's other sweets. Hold on. My mother's friend Cookie had a daughter named Roseanne. Roseanne was... Uh, 
Can we try another? Can we try one of the cookies? Because it's been yes, hours now. Yes, we could try what. Is Vivian still with us? I think she is. Let's have a cookie. This one's amazing. Look at this. Milk speckle. Look at that. It's got all the fun speckles on it. Let's try this. My mother's friend thing. Cookie had a daughter named oh, Roseanne. Lance. Who my mother actually knew before she that. knew. No, she didn't know her before. Oh, I love this. It's it's, it's one really of these things. Chocolate. You know what happened in the Nets in, in my mother's world? Mm. You know what happened with my mother's world? My mother would often meet people. Mm, this is delicious. She would often meet people. Yeah. She'd befriend them. Yeah. Then discover they had a parent that was a friend of hers mm. when she was younger. Bits of Australia, Myrna. This came from Viv. It was a box that she sent us with all goodies in it, including this wonderful kangaroo. Kangaroo. Uh, <laughs> it had all I kinds of desserts. I immediately knew Danette didn't know what animal that was. Don't you love was. this? Look at this. I love it. From the from. Uh... Look here it is. It's a notepad from Merry... Australia. Danette and Anthony, Merry Christmas, bits of Australia. Isn't that nice? Look at that. And it's so nice. And, and I love this box. The box is nice. The goodies are nice. It's just amazing. I just What's love it. What's the How's it taste? Here's it. Now that's actually chocolate. Can we got some. Yeah, take a bite. We also got that same kind of chocolate in um, New Hampshire. Do you remember? Mm. Now this is called Dottie Byron Bay Cookies. Oh my God. I'm going to love it. This mm. was delicious. The ko koala. And that's chocolate. And then earlier, we in the beginning of the live, it is, isn't it, Owen? It really is. In the beginning of the live, we tried, we didn't try, we tried the beginning uh, stuff that came in. And now we're trying it at the end, too. They had Tam Tams. Those are delicious. I love them. Good, Aunt. You're telling me story. My mother would always meet people Ooh. that she would later on Look discover were relatives. when I opened it. Like with relatives of people she already knew. She was forever God. doing that. I don't know if that's a Harlem thing. Like you'd meet someone and then you'd discover that their relative or their parent was somebody that you already mm. knew for like 40 years. Mm. Oh, that's good. Hmm. It's called Dots. Wow, that's delicious. Holy smoke, that's really good. Oh, it's so good. Thank you so much, And this Viv. came all the way from Australia, and I it's I think fully we, delicious. I think we tried these things while she wasn't here. I don't know if she's here anymore. Mmm. Go ahead, what were you saying? Mmm. My mother was forever meeting people and befriending them. Delicious. And then discovering that they were relatives of someone that she already knew. Licorice called Aussie and it's pretty good. Wow. Yeah. My, my mother knew Cookie when she was a teenager. That's what Hollow said. Six years of separation. But then hadn't seen Cookie for a thousand years. It and is then scary. became friends with, met Cookie's daughter and was friends with her and then discovered that the daughter was Cookie's daughter. And then she was like, oh, I know you. We knew each other then. Yeah, yeah, we knew each other. All you have to do is say cookie and I want one. Yeah, you're right, Owen. It's like a neighborhood thing. But a lot of the people that lived in Harlem that were Italian moved to the Bronx for some reason. It was like the suburbs back then, right? Yeah. It was like the suburbs. That happened to your mother and um, and one of the girls in the wedding party, remember? Her name was Cookie, too. No, Chicky. That was Chicky, remember? That was a Chicky. I like this one, too. Mmm. And what about my father? Remember my father? Yeah. The next father, like, practically lived around the corner from where my mother grew up. What happened was, my father... This is so weird. Let me tell the story really quick. There's water if you want. So my mother, my father, my uncle, my uncle went on, was going on a date with this girl who's my aunt, right? 
while he was going on the date, she was a twin, my aunt's a twin. That's my mother's sister, right? They go on a date and they, need, right, and they need a double, she can't go alone. She has to go with her sister, which is my mother. She has to go on a double date. That's what they, that was the rule when they were dating. So my uncle, rules. my uncle needed another guy and he asked other people. He asked other people. They couldn't go. Listen, I can't go on the state. You got to help me out. And then he decided that the perfect person he thought would be my father. Long story short, they went on a double date. The first time meeting night, uh, each other. Good night, Patricia. And it turned out that, and they lived in the same neighborhood. They went to the same school, my uncle and my father. That's how they knew each other from Harlem. And it turned out that my aunt and my uncle got married and my mother and father got married from that double date. That's how they got married. And it turned out that their friend, someone else they went to school with, lived upstairs from Anthony's mother. From my and her, mother. And knew her. We found all of this and out his little years sister was later. friends with my mother for years. Right. They lived in the same building. Isn't that amazing? Like, and I can't, then that's I still the can't woman that I rented my tux from. Yes, because she owned... <laughs> She owns a... When they got married. She owns, she owns a, a bridal shop. She bridal shop. In the, in the Bronx. In the place. In the Bronx. So that's that. So that's that. These people, like, knew each other. My mother said to my father when she met him that first date that she was going to marry him. That's Well, she didn't tell him that. She told him that later. But that's what she did. She said she knew. Now, and one it, of the stories that was, like, interesting enough was his mysterious part about the... Like, Danette says, Thank there was you, a Myrna. girl in her wedding party. Yeah. There was a girl in Danette's wedding party. Her mother was named Chicky. Take care, Patricia. Also Chicky. Chickies and cookies. <laughs> but did they share the same clothesline? Now, that would be a small world. That would be an extra small oh, world. Powder blue. No, it was black. It was not powder blue. It was black. It was a black oh, tuxedo. Oh, hell no. We got married in November. Can you imagine Power Blue in November? Yes. So the girl in the Nets wedding party, her name, also a chicky. Is she like, The mother was chicky. She went like this. Her, her mother was a chicky. Not the girl in the party. So the chick that's what I said. Her, the, her mother was chicky. There okay. was a chicky involved. And then she said to my it's the, we described my mother, and this woman chicky said, like, Wait a minute. Oh, I know who she is. I know Jeannie. And like she's like, give me a break. Name. You know what? So she's telling me I knew the last name. She told me where they worked. They and went she to told school. Me about it. They went to school. The name of the school. She said they worked together yes. after they got out of high school. Yes. At the this particular business that they all worked all together. Harlem. All information. Every little thing. Where she lived. Her address. Your mother was everything. crazy. Yeah. Everything. She Your told us nuts. all these things. This woman Chicky said. And then my mother said, I have no idea who she is. My mother said, I have no idea who that is. I never heard of her. My grandmother she said told she my mother that my father was going to call her and marry her. Wow. Yeah, your mother denied it. Remember? My mother denied ever knowing this woman. And that woman swore up and down. She, she told me details that she wouldn't have she known. She told details. So she had a sister named this. Her father was named that. This one was named that. She, but she knows who your father is, Mom. She knows who your sister is, How do you Mom. explain she that? She knows who you think. How do you explain it? She goes, never heard of her. Didn't you work at the so-and-so? Yeah. Didn't you go Didn't to you that work? school? Didn't you go? Yeah. Yeah. Did you go there with Chicky? Exactly, Never Myrna. heard of her. By your mother. It was a cover-up. So it turns out that the woman didn't come to our wedding. It was a, her parent, the woman her, didn't come. her daughter and son-in-law, because both of them were in the wedding party, they didn't come to our wedding. So when, when we got married, they came to the church. So you know at the end of the church, you like kiss everybody goodbye after the... You know that thing where you're saying thing. so long? So I'll in the you video, later. you see the two of them like hugging? The, dude, there's raw footage. Oh my Not God. Not the finished video. Not with the you music. Know, the wedding yeah. video with all the music. In the raw footage... 
It's like behind the scenes. It's like Stanley Kubrick behind the scenes <laughs> at, 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 when he's making The Shining. In the raw footage, you can see my mother on the line, walking down the line, and there's this woman, this girl's mother, Chicky, and she's standing in the line, and the two of them lock eyes They're going like, like this. this. <laughs> This, they're going like this, literally in the bit. They go, and the woman goes, "You, you, me,", me. and she oh, goes, later. "Yeah, I know." My mother, I used to read my I mother's know. lips, going, "Later, yeah, I know, yeah, later, we'll <gasps> get together then, later." And then my mother stormed See, out. See, Marnie, like you were right, and and that's another thing. Till this day, Looking I don't know what the hell happened. Side. Like she's looking for the cops. We don't know what happened. We don't know. We have no way of knowing. I mean, that's like, those are those times when you wish you were a fly on the wall and you knew what happened. And I hate when you eat on camera. I could hear you chewing. Stop chewing. <laughs> Just swallow. Gulp. My lips are so dry, it's ridiculous. What's all this about? This I know it's killing, it's killing me. No, it's from being outside. If you think about it, we didn't have the internet or YouTube, but we did have clotheslines and showers. We did. Uh, and, and and you know what else, Hala? We have garages. Is Chicky still alive? I'm not sure. I wonder. I don't know. That's that was a long know. time ago. We don't talk to them But you know, Chicky's no last a long time. Cookie's still around. They had beef? I don't know. There's a million Chickies. Cookies still My around? mother knew at least four chickies from Harlem. It's so stupid that they're all called the same name. There were know four chickies and at least three cookies. How do you know who's talking about who? Cookie has a certain street. Cookie, like, how do you know? The cookie that was married to Charlie who walked my mother down the aisle. Now, oh, Charlie, Ron, thank you so much, Ron. We know you appreciate it. We appreciate you. I hope that you get some uh, rest and relief. Thanks and so much, Ron. You know how much we love you, of course. Thank you so much, Ron, for being here all this time. I know it's not easy. Okay, what were you saying? I was saying then of the cookie. The cook the chicky not chicky. The cookie that my mother knew, whose husband Charlie walked her down the aisle. Yeah. At our wedding. Yeah. Who who walked her in. Yeah. And his mother and his his and the guy the very the first guy. Time. His, No, that's a different Are wedding. I'm gonna get to that. Oh, you're going for lunch? Have to head off to get lunch. Have a wonderful lunch, Ron. A wonderful lunch, Ron. We love you. We'll see you Thank next you so time, okay? And of course, us. you can always reach out to us anytime, anytime, okay? Let me tell you, the, the, pe the people, the guy that walked down the aisle, Charlie, this is what it was. We had the DJ who did the announcements. Yeah. And no, what? Here, he, here she is, the mother of the groom, <laughs> Jeannie. With her escort, Charlie. And then he comes in and she's like dragging him behind her because. Happy New Year watching like, trains go by. See you next time. Thank Year. you for it's being here. We appreciate it. Go ahead. Thank you for being here. She's dragging him behind her because he's walking her in, but he looks like he's <laughs> like. I, I, he, he must have weighed all of like 45 pounds. It was just like Charlie. I, it was like oh, she had to hold him up. Escort Charlie. She was escorting him. He was wearing one of those shark skin suits. You know those suits that look like they're shining. The light hit it. The glare like blinded me from the. Do suit. you guys get a sense of the exaggeration? Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Now you know where the exaggeration comes from. His I think mother. His suit was made out everything of she foil. ever did was an exaggeration. And where do you think that comes from? What was made of metal? His suit, Charlie's suit. Oh, was it was shining. like a, it was like this color you know, blue. You know, it was, remember, it was this color, color blue, blue. But it was and it like was like shiny. iridescent. It was iridescent. It was shiny. and the light hit it. The light hit it, and it was like this. It was like I it was forgot about a that. Ball. Yeah, John was still alive because we're crazy. I just got back doing my security walk around the Rockwell <laughs> Automation. <laughs> automation. <laughs> Oh my God! The glare—it's hyper realistic. Hyper realistic reality. Oh, I like TV. that. That's, right. that's a nice. It's that's like a this. nice name. Ah. 
It was like the lights. It was shining off of his oh jacket. Oh, my God. Our wedding was nuts. His suit, he's walking oh in. God. And that's what the guy said. He said, Hey, Katie. The father. He's the, in a different. The she was Katie the F before. Jeannie she's in a different. Jeannie with her escort. Charlie. Charlie. And we was like, like, who's Charlie? <laughs> You know who Charlie was? This was Charlie. Let me tell you. <laughs> this was Charlie. Let me get Charlie. Then it's the Charlie. Wait, what do you mean? Her escort Charlie came this in. This was Charlie. Teenie <laughs> with her escort Charlie. She's not right. That is not. Let's Wait, this is Charlie. Hold on. She's she's got to get props, guys. She's got to get the props. Her escort Charlie. I gotta do the props. She's Let's got the props. Well, Let's see if it works. Work? I don't know. It's so see, silly. She's turning the lights. Yeah, that, that works. Hold on. Good. Announce Charlie. Teeny and her escort, Charlie. <laughs> That's what it looked like. No, it is the. And her escort, Charlie. Charlie. <laughs> Ooh. Her escort, Mirrorball. <laughs> oh, my God. I was on my iPad, now I'm in bed on the phone, says Katie Fernandez. Oh, shit. That was Charlie. Charlie was a, a disco ball. I have all my says, props. Charlie says, huh? <laughs> Different Charlie. <laughs> not that Charlie, not the cool Charlie. Her escort Charlie. Weddings are weird. You know, I was different. People thought I was weird back then. We got married in 1994 and they thought, what do you mean you're not going to cut? What do you mean you're not going to cut the cake and throw it in each other's faces? We did cut the cake, but we didn't do that. I we didn't, didn't like the throwing the dumb, throwing thing. the, throwing the guard or doing the guard or throwing the thing. I just like, I hated all that regular we stuff. I had to garter. be different. We didn't do the throwing. So the at the wedding, at the wedding, we, I told you we had dead flowers cause we got married mm -hmm. in November. But it was, but it was like summertime. It was so warm that day. It was like a freaky thing. And so the flowers came and half of them were dead. So we had to call them back to come and give us new ones. So they had given us the throw one. No, actually, they gave us the throw one, which is a small one. It's like this big. It's round. It's, it's no big deal. You throw it. They give it to you as part of the package, right? So because our dead bouquet was there, I had the actual one you throw and I had my actual dead bouquet. When I say dead, it wasn't good for the, you know, it was like, it was so warm and it was like the roses were turning brown because they made it hours before and it wasn't fresh anymore. So they literally had to give me some other girl's uh, bouquet and that's so what I used. So I had the extra bouquet, which was a big bouquet. So I, we were in front of St. Benedict's on the steps in the Bronx and I had two, two bouquets to throw, right? And I was like, all right, you know what? I don't want to do that usual crap in the in the catering hall. Let's just do it right here on the top of the steps. This is really what it means. It means like when you get married years ago, you would throw the bouquet and you would you throw your bouquet and then go off into the sunset. And I can't talk. Sure you could. You were too loud. Everything's too loud. It's too loud. I can't hear myself. You're right next to me. So anyway. So the, the thing is, is that you would throw it, right? And then you would go off into the sunset from years ago. So I thought, let me do it at the church. So I threw the one that, right, Anthony? I threw the yes. one that was the one that like died, but it was heavy because it was like, it was a cascade. It was big. So I threw it and my cut, it landed on the floor and my cousin kind of got the end of it. And she was really young. She was like 18 or whatever, right? Or 17, I don't know. So she caught yeah, they it. they fought with each other. And then I thought... each other over. No, they didn't. And then I thought, all right, well, I got this extra one, which is the one they gave me. Let me throw this too. It's like, you know, let me just get rid of it. So I'm on the top of the stairs. I turn around. I threw the big one first, which was very heavy. And then so I, I forgot and didn't realize that the second one is very light. It's very light. But it's I did the small. same swing. 
So when they did the, the same, same swing. swing, it went flying over the girls. It went past, past the girls, all the way past the crowd, to all the, the way end, to the back. All the way to the back, almost to where the street is. And it went so far back because when I threw it, it went flying. And my aunt, who's like been married, she's got grandchildren, she's older. She goes like this. It's like nobody realizes. They look. She goes like this and goes like this. Right to the side did of the body. Did a basket catch, like, like Willie Mays. She like, and caught it. She just went like this, and then opened it went, her hand and it And then she picked it up hand. like this and went, ah! And it was so amazing. Got it on video. That it was so amazing the way she caught it. I don't know why I'm telling the story, but anyway. Good. Okay, what well, you want to say something? That so and that was one of the things that we did. I made it happen at the church, not... So I'm glad you see, like, my mother and the chicky. Armis says he's been married four times. Seriously? Want pictures? Yeah, I know you guys always ask My mother for the... knew the many chickies and the many cookies. The ball to fall next New Year's Eve. That thing that you had is what they're talking about. Oh, that That's thing? That's the ball <laughs> for next New Year's oh, Eve. Oh, yeah, right? That's it's, a good idea. It's, it's, much like Charlie, it's encrusted with Swarovski <laughs> crystals. K Chad, yeah, yeah, right. Swarovski you want to see crystals. it in the real light? Hold on. Just like Charlie. Charlie was covered in Swarovski. 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 Oh my crystals. God, do you want to see my Swarovski? My Swarovski? Go next time. Does anybody want to see my Swarovski? Hey, Steph, hey, how Steph. are you? Steph is How are you doing? By the seashore. Breezy, we doing? have video? Uh, actually, yeah, we have, you know what it is? It was, oh my God, we got married in the early 90s, like I said. What is it called? What is it called? The VHS? I we forgot. Had the VHS. We had the VHS, you know, the big box that, yeah, and you know, it wasn't clear like box. it is now. It really isn't clear. <laughs> we had, but we also had the raw footage. Hours Only click and it tells you if you want a super chat or membership. Wait, I'm still looking. I'm still looking. I'm trying to see what I missed. Um, what can I say? I like the cookie dance. <laughs> um, oh, I missed. I like your new picture. I would love to see your wedding vi uh, video. Oh my god, I want to see it. Happy, happy New Year, Steph. Hi, Steph. Hello happy again, guys. Hi, Joe. <laughs> We're up to a, a ball. I have a, to, like, I have a Swazowski. How do you say it? Swarovski. Swarovski. Um, I have a lot Swarovski. of them. I mean, I don't have hundreds of them. I have a lot. Crystals. Next time we'll show my Swarovski. I can't even say Crystal it. collection. Crystal collection. That's going to be for next time. She does have a, a few. Do we have a VCR? No. But what Anthony <laughs> did is he had, that. he had the things that were important, like the home videos that we had and stuff. And converted I it into them to a, digital, C, uh, a DVD. DVDs. So we, we have a DVD Blu-ray yes, player. I do That's have what a Blu-ray player. That's what we have next on TV. Yeah. And I transferred all of those onto DVDs. Yes. Which was not a fast process, let me tell you. Oh, the ring looks great. With you mean my ring? freaking technology. Look how clean it is. And so, even as clean as this is, you guys wouldn't believe it. If I were to go on my, what is it called? An ocular or whatever, that thing my father had, and looked... You would see like smudges or maybe a little bit of kind of like, not dirt, but kind of like, it's not as clean. That's why they give you the brush. And it's like, this is hard to get into. So what's the did new emoji? Did you get emoji? it put we still onto a decided. DVD? So yes, yes, we did. We converted I it into it. a DVD. Yes, he did it. It was cheaper to buy the machine. You see, if you go into those little nooks and crannies, you have to get in there with the brush. Yeah, it was cheaper to um, buy a gizmo you can, that would do You can it. actually pay someone to do it, but they'll... You know, they'll charge an arm and a leg. I bought you can actually get the machine it. to do it if you have Bye, them. Frank. Bye, Frank. Is Frank leaving? I got to get going to see you guys later. Take care, McLeod. Joseph Love you. Taylor sleeps with the Hit the man. button, Frank. That's right. That, by the way, if anybody doesn't know, is from MST3K, Mystery Science Theater 3000. That's my homage. That's Anthony say, loves it. And so do button, I. Frank. So press the button, Frank. It's from, from that MST3K. TV show. MST3K. Which, by the way, has gone. Oh, you have a, a couple LAB. Oh, I'd love to show you. Has created yeah. a twenty-four hour YouTube stream. Oh my God! Sidebar, guys. Joseph Taylor sleeps with an Anthony doll. Schmutz. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you guys are killing me. Yeah. Uh, so. 
Good night, guys. I got to go to work tomorrow. First day back in the classroom. Wish I could stay longer. Thank you for the laughs. Oh, thank you for being here thank so long. Thank you for long. being here so We're gonna long. We're going to end it soon anyway. I don't know how much longer we could stay on. What time is it? It's after one, Anne. It's after one, we got it. Oh, my God. Yeah, MST 3000. We love it. And what were you saying? Tell them yes. in case they want to see it. There's a... There's, there's a Ever there's since New Year's, they MST did... Tell how it started. Uh, yeah, it started on New Year's Eve with a... Uh, like a marathon. With, with a marathon. Bye, Diana. But it's kind of morphed into a 24 hour a day thing. Enjoy your first like day back. Forever or something. They're, they're, they now have a 24 so hour a day. So, what happened was live stream after on their New Year's YouTube Day, they, they found that so many people were watching it that they've cha they've actually decided to make it into a, you know, you can, you could, you can watch it on YouTube now. And they'll just play whatever movie they want. And all the people, you know, the... Um, yes, Breezy. It's very exciting. 24 hours a day. Yeah. And now you could be involved in the chat, like making jokes. And you have to be a subscriber, though. That's what you, you have, have to, to sign in. You have to be a subscriber in. to talk in the chat. Maybe Anthony's mother needed those glasses to figure out if the dog's butt was clean instead of trying to smell it. Oh, my <laughs> God. That is ridiculous. She needs those fabulous glasses. Have a great that week, Frank. Has. Yes. I was I was that twenty four hour YouTube stream. I was excited. So you like MST three K too? And what are they playing now? They're playing what is that other one called after MST three? Oh, they were also playing um, like episodes from Rift Tracks. No, not just Rift Tracks. Cinematic yeah. Cinema Titanic. Cinematic Titanic. Titanic. And Every the, once in a while, you'll see MST Joel or Mike or or even Jonah, Jonah and Emily. Yeah, and Emily. It's so cool. We love that show. And Anthony loves the show. And yes. let's tell you, let me tell you a quick sidebar how we found it. One year, years and years and oh, years and sidebar. years ago, this is a fast one, just because it's fun. Yeah, we Joel, were still just yeah. like, uh, we, were we not weren't married, married yet. We were I think we married. went on our first vacation together. It was together. our first vacation. And we went as a to, couple. yes, and we went to, um, you see, you said something and now I forgot. We went to the Adirondacks. The Adirondacks. And I remember Anthony was taking a shower and I was just watching TV. I was changing the we channel. We were at Saranac Lake. Yes, Saranac staying Lake. Staying in the Wagon Wheel Motel. Yes. And I remember he was in the bathroom and I was watching TV and I was changing the channels. And I was the like, TV was the what size kind? of the screen on the I was phone. like, what do they have? You know how like when you go to a motel, you don't know what channels are on. You don't know what's going on. So I'm changing the channel and I see... This guy playing a guitar. And he's playing the guitar leaning against a he's leaning against a tree. And he's playing a guitar. And I'm and I'm, I'm hearing a voice. And I see these three like I see like a silhouette. And I see a silhouette like in a movie theater. And I'm like, okay, this looks interesting. What's this? The guy's playing the guitar very badly. And I hear La 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 la, like making they're making fun of the, fun of the guy singing the and playing movie. the guitar, and, there was and a, I'm said, laughing hysterical, and I'm screaming, I'm going, Anthony, get Anthony, out of the you show! Gotta you got to see, see this. this; it's hysterical. I've never seen the show. And Neither one it. of us had ever seen it, and then it went to commercial. It said Mystery Science Theater three three thousand. That was in the eighties. And we saw Joel. He was like a kid. And the old And I was channel. like, oh, my God, what is this called? And we would look for it from then on. We went home. We looked for it. We, Anthony has, we have CDs of it. We he have did DVDs not have a champagne it. bubble bath. No. In that hotel, Anthony, not in the way. Anthony, meal. Anthony, <laughs> tell them that you could buy. I bought for Christmas year after year all the videos. We have, we could just go to the shelf right now and play them. because we, we have, have a bunch of videos. Of I have a bunch of videos. And then of the original ones, at least. And like my favorite is, um, what's it called? With Paul, is it Paul Anka? Not Paul Anka. Paul, yeah, you know, Paul Anka. It was Paul Anka. Uh, what was the name? My, I haven't seen Girl's it. Town? Girl's Town my favorite. That's my because very favorite. Because Silva was a henchman. Anyway, I love that one. And I've loved it since 1988. Oh, you too? Yeah, see, we were dating. We weren't even yeah, married yet because we married in 94. So anyway, that's my little sidebar story. That's how we discovered it. We weren't in home. We're home. We were in Saranac Lake. They barely had an ice machine I don't even at the know. Wagon Wheel I don't Hotel. Uh, uh, a motel yeah, they had, one, they had one 
phone. It was a pay they phone, had a phone outside. You had to make a phone call. So when we arrived at the My motel, mother wanted to make sure we were safe. So I had to use the... Remember, there was no call. cell phones. My mother wanted me to call too. But like when I called <laughs> her, she said, good, you're alive. And hung up the phone. <laughs> so like her mother wanted her to call. And you had to go outside to use a Oh, it's phone. just... It's, you know it's what? It's the only phone. It's just making fun of... It's B-movies. I have to be honest. Some of the ones that they make fun of, I don't get. You shouldn't make fun of regular movies, in my opinion. I don't care for the new ones. Like you said, those new people, I personally don't like watching them. I don't think they're as good. I like watching every. So, but if you're seeing a movie that's bad and they're making fun of it, like these, we're talking about bad okay, movies. Okay, now the honeymoon Like not guys. even B movies. Like they're bad movies. Like, you know, like one minute the scene is, like it's supposed to be at night. They're doing the scene at night. And then, like, the next minute the scene, you see the sun shining, but it's nighttime. It doesn't make sense. Real bad, no budget, where no one got paid movies. It's so bad that they're even getting light just making fun of them, right? Some guy. Like, what's that guy's name? They've done movies about it. What's the, what's the guy's name that had, um, you know, who was the guy's name? That, uh, the producers that... Oh, like Ed Wood. Ed Wood. And, and he made Plan 9 from Plan Out of Space. Plan 9 from Out of Space, where you see the... Out of Bones. Space, they see, like, the spaceship with the string hanging, you know. He had those, like, the string bad, hanging from the Like, up bad gap. things, yeah. Things you know, like things that. Things like that. But at least Ed liked movies. Then there were other... We should do it on YouTube. Horrifyingly bad filmmakers, like Coleman Francis. Yes, Coleman, Coleman Francis. Coleman Francis was the... Was, the most horrible man who ever made a movie because he hated movies. He should have done Hated people it. that made movies, hated people that watched movies, thought you were all suckers. He Maybe wound this up is getting murdered dryer. eventually under mysterious circumstances. Steph, happy Coleman's New Year you. is not a nice guy. We were watching you the other day. I know I don't say hello, but a lot of times I'm like just watching and I, I don't have my, I don't have like my, chat up or anything and you're just so cool i love you check out everybody go check out steph sells stuff by the seashore she's so cool and she's she has like like you know when we go to like um city island to like uh to 239 play code call you know like 239 play like you have older stuff or like finds that you can get that you love well she does that she does like this she sells it and she'll show like i saw like you had like a purple um, look like an ashtray, but to me, it didn't really look like an ashtray, but maybe one cigarette and you were trying to show the purple. It just was so pretty. Yeah, that's you. <laughs> oh, take care, Marisol. Thank you for being take care, here. Marisol. Thank you so much for stopping. I can't believe us. we're still up either, Patrick. We did so many shenanigans. Oh, it was ridiculous. We are, Patrick, I can't believe we are either. Hi, Vic. Oh How God. are you we doing? Happy New Year, crazy Vic. crazy shenanigans. Happy New Year, Vic. But you can just How come hang doing? out. You don't have to buy anything. Exactly. Well, I watch you. I should say hello. I'm sorry if I don't. I just, we, sometimes it's very late and we're in bed and I just like, I just want to watch Steph. It's so calming and your chat is so cool. You have the nicest chat too. I mean, seriously, everybody's so nice there. I just love watching you. Um, Who's saying goodbye? Bye, Marisol. Bye, Marisol. All right, what do you think? You think we should end it? I think it's about time. I think yeah, it's about time. Yeah, I think time it is. We're going to get day. going. And I have to get to work tomorrow, too. And that's going to work. So later on today. <laughs> anyway, Viv, if you it's see so the, this fun. again, thank you so much you for your us again. We Australian really enjoyed the Australian snacks. Tweet, they were great. Great. And Danette loves her They notepad. are very She's nice. Really, it's really cool. I love it's everything. It's really cool. Thank you, Patrick. Well, guys, have a great week. Do not stress over anything. If nope. anything stresses you at all, walk away. Go away. Oh, that's great. Walk Thanks. away. Myrna just subbed to Steph. Oh, that's wonderful, Myrna. Thank you so much. Just to help each other. It's thank wonderful. You, thank Don't you. Don't forget to, to also, guys, if you can, um, also, uh, go ahead and sub to Ron. He's really having to a Ron hard time right now. And Ron, Ron TV like, Metro, please. Sub to Ron TV Metro. Because he's he, a good guy. He's a good guy. He's, he's one of he's, her friends. Yeah. The Hi, wizard. the wizard. The Look wizard at you. Good night, good night everyone. All. Thank you very much. Hope you're feeling wizard. okay, wizard. Hope you're doing well. Thank uh, you, Heather. Heather so, guys, if you're stressing you out, much. walk away. Take a breather. Take a minute. Don't let anyone get you down. Don't let anyone get you down. If anybody gets you down, just think of this face right here. Think of this face right here when he goes, ah! 
Just remember. think of that. Because we're going to be on again soon. And we'll see you on a, on a, a members only. If you're not a member, don't worry. We'll be on again soon after all. There'll, Barbara, be, there'll be other ones. Thank you. Thank you all for joining. Absolutely. Good night, everyone. Have a great night. And thank you for spending some time with us. Really, thank you so much. We love it. We can never, ever do any of this without you guys. You guys are where so, it's at. Yeah, and we love you all. And thank you, guys, and congratulations to who became it. members tonight. 100%. Be well, everyone. We exactly, it. Kiana. And Kiana, we love your book. Do you know that Sonia bought the book, one of your books, and is reading one at a time? She's reading, she Jay loves Wall, it. So we'll talk about moderators. that next time. Thank you, Steph. Love you guys, too. All right. Blue Star, great chat, guys. Night. Thanks. Good night. Oh, thanks, that black thanks. and white cookie looks good. Do you have anything else to say? All I got to say. Thank you, thank moderators. You, so you are the best. We, yes. Thank you, Virginia, Patrick, Ron, every one of you. Everyone, Steph, not Steph, I'm sorry. Myrna, I meant to say. And uh, who else, Aunt? Who else was in here Myrna, tonight? Myrna, Patrick, every, everybody was that was in with us today. George, of George, course. George, of course, yeah. All of our friends, all of our great moderators who are mm -hmm. always here to make everything great for us That's and for right. the rest of you guys. And thanks to all of our new members yes. for coming by. Thank you, Thanks Virginia. to all of our old members. Thanks for all of our subscribers. Thank you Thank to, you to everyone who's just watching and not just saying came anything. By to watch we see you because we see the numbers. We see the numbers. We right, know, you we know you're there. So thank you so much. We and appreciate we appreciate it. that. And thank you to my cousins who stopped in earlier. Well, I love the you to death. Who stopped I in love earlier. you so much. And we'll talk again another time. We'll talk again right? soon. What a great community here yeah, exactly patrick Absolutely. everyone is such great people here everyone is so good so good night Owen. take care everyone good night folks we will see you again real soon and until then as we like to <laughs> we say we didn't learn anything Holla. we did not learn we didn't learn you know what we thing. learned danette has a lot of props that's danette what we has learned. a lot of props <sighs> head on apply directly to head <laughs> wait We Wait, hold that. on. Cannonball! <laughs> cannonball! I like a cannonball. Oh my god, I'm losing it. Uh, All right, guys, good night. Bye, Carol. Oh, it's a wrecking ball, by the way. I don't That's know. So I'm saying cannonball. Anyway, thank you so <laughs> good night, much for Lisa. being with Take us. Care. We really appreciate it. Good night, Lisa. Good night, everybody. That and should thank be the you thumbnail. For coming. And as I always like to say, Danette, it's time to go. So press Bye, Capri. The, uh, Good night, press the button, Frank. Next time, Wild Bill. Everyone, thank you so much. I got to press the button, but first I got to find it. Right there. Bye, everyone. Push the button, Frank. Good night. Good night, friends.